Is this song in Kingsman 2? I don't even know if I saw the first one of that. But guys, welcome back in and a happy good Wednesday. Natty, Raging Fuchs, all of the mods are here. Welcome back in. During the days and too bad even. Wait, are you sick right now? I will probably need a new keyboard after finishing this. Wait, what are you talking about fever challenges? What game are you talking about? Urban, welcome back in. Sharpie, hello. Exoy, Maribel, welcome back in. Wolf Shadow, welcome back in. Your boy, Sean, DC. I see Zen is here, always on time. It's insane. DC, DC was here earlier when I was recording for YouTube. You always pop in and say hi. It's ridiculous. I swear you know exactly when I'm recording and I look over and I see your emotes and it just makes me crack up. But Axe, welcome back in. Biggie's here. Mr. Mojo, welcome back in. Wayward, welcome back in. Happy Wednesday. How are you guys doing? How has this week been for y'all? I also see Yuzu. Yuzu's back here. Axe, hello. DC with the hydrate. All right. I don't have my, my energy drink is downstairs and I forgot to grab it, but I'm going to see how this is. I'm starting to try to take like my BCAs and my protein and everything everything on time but oh. I just hate the taste of all supplements I've yet to find like one decent tasting supplement and if you guys have any recommendations let me know I'm new to watching the stream in Witcher 3 what is Gwen oh my gosh please let me answer this if you don't know what Gwent is it is essentially the quintessential essence of what Witcher really is. I don't think you need to do any quests. I don't think you need to look any further. All you gotta know is Gwent is the most fun you'll ever have in a game. And also Kingdom. <laughs> that was not bad. All right, I will take it. Gwent is the Witcher. Everything else is just extra. It's all just window dressing. All right, Gwent is the main thing. Um, Retro, what's up? Welcome in. Vintage, welcome back into it. Devow is here. Joel's. DC, Vintage again, Sharpie, and also y'all. I don't know why that is so large. Hold on, I was messing with all the alerts. I think I was messing with things. Hopefully that looks a little bit better. But Purple Iron, thank you so much for the reset for nine months in a row. Welcome back in. Anon already popping off. Retro, I hope you enjoy the sub. Victor as well, or Victor, sorry. And Shadow Knight, three months already. I'm just glad that you finally unlocked your your uh, account to be able to type on Twitch. But thank you so much for the continual support and welcome back in. And what is happening? Purple iron, orange, orange with 30. I feel like it was just 12 months. That's crazy. Orange, thank you so much for the 34 months of continual support and welcome back in. Holy cow. Thank you so much. It does not feel like it's been that long. Aquina, we, and also Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub as well to Purpose. And Aquina with the nine months as well. One step further from the first month, one step closer to one year. Very true. Very true. What are we, three weeks, three, three weeks, three months away from an entire year. Aquina, thank you so much for the continual support as well. London's here. London, welcome back in. Glide Path, welcome back in. I used to do Extend for that time, for a time. You had more of a extend. crack than a crack. Shot. Falky's in here too. <laughs> Falky, welcome back in. Um, Bro Gamer, welcome back in too. I can't even count to 34 without breaking down and wanting to play Gwent. That sounds about right. Guys, we are, what, 20, 48 hours? I think it's been 48 hours since the last time I played Gwent. I don't know why my earbuds do not want to stay in today. And I just feel out of it. I don't know what's going on. I think I'm also emotionally drained from Life is Strange. If you guys are watching that on YouTube, I got to the really good part and now I don't want to put it down. But yes, that is happening. I'm trying to think what else. What I didn't watch the episode. I know you guys are going to ask me about it. I still haven't watched the episode as well. And holy beans. Yes, chink. Y'all, this, I don't know what's going on, but it has been absolutely bananas. We hit 30K followers here. 30K. That is insane. Like I have been doing this for almost five years and that just feels absolutely unreal. So thank you guys for the continual support and, and just welcome back in. I also see Benja. Benja, welcome back in. Glide Path, Victor, again, I hope you enjoyed the emotes. It's, it just doesn't feel real. The past couple months have genuinely felt like a blur. Um, and I really can't put it any other way. Yeah. <laughs> Glad you stuck with Life is Strange. First few episodes are a little so. That's exactly how I felt. But I think after the second episode, it all just gets better from there. The end of the second episode, you're like, I'm stuck. I have to finish this. Exactly. My Life is Strange didn't turn tragic, right? You just have to watch and find out. You... 
you're, you think I'm gonna tell you that? <laughs> Scarlet Fox, welcome back in. Is that who I think it is? And also Average Flynn. Flynn, it's been nine months too. Flynn, thank you so much for the continual support for nine months in a row. Fallout New Vegas, right? Nine months ago, Fallout New Vegas. Or no, 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 no. Was it, was it God of War? I want to say it was God of War, maybe. Maybe it was God of War. Average Bo, thank you so much for the continual support for 22 months in a row as well. It was RDR2. Oh, okay, okay. It was RDR2. I just feel, but you were ha super active in fallout new vegas if i'm not mistaken now i think i'm i'm falling behind anon thank you so much for all the gifted subs as well and also did i see siva siva with the 18 months i'm here for the card game immersion all right ask and you shall receive i am here to give you guys the top gwent uh playthrough okay <laughs> it's how fast can we beat every single character in gwent <gasps> is that already a challenge that's been completed have people already done that hold on Anon, thank you so much. Gamer Jordan, welcome back in. Falky, again, welcome back in. Shadow Knight, I'm so glad you're able to type now. Benja, always out thinking about the scene in Kingsman 2. So I need to watch Kingsman. Maybe we should add that to our movie nights. If you guys aren't tracking, I know I keep saying this at the start of streams, but this Friday is going to be Monty Python and the Holy Grail in the Discord channel. So if you're not there, definitely hop in for that. And then we're doing that movie night. And then next month is Princess Bride. So I'm really excited for those movie nights. I haven't picked out March, but I was kind of leaning towards, we talked about Scott Pilgrim, but maybe we could do a Kingsman because I've heard a lot of people say really good things about it. And also Anon, thank you so much for another gifted sub to falling behind. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go. I'm scrolling. I see Kingdom again. Wolf Shadow, welcome back in. Exoit's here too. Exoit, welcome back in. Crack Daddy, thank you again for two whole years. That two years ago, what was I doing two years ago? It wasn't Red Dead. It was a it was a January before last. What was I playing two years ago? Stream. We Mako, what's up? Welcome back in. Scott Pilgrim is one of the best films. It is pretty good. I think it would be really fun to do it again. And Scotty, thank you for the posture check. I know. I feel like I'm sitting like an absolute gremlin. I think Ginger's actually going to come out today because earlier I was playing grounded and she was actively not leaving me alone. Like she was sitting right next to me the entire time. All right. My posture check is all the way back here. This is so bad. <laughs> Wolf, welcome back in. That's two times. I honestly will say it probably three more times before I'm caught up as well. Maribel, again, welcome back in. EK, thanks for the follow. And Flynn, thank you so much for the 500 bits as well. Have you seen Jojo Rabbit? That film made me tear up a little bit. No, I haven't. What is it about? I've never even heard of it. I'm trying to remember what you played two years ago, and I don't even know what I played last week. <laughs> That's pretty much still me. I think that I everybody's always like, oh, what are your plans for the year? What are your goals for the year? I don't know what I'm having for breakfast tomorrow. It's honestly shaky. It's either between a donut or a bagel. Either way, it's going to be carbs. I just can't tell you exactly what it's going to be. Uh, KR and also Kiro. Guys, I hope y'all enjoy the sub and the emotes and welcome in. And Anon, thank you so much for two more gifted subs. You know, this is a crime. No, wait, maybe I have had it. Maybe, have I had Taco Bell breakfast before? I feel like if you can't remember, then it's either that unmemorable or maybe I haven't had it. I feel like I haven't had it. I feel like I'd remember. Oh, I have heard about this. Who was the famous, who were the famous actors in Jojo Rabbit? That's right. That's right. That's right. I do faintly remember this. And Stoic, Stoic, thank you so much for the thousand bits and welcome back in. Thank you. Steven Merchant, I'm not sure. I, who's the female? Isn't there a main female actress? Scarlett Johansson. Yes, it was Scarlett Johansson. That's right. Taika? Taika? Is it Taika? See, I'm so bad with names, though. If I see their face, I'm really good with faces and Twitch names. I'm really good with Twitch names. Sentinel, welcome back in as well. Your boy, Sean, I'm saying for like the sixth time. I also see, hold on, I see Jamaicans here, Jinx here, Jordan again. I've said a million times. Drogs, welcome back in. Is this gym time? I told you guys that if I am prepped and ready for the gym, that I will actually go to the gym. So I'm determined to, yes, so we are stopping at nine o'clock tonight, but I'm determined to just be in my gym fit so I can just roll straight from here to the gym. No second thoughts object emotion stays in motion i don't know if plain gwent counts as in motion but i'm choosing to believe it 
<laughs> instead of just hopping off a stream and not doing anything oh man okay we're i feel like i need to do slightly different stretches because i can't remember if i she <laughs> i can't remember she my arms. i guess i'll find out in a second Nilsson, welcome back in. Oh man, this is such a jangles. Welcome back in as well. I'm going to stretch. Oh, my, I never, oh, do you guys crack your fingers at all? I don't really do that that much. Conquer, welcome back in, by the way. And Lesnar, Lesnar, welcome back in. And thank you so much for the donation. I think at this point, we're just going to permanently have Santa Claus as the donation alert. It's never changing. Cracking fingers unlocked. I actually hate that. So like when Hello, I do everyone. it. Hello, everyone. Lesnar, welcome back in. And thank you so much for the donation. In before she decides to do a 12-hour Witcher stream. No, it is not happening. Absolutely not. Sharpie is spamming all of the emotes that I probably need to change out because it's out of season for Christmas emotes. But maybe we have Christmas emotes all year round except for Christmas time. Like when I listen to my Christmas music, maybe. Maybe. Zorak, welcome back in. And Anon as well with another gifted sub to Senpai. Senpai, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. And Crate, welcome back back in how are you i don't recognize you is it because my hair's up it's like all pulled back i'm super relaxed today i really just wanted to roll straight into streaming i'm new to watching the stream in witcher 3 you boy again welcome back in armin we are welcome back in too i saw sentinel i saw crate i see elm i see furch furch is it furch is that what i'm saying furch welcome back in royal spoon i love your name so much it's been a rough week wait your credit card got hacked broke for the last wait wait broke for at least a week or so the good news okay before i say the good news to be fair, at least it was your credit card and not your debit card. So typically credit cards, I mean, at least I was always told and I, in my own experience, credit cards will usually replenish whatever has been taken. So to be fair, it is better than it being a debit card. So yes, it's right. Furch. Okay, awesome. All right. I always have to give myself a pat on the back if I get a name right the first go. And Cosmac, welcome back in. Dream Hunter, welcome back in. Mr. Monkey's here. Ken's here. Witch. No, not witch. I keep wanting to say Witcher and it's... It's Wichter. Wichter purpose porpoise is it porpoise i think it's porpoise porpoise welcome back in as well what has happened is there anything that i need to catch you guys up on i feel like i just saw y'all the other day the background is different i changed the colors a little bit so i usually do purple backgrounds but i'm realizing that it's kind of washing out the entire screen so i am trying to mess around with a couple different like color options so you guys might see it different for the next week until i decide on the one thing but i kind of like this one it's like a pinkish like michael myers is looking a little ominous back there with a little red pink hint on his face missing maggie with the bangs oh <laughs> no never i will never go back to the bang days i feel so bad for anybody that had to experience that or watch those videos absolutely not witcher and gwen has the only name <laughs> those are the only names that i remember right now glide pass here spazzy's here you need to do quests but only to win cards there are quests to do them wasn't i doing that was what we did last stream i did one of those ones sienna welcome back in quiz unknown are your piercings the same on yeah, the, on other ears or different? They're different. So this one, like I don't have these on that one. I just have like one up here on this one. But this one, I actually have my rook pierced and my tragus. And then I have three on each side. So I think I have a total of nine or ten. Nine or ten something. Uh, I've had them for so long, I can't even remember. I It's the same thing, though. I don't like getting this question because you guys know I've answered this before. When I got my tattoos, it's like an addictive feeling and I don't feel it as painful. It's actually like this nice feeling. So I hate answering this question. The only piercing that hurt was this one because that's like a really thick piece of uh, cartilage, I want to say. So that was like the worst one that I did. And I had to get it re-pierced because I had it pierced before I was in the military. And then I had to get it taken out so it closed up. And so when they re-pierced it, it was scarred tissue at that point and it was brutal so it's only whenever you have to get him re-pierced does it hurt really badly and anon thank you so much for the gifted sub to monkey man and also to gravel as well guys welcome back in and i hope y'all enjoy the emotes and the sub i'm addicted to the pain it's why i love dark souls please all great piercings and jewelry choices i am like gold only i made that switch a long time ago and i just i pretty much will only keep the but i use like evergreen pieces so like i never change out any of my jewelry i almost keep like the same pieces on all the time although i haven't been wearing my rings very much lately 
I have a sleeve. Can convert. Sienna, I need sleeve pictures. I did not realize that in the pictures you had sent me. Maybe it's because you didn't show me your arm picture, but I need to see these sleeves. See, I always in my head like have this idea to get more tattoos, but as you can tell, I have commitment issues, so I get the smallest thing in existence. <laughs> and Ryan with the Discord noise. Ryan, welcome back in. Silly Cohen, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. If you're talking pre-workout, no idea. I can't do pre-workouts. No, I'm not doing pre-workouts anymore. So the only like caffeine consumption I'll do is if I'm recording or or it's like in an energy drink form. I stopped doing pre-workout a while ago. Now sometimes I'll have some before I record or if I need to pick me up instead of having like a cup of coffee or something, I'll do a half scoop of pre-workout. But I typically stick with like Alani New is the brand that I just stick with. Jay Rainey, welcome back in. I see Dread as well. Dread, welcome back in. I'm here to remind you about Halo. Is is what is it, February? Is February not enough for you? Is that not enough? Addicted to the pain is my gaming and collection right now. <laughs> If the game is too easy, I need to play the hardest mode. I I mean, I feel like when it comes to gaming, it's really enjoyable to keep being met with resistance and bosses seem to do that in Dark Souls to me. So I don't know. I like I like a challenge. I don't like the ease of just winning a battle. I want to feel the blood, sweat and tears it takes to take down like a boss or or something of that. So speaking of that, I told you guys we would talk about it. What do y'all think after watching eight parts, nine parts, Fuchs, don't worry about it. Something's in the works. Don't even worry about it. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. What do you guys think about switching it to um, Death March? Is it Death March? Dead space? Dead something something dead space? Dark path. We dark pass. Welcome back in, by the way. But Sienna sleeve is full away. What? All right. Hold on. I have to scroll and catch up. Bell Peppa, welcome back in. Rain Man's here. Jupiter, again, welcome back in. Aquina, I saw 100k before summer for sure. Oh, man. I can't even keep up with chat with you guys. I There's like such a sweet spot and I feel like this is it. And I don't know. I just, I never want to lose the personable aspect of the stream. And so I feel like I, it's such a tricky thing, right? Because you always want to continue to grow and stuff like that. But I just, I really like where the stream's at right now. And I just never want it to get to the point where I, I'm not able to even do an aspect of the intro. I just, you guys are what make this enjoyable. So I always want to make sure that it, it's personable. We can't quit you either. <laughs> You're stuck forever. Guys, thank you so much for the follows and welcome in. I almost read that as it's algebra and I wanted to run. It's Alina, Alingra, Alingra, Allegra? Wait, what? Zaber, what's up? Welcome back in. Um, Mr. Monkey again. There's going to come to a point where there's too many. I can't allow it. I'm going to have to do. I never want to do slow mo either. Unknown. Unknown with the five gifted subs to the channel and community. Unknown. Thank you so much. Y'all, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and welcome in. And I'm going to have to just catch up and scroll down. I saw Scotty, Spazzy, Deadmall's here. Thunderjaw is here too. Thank you for the kind words. Praying Mantis is here too. Don't bring up New Vegas. It gives me PTSD of my eggs. The statement that just came out of my mouth by saying that, but I know exactly what you're talking about. Praying. <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about. Unknown. Thank you so much. Uh, Darth Vicious, what's up? Welcome in. Your camera is crystal clear. Crystal clear. It's a Sony A6600. And yes, it is. It is both amazing, but relentless as well. Because if you have a single, like you can see like every single freckle on my face. So just fully understand that it is a great camera. The lens does all the work, but it will show every single thing possible. <laughs> They're coming for the eggs. Oh, you guys, I played Grounded this morning with Anna. And there are just some statements that you never, like hearing Anna say you need to stab the sack is not something that I ever thought I would hear <laughs> in my life. And this is why I think gaming and streaming is the most, like, it's just, it keeps me laughing and cracking up. And, and honestly, all the laughter that I have with you guys is what keeps me young because the words and the statements that come out when playing a game, because you're so lost in what you're doing that you don't even realize what you're saying until you guys are like, Maggie, what? What did you just say? I'm not making it up. Ask her about it. She told me to stab the sack. <laughs> she told me to stab. 
<laughs> There's the like spider sacks in that game. And that game is brutal. That game is brutal. Um, And also speaking of Anna, we decided next Saturday, we're going to do the first part of It Takes Two. So if you guys enjoyed watching A Way Out or you guys have seen our videos on YouTube with The Forest um, or Grounded as well, we're going to do a co-op stream on next Saturday. Not this Saturday, but next Saturday. So we're going to do It Takes Two. It takes two to make a thing go right. Specs and tech, guys, thanks for the follow and welcome in. So we'll pause Witcher on Saturday next week for it. Yes, it's going to be utter chaos. I've not played the game, so I know that it's like i'm pretty sure it's family relations right like it's a husband and a wife so we're gonna let y'all decide who you think the husband and the wife is in this relationship um and also eminem is it eminem is it emin emin hello what's up welcome in conquer i caught again respiro respiro i haven't seen you in so long welcome back in and snap a light is here unknown again thank you so much and welcome back in yes we are doing gwen and also can we take a moment to appreciate where the pork chops are where's the pork chops welcome back in preparation is half the battle this is true and ano 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 Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Uno as well. Uno, welcome back in. Flynn, I saw. All right, I'm scrolling down. Financials here. 47, Mike is here. Welcome back in. Craig, Aries, chart. Aries, hello. Also, did I see Riddler, Raj? Welcome back into Bro Gamer. Which are in Gwent. That's the only names Maggie sees nowadays. Really just Gwent. It's really just Gwent, too. I don't even know if I would say Witcher, you know? Uh, and also DARPA, thank you so much for the reset for 20 months in a row and welcome back in and Anon as well with the gift of sub to Gert. It was funny because when I was playing this morning with Anna, my brother calls and he was bringing up Witcher. And so we were talking about Witcher and I'm on speakerphone so Anna can hear it and everything. And I told him, I was like, hey, cause he's not loving Witcher right now. Like for whatever reason, he's not loving it. And so I told him to just give it another chance and a go. And um, I told him this statement, I said, it is actually usurping my love for Fable. Like Fable will no longer be my favorite game at the end of this. And my brother genuinely said, he was like, wow, that is the highest honor you can give somebody. Like that even he knows that Fable has always been the top for me. So he said he would go back and give it another try after I said that. So yeah, I am definitely loving Witcher. There's, I, I knighted that shit. <laughs> I dub thee my favorite game ever, Fable. I'm so sorry. Uh, Bartoon, what's up? Welcome in and thank you for the follow. And Anon with another gifted sub. Forgot how he feels about Witcher. How does he feel about Gwent? I asked him and he was like, it's not that I don't understand it. I understand it. It's just not fun. Well, being your sister isn't fun. Okay, but I still have to do it. All right, <laughs> that's how I feel. I don't have an option, so neither do you. Okay, <laughs> Donnie. <laughs> Donnie, thank you so much for the reset for three months in a row and welcome back in. Thank you. Seriously, I'm so glad to see you're still enjoying the community. I'm going to make him play it. I'm going to tie him to this chair the next time he comes down to visit me and I'm going to make him watch hours and hours. <laughs> What's that movie where they like tape his eyes open? Um, ah, Clockwork Orange. It's not taping his eyes open either, but I think it's Clockwork Orange. I've never seen that movie, but it looks so strange. Homeless. Thanks for the follow. <laughs> Welcome to the channel and community. Oh, it was Zoolander too. They did it in Zoolander too. I love how you were going with Zoolander and I thought Clockwork Orange. Oh man. Gaslight, what's up? Welcome back in Vaughn as well. My wife and I played it take two together and it was incredible. Did it bring you guys closer, Vaughn, or did it tear you guys apart? Did y'all need a break after playing that? Come down with it. You came down with the virus today. This will be a good way to spend my sick day. Ah, well, I hope that hopefully, wait, it's a give or take. Are you having like respiratory issues? Because I don't want you to laugh because you're going to have all the laughter and that might make it worse. But I hope you have a quick recovery. And thank you so much for tuning in today. And Gert, welcome in. And also Koopa, thank you for the follow. The Gwen addiction is real. So speaking of Gwen addiction, are you guys ready? Should we start this? A Clockwork Orange. What is that? I don't even know what that is about. I feel like that's one of those films that is like, um... oh, does that have what's her name? Oh, what's the girl in that? Or am I thinking? I always get Clockwork Orange and another film confused. Mm -mm. Mm. What's the one girl? Her daughter's in Stranger Things. Her daughter's... No, no, no. Her daughter's in... Oh, is it the girl from The Shining? Is that who it is? Gaslight. Gaslight, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Thank you. 
Y'all, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and welcome in. Taxi driver? No, not taxi driver. Why am I thinking of Uma Thurman? She's not in that. What other cult classic is Uma Thurman in? Gaslight, thank you so much. And anybody that's got a gifted sub from Unknown or Gaslight, I hope y'all enjoy the sub and the emotes and welcome in. Pulp Fiction! That's right. I've never seen Pulp Fiction either. Oh, she was not Kill Bill, wasn't she? She's been in a lot of stuff, to be fair. To be fair. Um, Ish, welcome back in. Skywalker, welcome back in. Yes, we are Gwentine. I also see a Bosti the Snowman. Anybody that I miss, Dark Shadow, Uno, Skywalker again. Add more Happy Hump Day, welcome back in. Aries, somehow I get Uncharted vibes from the way that I look. Is it because anytime you say, it's like more of a Tomb Raider. Is this like a Tomb Raider look? <laughs> It's just the tank top and the and I just look like I have dirt on my face right now. If I smacked some dirt on my face, I think I could pull off Tomb Raider. And I have her necklace. I should have just done the impromptu uh the impromptu Tomb Raider look. You should dump your brother. I will work on that. I'm gonna get a different brother, okay? I think he was the milkman's son anyway, so Lara Croft. Yes, yes, Lara Croft. Uh guys, thank you for the followers and welcome in. And oh man runway runway with the reset for 25 months in a row thank you so much for the continual support and welcome back in for 25 months in a row the build a brother <laughs> you is awesome always happy to be here runway i'm so glad that you've been a part of the community for over over two years now thank you and i hope you're off to a great 2023 as well can we trade brothers pod <laughs> Pod, what's up? Welcome back in. Vintage, welcome back in. Andy as well. Uh, I'm feeling the open world fatigue now and I'm 62 hours in. So open world fatigue is a real thing. Usually I hit it at around 80 hours. But um, have you been playing Gwent? I've heard that Gwent is the perfect cure for that. So maybe consider it. Just saying. Maybe consider it. You yeah, know? I'm just saying. Anthony, what's up? Welcome back in. A close friend of mine said that The Witcher 3 was massive, but just too effing massive for my taste. And I think a lot of people have that problem, to be honest. It's a sense of overwhelm. I think it can be overwhelming when you have so much content. So I think it is that open world fatigue. Darpaz. Darpaz, thank you so much for another five gifted subs to the channel and community. What are you guys doing? Darpaz, thank you. Hold on, I gotta scroll down so I can catch that. I saw something about a country accent. I do not have a country accent. That is not true. <laughs> Don't start. Craig, welcome back in. Metal Gear, welcome back in. Gaslight, again, thank you so much. And Darpaz, Rough Overlord's here. Pat's here. Ken's here. Sharpie. Did you see? <laughs> maybe a little. All right, maybe when I say like butter my buns and call me a biscuit, but y'all take it far too. No. Mm -mm. What, what was the accent that I was doing? What game were we playing? We were playing a game when I just fully leaned into the accent. Yes, she has a very country accent. Supo, what's up? Welcome back in. Ken, again, welcome back in. Yes, we should watch Pulp Fiction. I think it would be fun to make this year about watching cult classics because we're doing Princess Bride and Monty Python. So for my birthday, maybe we could do something like that. I kind of want to watch Mad Max. I have it. I don't remember it. I watched it one time, but I was thinking we could rewatch Mad Max. Yeehaw! I'm a cowboy! Swift, welcome back in, or welcome in, and I hope you enjoy the channel as well as Ard Ard. I don't know why I turned into a seal there. Art, art. Uh, Captain, welcome back in. And holy cow, happy entire year of continual support. And thank you so much for the, just the continual support. I don't know what I just have. I don't know what just happened. Let's start the game. <laughs> Captain Portugal, thank you. Well, guys, give me a day and I will show you that I forget how to stream. I will show you. Nicholas, thanks for the follow as well. Math, welcome back in. Classic or reboot? Is classic better than the reboot? I don't know. I haven't seen either. A pirate Lara Croft is an interesting take. Arr. <laughs> arr, arr. <laughs> Lord of the Rings extended marathon. So I thought about doing this for my birthday, maybe doing a Lord of the Rings marathon with you guys, but I'm not entirely sure because that's going to take a long time. That's like an entire day of me just throwing on the movies and people can come and go as they please. And then I'll just be sitting here watching the whole ones. I'll lay back there. I just got an awesome blanket. My best friend gave me a Costco blanket for Christmas and it is the most comfortable blanket I've ever had. So if you guys have a Costco near you, go get them. It's the softest blanket and Ginger has currently taken it captive and I don't think I'm going to get it back. And if I do, it will not be the same. Hashtag ad. <laughs> 
<laughs> Dude, I wish Costco would sponsor me. Are you kidding me? Costco blankets are so good. You know, I have my Udi. So Anna sent me an Udi, but it's so damn warm. Like it is so warm. It's basically like, do I want to sweat today? Maybe I'll put the Udi on later. We'll see. Lord of the Rings Marathon is a whole adventure. I did it once. I slept for like two days after. My family and I pretty much do it the day after Christmas or the day after New Year's. We'll like all hang out at the house and then we'll just throw it on the TV and do things, come back, kind of watch it and stuff like that. But now we don't do it as much because we usually are all split up for the holidays. But my ex said I lost seven turns picking a movie when I took us to the new Mad Max. <laughs> what? You lost seven turns of picking it. So wait, is that because they're a big fan of the old one? Is that what it is? Black Alicious, what's up? Welcome back in. Senpai, welcome back in. Wish my fam would do Home Alone movie marathons. I've, I told you guys I've never seen the Home Alone series. We've got to watch the Home Alone series. The first Mad Max is a bit tricky to get into now since it's a different style of action. Low, wait, wait, different action film and low budget. You guys r realize who's back there, right? You want to talk about low budget? Do you know that uh, Laurie Strode bought her own clothes for that movie? Like she had to go out and buy, provide her own clothes for the movie. So don't be insulting low budget old films, okay? We love those here. Home Alone is garbage. <laughs> I've always been a fan of the, um... oh man. What's the one where everything bad happens? Ah, he has multiple movies. It's not just a Christmas movie. This, it's a, a family name not hostile oh my not hostile we're not talking about hostile get that out of here the noodle arms are like the... <laughs> honestly i could cut somebody with that i could cut somebody with that i need to put them away you have to see home alone one one day seriously at last so during december i really wanted to do more movie nights but the problem is is i'm usually spread way too thin during the holidays but also maybe this year i don't know do you guys even like doing the 12 games of christmas like is that something that you guys would even want to see this year or what if y'all keep saying lara croft i will go grab the necklace and we'll just sell this i will during break grab some mud and smear it on national lampoons yes yes the national lampoons that's exactly what it is Yes, the vacations. That one's always been my favorite because it's just there's a lot of relatable things, especially when it comes to him having his family nearby. Make it 15 games of Christmas. <laughs> it was fun, but it stressed you out. No, it didn't stress me out. It didn't stress me out. <laughs> How does that lie taste? I don't know. Dill, Dill, welcome back in, Dill. Mikey as well. You can't catch this comment. It's too fast. I'm too fast. <laughs> Not for me, y'all. Okay, Cheerio, what's up? Welcome back in. Darth, 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 Dark Shadow is more, more like a Southern accent. Yeah, I can say that over, it's the y'all. It's mostly what I say. Saying y'all isn't just the, that can't be the exclusive thing that gives me a Southern accent though. And sticky. <laughs> Why are y'all's names like this? Why do you guys? Sticky side down. Uh, maybe I'm the problem. Maybe I'm making that weird. But Anon, thank you so much for another gifted sub as well to Sticky Side Down. <laughs> oh, guys, we're doing my build tomorrow. I'm do well, we're I'm doing my build tomorrow. I'm starting my new PC build tomorrow. <gasps> I'm super excited. Uh, I'm going to film most of it so that or I'm going to try to film all of it so that I can make it into a YouTube short or a YouTube video for you guys if y'all want to see it. No, we're not doing it on stream. I'm going to try to record it. Yeah, so I can still still show you guys the fast process. Trust me, I feel like when it comes to a build anyway, it's so aesthetically pleasing to watch like what is six hours turn into 60 seconds, you know? So I'm going to plan to do that tomorrow. And also book, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. The mic that I use is the Sure. I'm unsure. <laughs> um it is in my specs if it if so there we go the sure mv7 i've tested a couple different mics and this one just sounded the best overall considering your addiction to gwent are you going to try the standalone gwent game from cd project red i haven't decided i haven't decided maybe it's something that for oh i know what we can do oh it's already happening i've got it in my head all right, I'm playing catch up. Hold on. Bad Buddha, welcome back in, by the way. Best Christmas movie ever, Die Hard. I still haven't seen it, and I think I'm going to refuse to see it. I think I'm going to hold out and be strong and not... Uh, it can't be a Christmas music just... Uh, Christmas music. It can't be a Christmas movie just because there's Christmas music in it. That doesn't constitute an entire film being labeled as a Christmas movie, okay? Don't say lame. 
Don't say Liam and Dombach. What's up? Welcome back in. So you know what we can do is after Witcher, we'll have a little bit of time. And if you guys are, hopefully all will still be here, but we are celebrating half a decade here on June 8th or something. So maybe for my stream anniversary, we'll do the Gwent standalone game and come back to it to celebrate it. And also Big and Sierra. Guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in. Anybody that just followed, welcome. Mm. Sierra. If I... Now I'm just going to break out into Sierra song still. So Die Hard is the new Halo? No, it is not. Uh, oh. Yeah, actually, no, that's accurate. Don't clip me say no, but yes, I would say that's pretty accurate. It's the new Halo. Witcher? Oh, okay. I was like, Witcher? Uh, let me... There we go. All right. I was so confused for a second. I messed up my entire OBS today, y'all. I'm not going to go into details, but I had to basically reset every single scene in my OBS because I'm a mess. I am the problem here. I am the, I'm the problem. <laughs> Glad I found it now, though. Financial, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, the stream. Uh, did you come from, you came from YouTube, right? I want to say you came from YouTube. The better be protein for the noodle arms. <laughs> Is it that so I worked out my biceps yesterday. I did. I did biceps, back and biceps. So today we have legs. So we'll see how it goes. Taking it back to the mid 2000s with Sierra. If I had a thing of that, then made you cry. Wait, maybe that's Beyonce. Ah, oh, they both sing about men. Okay, that's a really bad way to put that. But yes, you know, <laughs> if I were a boy. Ah, uh, no, they both have a similar song like that. I can't remember what is it what it is. Angel, what's up? Welcome back in. The 40 minute intro, that's fast. Okay, we say that it's a 40 minute intro, but you realize that I haven't actually started playing the game yet. If I was a boy is Beyonce, but I think there I think there is one. Sierra did a song too. At least what you were singing. That was Sierra. If I I can't get to the chorus. I can't make it to the chorus. Uh, yes, the rated. It is. It is a small, it's like called a fine line tattoo. So you can almost not tell. Like a boy. So there's, if I was a boy, and then there's like a boy. Yeah, that's right. Unknown, welcome back in. I gotta do it like this because I, <laughs> I'm gonna have to go grab something else. I'm pretty sure I did not. Sway, what's up? Welcome back in, by the way. I need to ask Asta, have you ever seen everywhere all at once? No, what is that? What is that? Angel, seriously, welcome back in. Just found you on Twitch when I was looking at Witcher streams, actually. Okay, it was through Witcher. It was through Witcher. I know that it was just, like, not even a week ago. I think it was just last week. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Uh, what is it? I've also never seen, what is it, The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Universe or something? Accidentally strandle herself in the noodle arms. <laughs> it's like, the one, what is that thing where it's like you twist your arms up and around? Oh, gosh. Although, on the bright side, I feel like I really have good chances of strangling somebody with them. I feel like I could actually choke somebody out. Maybe not. No, maybe they just snap my noodle. <laughs> just snap the noodle. It's a multiverse movie. Ooh. How do I unsubscribe? All right, Admore. Get back here. Handy Andy. Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community. Uh, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy movie isn't that good. Why does everybody talk about it then? Or maybe I just remember it being a trailer for some other movie that I saw. I did leg day. Wait, wait. I did leg day for the first time on Monday since four years ago, and they were burning. I neglected my legs for the glam muscles for too long. Okay, first of all, legs are glam muscles all right i look at a guy and i say god damn that's a baseball booty like you already <laughs> there's like i don't know i think it's more impressive when there's guys with like beefy legs you know like a good calf muscle oh yes a good calf muscle <laughs> hey yo uh, i like the hitchhikers movie and the books i think a lot of people though the consensus is they like the book better but i didn't even realize it was a book but i just remember seeing the trailer for the longest time to blame <laughs> everybody likes a good calf okay only calves <laughs> calves mean that they're like either a runner or a track star or a bicycle uh, a bicycle or a cyclist big calf girl big big calves calves and achilles heels oh achilles tendons oh yeah <laughs> mm. 
I should say the marching band nerds have those big calves. The toned calves. Calves are actually... Nick, you bring up a good point. Calves are a really hard muscle to ice. Well, not just to isolate, but to grow. So if you see somebody with massive calves, I think a lot of it is genetics. I feel like for calves, a lot is genetics. Mm. I don't ever do vegan protein. I mostly always stick with whey. Um, but that's also just, I just have never, I, don't, I just don't like to spend money and vegan protein is really expensive. <laughs> vegan protein is really expensive. We've seen this a million times. So I'm going to give you guys the update if y'all are new here or you haven't been here like last stream. So I'll give you guys the recap. I also have been looking into cosplay ideas. I know initially we talked about Yennefer because of my hair, but I'm actually kind of leaning towards Siri. I think that I have, somebody mentioned it, but I do think that I have her face shape more. And if I'm going to do this, I want to go all out because I really haven't done a cosplay in so long. Um... So I'm leaning towards Siri, or no, which would in fact mean that I have to get contacts, but you'd have to do contacts for Yennefer either way. Bobby, what's up? Welcome back in. And Azzy, welcome back in too. Wait, what'd you say? <laughs> After the mail day. <laughs> what was that, Azzy? Hold on. J-Rod, welcome back in too. I gen genetically am predispositioned to chicken legs. <laughs> Who doesn't have a good tendon? Exactly, Anthony. Exactly. <laughs> Did you finish the plant protein from your neighbor? No, I've been slowly, uh, very slowly working my way through that. I know I should. I know I need to start having protein on a daily basis. I was trying to read things to like help hair growth because I feel like my hair is thinned for whatever reason. And then I read that like energy drinks are really bad for your hair, like causing hair thinning. And then I read that protein's really good for hair growth. And I don't, there's so many mixed consensus. I just don't know what to believe. Maybe it's because I'm always wearing a hat. Is the hat the reason up for my hair? Did you finish that? Okay, wait, I saw that. Wait, wait, where was Azzy's? She's going after the mailman, walking on the, <laughs> they're just walking the mail on a daily basis. <laughs> I'm chasing the mailman down the, down the, I almost said down the hall, down the driveway or whatever. Note to self, man, he loves to check other people's calves in the gym. <laughs> yes. Ninja, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Did you ever do a Claire Redfield? No, I never did a Claire Redfield cosplay. I haven't done a cosplay in a really long time, but I haven't thought to doing a Resident Evil one and maybe I should. Focus, focus. There's pizza on your focus. <laughs> Should I do collagen? Should it be collagen? I feel like nobody... Collagen is really good for hair. You had to read that fact. <laughs> that what? Energy drinks aren't good for you? The, I know that the hat thing is a myth. Hats being bad for your hair growth, I'm pretty sure that's a myth. Maybe for hair growth, but I know that it doesn't thin your hair. I think that's an old wives' tale. Stoic, welcome back in. The biotin for the hair. I've read that pizza is good for growth. Oh, it's the pizza this whole time. I also saw the eggs were really good as well. Maybe I should start taking a collagen supplement. I feel like I should anyway. Cosplay as a child. Wait, what was that? <laughs> Hold on. I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling. What's good for blood flow is good for hair. Okay. That was very... Okay. I drink protein every day and my hair is trash. <laughs> I think that all of this is like... It's got to have slight impacts. I Like I have heard biotin's really good for hair growth and nail growth. But yeah, I don't know. A lot of it just feels like you'd have to... I think genetics just play a huge part in it. Like, it's such a large part. A leck and hidden, guys. Thanks for the follows and welcome in. The bald Rebel Maggie look when. <laughs> oh, like, um, V for Vin. Oh, that was the day. That was the moment that I knew I was in love with, um, oh, Padme. Why am I blanking on her name? Oh my goodness, when she played V for Vendetta and she looked beautiful, even with like the shaved head look looked so good on her. I knew it. Cosplay as a child because they're more your size. For being 4'11", is that what it is? <laughs> uh, Kyle, what's up? Welcome back in. Oh, <laughs> Could you do a Plague Tale cosplay? Oh, that would be cool. I don't know who I would do though. I don't know who, like cosplays go either way. Like I feel like I like doing, I like doing ones that require not minimal effort because you guys saw I did the dancer cosplay. I like making armor, but then I also, there's just something fun about rubbing dirt on you. You know, I like the cosplays like Lara Croft. What was the other one we did? What was I? The towel cosplay from Until Dawn. <laughs> 
or ask a dermatologist. Yeah, I need to honestly talk to my doctor and get referred to a dermatologist for it. And Banks, what's up? Welcome in. I always just like having these conversations to see what you guys say. Da Vinci, welcome back in. Maggie, I'm here. Senior, welcome back in. Cosplay is Tom Holland. Cosplay is Nathan Drake. Um... I don't think you could pay me enough to cosplay as Tom Holland. I'm pretty sure. I, the, the fact that he ruined Nathan Drake for me. But Nathan Fillion. Now that somebody actually recommended the show that Nathan Fillion is in. Um, you know, how, does anybody remember Castle? Castle was so good. It was so damn good. Natalie Portman. How could I forget? I know you're right. I'm going to do the rat costume. <laughs> Faking and also Fuji, guys. Thanks for the follow and welcome in. And Buck. Oh, man. Ah, uh, that was so weak. I'm sorry. That was weak. Oh, I did do a Tifa cosplay. I did do a Tifa. All right, guys. So just something fun about running some dirt into it, you know? The Rat King costume. <laughs> Are you about the Rat King from Last of Us? <laughs> and, uh, there's something really fun about people saying, like, do a cosplay from a game, but you do, like, completely what nobody's expecting. <laughs> like, the Rat King from Last of Us, too. <laughs> mm-hmm castle was so good and then he went on to do something else the rookie so i've heard really good things about the rookie and i should do it i forgot that i did tifa honestly that was two halloweens ago it was two moons ago all right y'all well everybody happy wednesday welcome back in if you guys weren't here for monday's stream or the past couple of streams have no fear all we accomplished was gwent here um <laughs> No, we are starting to get through some of the maps. Last um, last stream when I played, when I did play Gwent games, it was all in the name of the quest, okay? There is a quest that you can do to go out there and fight all of the, I think all of the highballer people when it comes to Gwent. So I did complete that one secondary quest, right? Never mind. I also have playing in keeps. I have playing in keeps. Yes, the Fable cos- the Hob cosplay. <laughs> I should. You know, out of everything that I've cosplayed, I can't believe I've never- never done Fable. I feel like that's a crime. One hour overtime to game. <laughs> oh, no, 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 it's 59 minutes. We're starting, we're starting. The intro is gonna be short today. The last season was pretty whack. They should have ended at the wedding. Maybe I don't remember the last season. It's been a while. It's been a while. That's like do a Witcher cosplay proceeds to cosplay as Roach. <laughs> Hey, that's not the worst cosplay in the world. I feel like that would be fantastic. Um, didn't somebody say that? They were like, every year I have to top my previous October and how incredible the costumes are. So this next year I have to get into doing like full blown, like, what is it? Um, ah, like FX art where you're actually changing the shape of your face and everything, turning into like Avatar or something. The Null Detective, thank you so much for the resale for eight months in a row and welcome back in. Thank you for the continual support. Hello. I was like, Anna today told me that I, I remind her of the Avatar, I guess in the latest Avatar. She was like, I kept thinking it was you. And I was like, what? How do you get that? She said the personalities. You won't have any Gwent left if you do it all now. Roth, you make a good point. Okay. I have put off Kara for far too long. Guys, I think it is time we do the Kara quest line. I think the plan is today. And also, Wak. Is it Wakum? Wakum, thank you so much for continuing your gifted sub from Blackadder. Blackadder, if you're here, thank you for the gifted sub. And Wakum, thank you. I'm so glad to see you're still enjoying the channel and community. It's clearly the blue skin. Clearly. You're going to need to do makeup artists this year. I'm going to need a makeup artist this year to top my previous work. No, I'm just going to be better. I can do better. I can do better. I guarantee this October you guys will be like, uh, I'm not going to hype it up too, too much because sometimes you have to have lazy costumes on the sidelines. Like you have to know that not every single day I'm going to be able to do the best and top the previous work. But I will say that I think this year's are going to be better because I'm already starting to plan for it. Okay, so we're going to do Kara Quest. Be better. Do better. The plan is Gwent. No, we'll go back to Gwent later. I put off Kara for far too long. And to be honest, she's too pretty to put off any longer. 
it's time to ride for Kara. This October, that sounds so far away, but it is going to creep up so quickly. I can Let's see you kind of look like Zoe with heavy makeup like it. Oh, Homo Sabian, welcome back in, by the way. I have to see, I haven't seen Avatar 2, and I can't remember how long it's been since I saw Avatar 1. It's been quite some time. You could put off Kara another week doing side quests, for sure. If I put my mind to anything. <laughs> but if I put my mind to Witcher and doing side quests, I could make Kara a next week activity for sure. But I think that she deserves a little bit better from me. Which, by the way, did we talk about? Should I up it to Death March? I expect you to force choke me through the monitor in October. <laughs> Oh, you guys want to see a Sith Lord Casta in October next year? You can do Sith Lord Casta. <laughs> Just started replaying Witcher 3 today and the next gen looks so good. It is. It looks absolutely beautiful. And I also just missed that. Erdy, Erdy, welcome back in, by the way. Uh, I started Elden Ring and I just beat Margo. Though I have to say, quick, in the process of getting to Margo, I met Patches and well, I kind of killed him. You killed Patches? I killed Patches in... Did I kill Patches in Dark Souls 1? I think I killed Patches in Dark Souls 1. Sapper's Trousers. I think I did kill Trapper, actually. Oh, Disney Plus has Avatar 1. I don't have it, but I can snag it from my brother. Let me get that. Let me get that. Um, I wonder if I can wear those pants. Ooh. Some saucy pants. Ooh. All right, we'll wear those. I'm 50 out of 60. The best way to play Witcher. Ew, I hate my shirt. <laughs> I hate the shirt so much. Well, thanks for the follow, welcome in. I tried to see Avatar with the kids. Lost patience an hour and a half in. It's a long film, right? If I have to pee in the middle of a film, it's too long. But that doesn't say a lot about me. Oh, there look at her. At last. Hold on. Time out. Zoro, what's up? Welcome back in. Ooh, steel. Mm. I could see how kids could lose patience with that really quickly. Aww. The shirt is not cash money. That statement is not cash money. <laughs> McDo, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. And Anon, thank you so much for the gift of Zoro. Zoro, I hope you enjoy the Can seven emotes. I'd like to finally meet this mysterious elf. I haven't found the witch armor. I do armor. wonder if the two of mm. you will hit it off. Not like I want to bet him. Just want to ask him about Siri. Just want to ask him about Siri. So I think we need to do wandering in the in the dark first to be able to finish the Baron quest, and then we'll be able to keep continuing after Siri. I hate the lack of drip when I get a random item, but it is better. Um, everybody knows that to play Witcher, you have to be fashionable, not practical. Okay. The fashion faux pas. Oh. I guess let's talk to her while she's going. Ma'am? Ma'am. Ignite. I usually have to pee during a movie because going to a movie and not getting a large coke is basically a sin. Is that what you said? <laughs> Style over substance. Exactly. I haven't played cyberpunk, but I agree with it. Just craft some witcher gear. Maybe the feline stuff? I don't think I've gotten the feline stuff. Are you giving spoilers right now? The wild hunt. What? Phantom Riders? That means... I, I thought they didn't exist. Feast your eyes on the non-existent then. Huh. Hmm. Got a navigator with them. Uh, what? They didn't sense our entrance? Billy D, welcome in, by the way. Can you teleport us to the other side? I'd rather teleport oh. us home. Do you really mean to follow them? Teleport. Hurry up. Have I seen this before? Sure no. I like any of this. Oh, this reminds me of Fable when you go into the caves in Fable 3 or whatever. Um, no, I, this is my first playthrough ever. Cost me 92 bucks to see Avatar for three people with, oh, well, with popcorn and drinks, yeah. Guys, you gotta do the snap pack. Hold on. Real quick. Oh, crap. I feel like I'm on a time constraint, but there could be loot, and there's also creatures. There's drowners down here. All right, let's go. Let me stay on quest. Stay on quest. No, yeah, this is... Damn portals. Wonder where Kira is now. Did she just get taken off? All right, let me pull this out real quick. Uh, I don't know if I like that. Let's see, for drowners, I do believe that they fall under... Mm, drowners might be 
cursed or I think they're necro. I'm gonna throw a necro on there. I can't remember. We did actually, in preparation for this quest, we did upgrade things as well. You know nothing, Jon Snow. Welcome back in. Would you trade Kara for Yen? Oh. See, I think I just haven't been exposed to Yen enough to be as hopelessly devoted to her as a lot of people are. I think that the more exposure I have to her, I'll kind of, I'll get the allure and I'll feel like absolutely ride or die for her. But currently I'm just not, Hopeless. Isn't it hopelessly devoted to you? Isn't that what that song says? Hopelessly devoted. Maybe it's not hopeless. Helplessly devoted? It's not helplessly. Uh, guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in. I'm not swimming in there. All right, we're going. All right, I have to go. I have to go. We have to go. I trade Yen for a drowner. <laughs> you would trade. Hopelessly devoted. Yes, it's the song from Greece. Okay. Can you please swim, my man? Swim swiftly. All right, let's surface. Hopelessly devoted. I'm hopeless for another character in this game, but we'll talk about her once we see her. It's probably Triss. People only talk about two different girls. Everybody, nobody talks about Kara. So, so disrespectful. I think Kara is amazing. Mika, thanks for the follow and welcome in. You had no right, it's up. Alright, where'd she go? Over there. It's the way that the drowners like barf up, you know? It's gotta be Triss. Let's actually just make sure that we're good to go. Oh. I should pick up the body parts. Little Dane, what's up? Welcome back in. Happy Wednesday. Siri, Yen, then Triss. Oh, you actually do have to consider Siri. Well, I don't know because as of right now, Siri has been our ward. So I'm not choosing to look at her like that, but I don't put anything past. Mm, I don't put anything past Geralt. I don't know. Oh, wait, I saw something about, I saw something about HBO. Have you watched Last of Us? No, Lang, I haven't yet. I haven't yet. Oh. Okay, we're not going that way. I haven't yet. I'm planning to watch it to tomorrow. I'm planning to watch it tomorrow because I'm going to record it and then do like a reaction video for you guys. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you for that, Maddie. All right. Look for anything else we can find. I, did, I wasn't tracking it as gas, okay? Gas, gas, gas. DJ, what's up? Welcome back in. Mm. Siri has, has a foglet? A foglet? Oh! Okay, we can't kill it unless it's in. It's gotta be susceptible to this. No, it's not. Okay. Huh. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, let's see it. Let's see it. Let's check it out. Vlad, what's up? Welcome in. And guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Little Dane. All right, the foglets. I was in... It's a necro. It's a electric. Fog is a traveler's foe. In the forest, it can make one lose one's way. At sea, it can send one sailing into the rocks. Yet such dangers are nothing compared to the monsters known as foglets, which sometimes lurk within it. Mm, these creatures are powerful. Claws like the Zerkanian Zirkan Zir Kinjals. Yet they make it truly dangerous is their mastery of deception and beguilement and disorientation. Many times they do not need to attack at all, instead simply driving their prey into madness or boggy marshlands. Interesting. Hmm. I don't have the, I don't have the, I have the torch, I don't have the lantern. I don't have a lantern yet. Gaslight, thanks for the stretch. Um, yeah, I don't have the, I don't have it yet. Callum, what's up? Welcome in and thank you so much for the follow. And Steel, I was wondering who it was. Steel, thank you so much for the continual support for 46 months in a row. You know two more months and we've got four years, dude. If one day you read the books, you will be sure. You'll know who to choose. I think the books lean towards, um, 
Yennefer to begin with, and also Tito Welkman. I think that's what a couple of you guys have spoke to. I think a lot of people say that the books help you understand why it's always Yen and it always will be Yen. Yeah, those were super annoying. Actually, real quick, I didn't look at this. Hold on. Hold up. Snip, welcome in as well. Let's do... They're susceptible to Ard? Oh no, Quen. Interesting. Okay. I guess since they jump out of nowhere, that's not a bad thing to be able to use in a pinch. There's got to be something down here. Let's try diving. Isn't this where I came from, though? I think this is where we came from. Yeah, this is where we came from. It circled us. It was a giant circle. The books will never take away my love for the game. I, for the game's ability to choose which one. Nero, welcome in. Yen is more traditional than most. I'm gonna go based on who I'm drawn to more. I'm gonna make it true to, true to me. So we will see who I decide. All right, pull this out. Yeah, this is the 4.0 version. Extinguish. That's such an odd placement. Tastic, what's up? Welcome in. Well, welcome and stay sticky. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. All right, let's light up this place. Oh, a water hag. I don't think I've looked at what they're susceptible to. Whoa. Flying poo. And she's coming out of nowhere. I, is she susceptible to fire maybe? I didn't realize if you're holding a torch in hand, you can light them on fire. Wait, the torch and sword is amazing. Hmm, that ain't bad. Line it up, what's up, welcome back in. How do you favorite alcohol? Chat, what's my favorite alcohol? Actually, I feel like that that's not a simple answer. There's like three options. Fire burns everything. I didn't realize that he waved it in their face though. Girl against machine, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Mmm, and Dawn, welcome back in. I'm still at 69, sweet. What do you mean? <laughs> Would you not be at 69 anymore? It's between a White Claw or... I do like, I think Moscow Mule. I do feel like Moscow Mule would be my go-to. Kara? 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 Hold on. I'm trying to light all these brazers. Braziers. Kyle, thanks for the follow. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Mm, have you tried quick casting with the signs? Kira? Is that not what I've been doing? Uh, is quick casting this or is quick casting this one? Isn't quick casting that? This was the original way to cast, I thought. Her welcome in too. Keep saying Kara. Kara. Whoa. All right, but real quick, <laughs> real quick, uh, time out. Let me get, let me loot first. Jodo, welcome back in. Strawberry, strawberry. I can't do, I can't do flavored milk. I cannot do flavored milks. Hmm. <laughs> time out, Kara. Hold on. I need to change my upper appearance. Damn it. Okay, let's get rid of that. They're all bad. Everything is bad. All right, we gotta stick with what I have. Uh, to shake a big tree of snow on myself. <laughs> to shaking it, you can put it in the Discord in the video section. You gotta be careful with the icicles. That shit's dangerous. All right, let's go this way. I'm pretty sure she's up and over that way, but we'll check over here. Clue. Clue. Is it Dor- I want to say Dorito, Todd, Drippy, Hilm, and Flip. Guys, I hope y'all enjoy the sub in the emotes. And Clue, thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the channel and community. What are you doing? Yeah, put it in the Discord, Don. I'll have to check it out. What? Welcome back in, and I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much. Just seen the development of Microsoft's layoffs. New gaming division got hit hard. Like studios like Bethesda? For what reason? Alright, 
hold on. I need to roll out, roll out, roll out. All right, take it slow. They're like, come here. All right, let's put that on. Yeah, the foglets are so annoying. Uh, uh, gonna ask. Yeah, that's crazy. It's just because of Microsoft's layoffs? Roll out or fall out? Okay, I'll see myself out. <laughs> oh my gosh, roll out, roll out. Mm, Clue, we how are you? Uh, All right. I'm Girl, here! You're this scared of rats? They're Stay rats! Strong. They're only rats. I hate blood. rats! Them, I beg you. Because of rats? Alright. Ah! This is like Plague's Tale all over again. Maybe this is where they got the idea to create Plague's Tale. Look, or the first stories of Witcher in 1988. They were astonishing. Who would have thought that in 2023 he'd still be known? You said he'd still be known? Or he'd still be unknown, is that what you're saying? I just missed the last part of it. Ooh. I hit the rats. Finishing The Last of Us because the series on HBO is gonna be great. Awesome, are you doing the second one right now or are you, are you on the first one? Because I don't know if they're, I think is the first. You know the diseases they spread. Yes, I know. Is the first series just going to be about the first one? I don't know how much they're following directly aligned with the with the, the books. I'm sorry, the games. Kira would never survive in New York City. That's for sure. She's definitely not a city gal. Ah! Oh, I need to go destroy the, hold on. I'm doing this to myself. Meanwhile, seeing a rat IRL locking yourself out of your own house, I would do that. Not rats, it's uh, cockroaches for me. Ooh. All right, stop. Destroy the nest, stop caring about the rats. All right, let me kill the rats first. Get them off. You're on the first ah. one too. You got this, Kara, you got this. Please, Geralt, I'm pressing B. Disgusting. You have to kill the rats first before I can break these. All right. How many rats are there? Slaughtering every single rat. Yeah, I think a crossbow would work, but right now it does not want me to get over there. It's so annoying. I don't have the right bomb. Oh, does it need, um, hold on. I think that I need to craft. Do I even have that bomb to craft? Yeah, I could do a crossbow. What? I think I need to, I can't, I can't craft what I need. Hold on. Yes, 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 yes. How would I be able to do this if I don't have what they want me to have? Where is it? I just need to switch it to Samen. Samum? What bomb do I need? Destroy the rats with signs or bombs. All right, let's do signs. Let's do Ard. Nope, Igni. It's gotta be Igni. No, that works. I guess it's any sign. Huh. No, you can use Ard too. That's hilarious. All right, stop targeting the rat. <laughs> Don't you. target the rat. Kara, move. You that afraid of mm. rats? Could have annihilated. She's a witch and she Yeah. I need to go Fine. back and watch the say anything. Wait, you said she's in the books, but not so the TV series, right? There's something here. Something that distorts teleportation. I've no idea how they managed to get to the other side problem free. Wild Hunt's mm. teleportation magic is different. Got specially trained mages for that. Navigators, Navigators they call them. They can have three helmsmen and a parrot for all I care. I'll not risk that again. Let's go. Wild Hunt got a good head I start guess everybody the has their weakness chance. and hers are rats. Are completely mad. We must leave here at once. Yeah, Clue, I'm looking forward to watching the TV series. I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to do it tomorrow. And Vlad, uh, where does The Witcher rank for you? Oh. Gas. Gaslight. Gaslight, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs to the channel and community. Y'all, Mind Melt got one too. Hassan got one. Glory. Elysian. Guys, I hope y'all enjoy the sub and the emotes. And thank you so much. The chicken leg. It's all for the chicken leg. <laughs> chicken legs and chicken arms. What are you going to do? Seriously, thank you so much. Apocalypse, welcome back in. Need to find out what the hunt's doing here. We need to find out. I got to know what the wild hunt's doing here. But we came to find the elven mage. I can top that alert. Hunt. I need to make if new they alerts. Reach him first, we won't get a chance to talk to him. Besides, 
Go on, finish. Wait, you've got some special interest in the hunt. Mm. Is this about Siri? There's something you've not told me, isn't there? Everybody's so interested Come with in Siri. Are you always like this? I'm beginning to feel sorry for Triss and Yen. Damn. Oh, very well. Let's go. Following what's up, Vulcan. I hope you enjoy the emotes. And also, Anon, thank you so much for the gift of sub to Angel. Angel, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Shots fired. Oof. Larena Luna. Daughter of Gold? Levate, Larena Is that... Luna. That's him. That's Is that Jack of Blades? Paul, the sign of your that? sword. An illusion? No. A morphotic projection. Exactly, Itachi. And also Assassin Wolf, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. A projection? A what projection? Something akin to a post box for mages. <laughs> Much safer than an ordinary letter, which anyone can intercept en route to its recipient. There was a message for Siri. Message was definitely for Siri. Daughter of the Gull. Laura Doran's heir. Indeed. It is what the elves would title Siri. But what was the bit hey. about the sign of her sword? A riddle? I'm trying here, Falky. Yeah, not a hard one, no. Not if you know Siri named her sword Tireo. Swallow. Come now. Who aside from you would know that? Swallow. Might have been the point. Your elven mage secured the passage, hid it, so that only Siri could find it. He failed to foresee that someone like you would show up. Nevertheless, I think he was expecting uninvited guests. Made some preparations. Let's hope the wild hunt ran into some obstacles. Well then, I, let's go. I know that's going to be like hours. We'll see. It's going to be hours and hours before we find out what the wild hunt wants with her, but... Uh, Alright, she's standing right by us. Well, you were in a hurry. Go this way. <laughs> it's the elf Palpatine. Please, you're my only hope. Yeah, Orion. I just An talked about that at the beginning. Must have been how they got it by feels I how long absolutely how long unreal. Probably 200 hours in before we find out Careful. exactly what. That oily yellow vapor, it's um, toxic. Um, I hardly need instruction from you. I oh. recognized the Vulpine Morel immediately. Hold on. Let's do this. Actually, let's try using crossbow. Vesemir told me that soon after he'd learned to cast Igni, he tried it out on a patch of these mushrooms. Terrible idea. Oh, I kind of want to try it now. Well, he survived. And awfully quick on young witchers. At least it doesn't come, come back. You explode it once, you're good to go. This cave section reminds you of Tomb Raider. Uh, Orion, seriously, welcome back in and thank you. You didn't even get the notification I was on? I'm even online on Discord. I wonder why. Let's go this way. Race are really annoying. Just because you need them to be in the circle, right? The race are the one. Seems we're headed the right way. The swallow. All right. I guess I should. I feel like I should explore the other segments as well, though. But maybe we'll come back. All of these plants that I'm passing, but they're mushrooms, and a, a girl can only have so many shrooms, you know. One can only have so many. All out of swallow. <laughs> Here's another message. Oh, there is another message. All right, I think we're safe. So let me. It's rather similar to that other pillar with the projection. You know what this means, y'all. You know what this means. All right, let's go into here. Tristan, what's up? Welcome back in. You know what this means, right? Might be stuck in this cave the entire stream. Somebody did say this is a really long uh, quest, right? I think this is a really long quest. Uh, let's go to character. Yes! Okay, we unlocked another slot. So, I want to test something out. Let's actually take this and put this here. And Anon, thank you so much for the gift of stuff to Jig. Jig, what's up? Welcome back in. I never meant to give you mushrooms. <laughs> Let's go over here. Yes, unknown human. I know. Gwent is on its way soon. Thank you so much, Anon. Alright, so let's actually throw into... Increases chance of landing fast attack critical hits by 4%. Hmm. Yeah, somebody was asking where which your kind of lines aligns on my rack and stack list of games. It's it's on its way to being number one. As much as it pains me to say that. It is definitely on my way to being number one. Increases strong attack. 
Damage from hits received while dodging is reduced by 100%. Wait, fleet footed is great. If I get schwacked while I'm trying to dodge? That's actually amazing. Stuck in a cave all stream and Kara hates Gwent. She's the one person that won't play Gwent with us. We'll have to fast travel out of it if we can. Uh, Misko, what's up? Welcome in. I'm feeling loopy. No worries. Get some rest, seriously. And thank you so much for all the support and just being here. Get, um, is it a cold? Did you say you got smacked with a cold, by the way? Definitely tea. A little hotty toddy. Never hurt anybody. And then also, I always swear by Zycam. Zycam helps cut short, uh, cold short by so much for me. Cold blooded. Each bolt and then vitality. Adrenaline points are immediately consumed to restore it. Wheat, that's actually pretty sick too, but we're gonna actually throw into this. I'm cheating on Fable. Uh, Jenk, what's up? Welcome in. And Anon with the gifted sub as well to Eldritch. Eldritch, welcome back in. What if Gwent wasn't part of the game? Where would it rank? Oh. Uh, my ex number one was Fable. But that was also because of nostalgia. Okay, nostalgia plays a major factor into favorite games. All right, let's get that, like, clear. Mm, I'm cheating on Fable with it. No. <laughs> Witcher is my number one, too, for the much reason that Fable was my number one for a long time. I mean, you have to. Actually, my brother and I were talking about this today. And Bozan, welcome back in. And Philly, hello as well. It has the same charm. Yes, exactly, Falky. It feels very much like Fable to me in a lot of ways. Oh, I can't place that up here? In a lot of ways, it feels like just a much better and well-organized fable. I know people are like squirming hearing that, but I think it just has all the same things that I loved about fable in it, but at a much more thought out and well put together level. So like the storylines are awesome. They still have the humor. I will say that I think I think Fable just has this awesome humor about it, but it's because it is Fable, like just like the name implies, like it's a series of more make-believe stories and things like that. Somehow, like Witcher just feels a lot more realistic fantasy, like realistic fantasy. If you say that it's on your way to number one, just wait till the DLCs, you're gonna love it. But this is good too, because people always talk about, I know I gotta take the nostalgia goggles off. I know people always ask me what my favorite game is and I always revert to Fable because I just, I think it's a cop-out answer for me. It's just easy to say it and explain it. But if I'm being honest with myself, there's so many games that have stolen that title. Like so many games. Nostalgia is so right. It's about the lasting impression. That's true. Like Last of Us is definitely up there. Hellblade's really far up there. Like Hellblade is a work of art. Yeah. Wait, is that actually a made-up language as well? Does he mean that sea monster? No, that's what Siri named her mare. Horse could apparently gallop like a demon. Hmm, good mm. name for a horse. So, should we look for it? It's Elvin. But is it like their version of Elden? Gavella Glan. Mm -hmm. We'll forever tell my favorite game from Ratchet and Clank 2. <laughs> it's still talking. Oh, let's go right here. There's definitely something right here. No Walking Dead. Um, Sid, Sid, it has been so long. Holy cow, how have you been? And welcome back in. I think if you broke it into categories, I would say Walking Dead is my favorite telltale. I would say that. Um, I think Hellblade is probably maybe one of my favorite emotional games. Hunting dog. Can't see any connection to Kelpie. We're looking for the brain symbol. Ow! You touch everything. Oh, yeah. I guess I do need to touch everything. Geralt, are you all right? It's not a fleshed you out language like so. Lord of the Rings, Elvish. Uh, it's just isn't a. Oh, what is the other? What Game of Thrones has multiple right languages? Wookie, what's up? Welcome back in. God of War is up there for emotional games. The Last of Us. I don't know if I ever emotionally connected it to a game like I did to The Walking Dead and Last of Us. A sea monster. Looks a bit like a Karen. There we go. Geralt, what the hell is that? Sid, how are you? Another security measure. Damn it all. Oh. The race. Alright, let's go to her. We'll take her on. For the race, we should just be able to do. Never mind, it doesn't matter. It's a mind game of some sort. You know, can you defeat yourself? Alright, well myself is pretty hard. 
Sorry, I just don't Ooh. share your doubts. I know exactly which one of you is real. Now focus on the fight. Uh, did you do it? Anything like that ever happened to you before? What well, is she doing almost. right now? While back a certain doctor yes. took yes, a shot at impersonating Force, me. Yes, I have. what's up? Welcome in. And? He hated being me. Felt uncomfortable. Dopplers are kind-hearted by nature. Really? Interesting. Um, I loved Jedi Fallen Order, and I cannot wait. I'm super excited for Resident Evil 4 Remake and then the next Jedi game. So I think I actually want to go back and replay Jedi Fallen Order in preparation for it. Super Snack, what do I mind? What was it? All right, so we already killed those. She's looking at this. This is where we need to go through. Mike, what's up? Welcome back in. Uh, Linguist fleshed out. Dothraki. Mm, she needed to puke after that one. There's no way that I can cut through this. I see the other one as well. The swallow I can't interact with. Hold on. She said something. Use your Witcher senses to find something associated with series. Force. Ah, uh, there. Mm. I know that I can talk to her. Is she waiting for me to talk to her? Yeah, that must be what it is. Mm. Oh, there it is. What? We knew that, though. Oh, maybe I didn't... That's really weird. Well, coming. Mm, don't tell me what to do. Don't spoil it. I see that it's red. I know that she's putting that out. The world's largest pizza. All right, Mr. Monkey, have a good one. I cannot... Her Kelpie. RE4 is going to be incredible. Guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. <sighs> it is coming soon. It is coming soon. Guys, please no tips, tricks, or spoilers. I see it. I know she probably completely talked about it as well. Can I jump in there? It, oh, yeah, yeah. We just needed to go down. All right, here we go. Drawing yeah, I was course. just waiting for. Clue for Siri must be. The clue for Siri. All right, let's dive down. <gasps> Vivi, it might have been a, if it was a spoiler tip or trick. Um, my mods just know to time out for that, just because I'm trying to keep the playthrough as organic as possible. So I know sometimes it is brutal seeing me struggle to try to figure like, something out, but that's part of the fun for me. Is just absolutely Healthy. wrecking my brain trying to figure out a puzzle even though I'm overthinking it and it's not a puzzle at all and I'm just overthinking it on a different level there we go all right so we should be able to talk to her part of the fun is playing the game what <laughs> let's go all right let's go let's go all right so we saw it down there we saw the way to get back was there something I missed down there there must have been something I missed down there Blue. Blue, thank you so much for the reset for two months in a row and welcome back in. Yeah, oh, check it out, check it out, check it out. Need for speed, welcome back in. Blue, thank you so much. That makes sense for there to be saddlebags at the end of it as well. I'm so glad to see you're still enjoying the channel and community and also Strumdum, welcome back in and thank you for 28 months of continual support. Mm. So this is where I'm kind of leaning right now. No. Oh, floppy pickle. No, we're not floppy pickling this. There it is. It's because you have to talk to every single thing before Another you can horse. figure it out. Almost exactly like the last one. Let's see what this does. Geralt. There you go. I don't know what you did, but it worked. Come back here. You just have to interact with all the horses. Gosh, that'd be so no, cool to do a Gwent tournament. Here. I'm not that good though. And Chell, what's up? Welcome back in. Imagine unironically experiencing a video game for the first time. It is difficult because I think I used to be the person like with Fable and stuff like that. Like I'd look stuff up on Google because I never had a chat or anything. But y'all remember floppy Let's pickle go. is the keyword. That means you guys can help spoil. And Jafras, Jafras, welcome back in. Oh, so here's where I'm at. For a hot bath. I talked about this week about putting out and starting Ragnarok. And I still want to do that. But at the same time, I feel like I will be doing Life is Strange dirty. And I just like Life is Strange just picked up today. Like, I did not realize how good it got until, well, yesterday, I think it was yesterday. And now all of a sudden I'm like, I want to finish Life is Strange well, really quickly. Now I know what distorted my effort at teleportation. Due to work that only got 
And I know why I landed in that drowner nest. You should be pleased to emerge from the portal in I one hope piece. that's still good, Blue. And everyone still wonders why I hate to be teleported. Hopefully that means works flying by. Alright, so we need to activate Think the portal. Swallow. Come. Sure it's safe. Oh. Of course. Soon said I know I keep saying Siri. that. Come on now. I know I keep saying that. There's just a technical aspect of sending them out that I'm having to flesh out. Vela Glan. Flush out. Awfully quiet. But I'm Is having to flush there? out. A bit like the calm before a storm. Ertie. Ertie, what the hell? Last time I was still M Sid. I still am. What does it say? And Congrats on 30k. Have a good uh, stream. Ertie, thank you so much for the donation and the kind words. Thank you. What do you mean have a good stream? Are you leaving? Oh shit! Yes, I'm so excited for Ragnarok. Ertie, thank you. Y'all, no troll message either? What's going on? Holy cow. Wait for, wait for you to spring. Mm, hold on, wait till spring for the update on their game? There's supposed to be an update? Alright, let's see what it's susceptible to. Guys, please no tips, tricks, or spoilers. Please no tips, tricks, or spoilers. I knew we'd managed. Alright. That was not too bad. You know when I took down the golem, it made me think of God of War 2018 when you're taking down the golems with the rocks and everything. I appreciate the help, but y'all, I'm really trying to figure it all out on my own, unless I ask Floppy Pickle. 100 videos of Ragnarok incoming. That's the other thing is I am trying to be really I want to be meticulous like I do in all my other playthroughs for Ragnarok. I think that I will be able to still finish it in a decent amount of time. But yeah, I think it's going to take up like two months. But Last of Us did too. I don't know if you guys remember. Last of Us took up months and months of uh, YouTube. Is adding a new game plus in spring. But I've never really done new game pluses. So I don't think it's the... I don't That's think it's... So? Make sure and tell me beforehand I don't think it's time. that worth it my for me to wait. My a fine right, instrument, go. Witcher. Don't underestimate it. All right, I'm not underestimating it. Scott, thanks for the follow and Anon, thank you so much for the gifted subs. Ertie, thank you. I don't know if you said that you're I've popping out or something, but thank you so much. About you, for instance. In several domains. Oh, do you? In what domains? In what domains? Once you finally find Siri, what will you do? Any plans? Depends what she wants. Imagine there we go. It. How it will transpire. What will she what look will like? She say? What will she look Let's like? go this way first. No. The music's so good here too. And also Wally and Sala. Wait, to Sala. I'm sorry. Welcome back in. Ainan, thank you. We hardly know each other. It's certainly not enough to discuss personal matters. Not to worry. Ragnarok will take we'll you to the there. middle of spring anyway. That's true. By the time they do any updates. Got that feeling again. By the time they do any updates, I will already be towards the end, but Gargoyle? At least she helps you fighting these things. What the hell? I mean, honestly, it's pretty good damage. She's kind of crushing him. What are they susceptible to, though? There's something go, else. Go, Let's go. Oh, Let's we went into the wrong one. But there should be some kind of loot in here, right? There's gotta be. Ragnarok took you 70 hours. Hold on, y'all. That was good stuff. Took you 70 hours. Mm. I'm guessing it will take me about 60. The spring update is only for NG+, so nothing affects your first playthrough. And honestly, it will come out even if I decide to do a new game plus. I don't I don't think I will because there's so much stuff I need to record for YouTube anyway <laughs> that I don't see myself taking like like going back through. I was even thinking about that with Walking Dead. I really want to go back and through and do playthroughs of all the series of choosing like the most like asshole decisions, like being completely opposite of me and my playthroughs before. But I just don't, I'm trying to find the time to do those. Like if I can do those while I'm still on track for my normal content coming out, then that's the goal is to get to that point. But mm. I still need to, I still need to do a recap of Walking Dead 2. 
Like, I really want to go back through and talk about my favorite characters, favorite scenes, and just kind of do, like, a nice finisher to it. And I still have Michonne as well. Teleport over there. Yeah, I want to do a... I want to do a You're Not Wrong, Just an Asshole playthrough. All right, so we have another one of these. Let's activate the swallow. You're not wrong. You're just an asshole. You forgot about the gargoyle of people. <laughs> I should have talked to him first. You're right. How insensitive. Mm. This is some like Star Wars Padme music happening right now. I feel like there's something here. Hold on. You did 100% on Gimme God of War. Wait, wait, wait. 76 hours. Okay, that's not bad then. If it was 76 hours for Gimme God of War. It won't let me look at them. Find a way to activate the portal using your Witcher senses. Oh. Interesting. I see that. Does it want me to pick it up or something? Another swallow. Look, it was. I did that before. <laughs> I tried so many times. Fidel, what's up? Welcome back in. Yeah, I want to make sure I close out Walking Look, Dead. I want to do a react to the first part of the, wild hunt. the first series, Great. like the TV series. I'd love to do a reaction to that. The Vela Gland. I think you just wild have to. Hunt. Oh, definitely. They destroyed the major sentries. The Did sentries. For a friendly chat with the elf? I don't think so either. It took you 80 hours with all the side missions, but okay, I don't have chat, right? When I'm recording, I don't have chat, so I feel like I'm more on track with normal playthrough time. Hmm. New hoodie, you're not wrong, just an asshole. <laughs> what What else did... Uh, there was another quote that I said, and Frozen. Anna said I needed to put it on a hoodie. I think it was when I was like, I love you, but just right now, I do not like you. Molten, what's up? Welcome back in. And Chad, thank you for the posture check. Shut up. All right. We're on their tail, but I don't really want to have a fight with them. I'm really not trying to encounter them. You're not wrong. Just to know. SI Pisa. Oh, Skilly, never mind. Ten Run. to them. Okay, this is our first time taking them on. I saw on YouTube comment that you may want to do reactions to shows like, yes, yes, I do. I'm already planning to record my reactions to The Last of Us show tomorrow. I told you guys, icicles! Icicles! Yeah, he looks like Sauron. Wait, you blame us for the long hours? What is this? Me blaming the chat? Never. Mage from the hunt summoned it. Never. Can you see all those cracks it's blowing through? They're too far. We must get closer. I shall shield us with Demetia Crest Surge. Stand I don't need side. to know what it is. Just shield me. <laughs> Just shield me. All right, so as long as she walks with us. I feel like we're staying close with Sophia. So I need to keep her alive. I hate quests of um, any kind of quest where you have to escort somebody or anything like that. Off. Absolutely hate them. We must Keep close them. Want me to go? I'll do it. Just cover me. Oh god, I don't. Oh god. Okay, wait. Cover her. Cover her. Cover. Her. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You've got a hound on you. Bad dog. I I don't have any swallow either, guys. Hold on. Hold on. I'm getting frozen. Okay, that's eating away at my health. Hold on. Let's do a couple things real quick. Um, Dave, what's up? Welcome back. And you're just here for the Gwent. We're actually questing today. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Flacco, what's up? Welcome back in too. No, we're actually questing. Shadow Knight, thank you so much. Ah! I need him to come closer. Uh, this is bad news, bears. Loot his body, loot his body, loot his body. Okay. All right, I just need to recover a little bit more. Thank you so much. At least she's not yelling Leon every two seconds. Oh no, she's helping a lot more than if Resident Evil Remake doesn't fix that. There better still be trash cans. As long as she can be put in trash cans, I'll be happy. Cover me immediately, leaves. <laughs> hey, Nicola. I go trying to close it my second. It's okay. All right, we're consuming bread. 
Aurora! Aurora, welcome back in. Bad. Bad. Aurora, seriously, welcome back in. How's it going? At least they're not hurting me. They're going for her, and she barely has any health taken. Oh. Oh. I'm not trying to freeze. This one's hard. I hate any kind of escort missions. I always get people killed. Just I'm out of swallows, yeah. I used swallows before this and then I didn't re-up them, so I, I haven't had swallows for this mission, really. Ah, wait for me. Wait for me. French frog, French frog, welcome back in and thank you so much. It must be because you streamed so much Gwent. Yes, the 30k followers is all because of Gwent. <laughs> Seriously, thank you so much, and welcome back hey, in Nicola. for 10 months. It really feels like you've been here for three years. It really does. All right, two dried fruits, more dried fruit. Go, go, go. Do I, I hate escort missions together, not separate together. Roasty toasty. I don't have free. Chicken sandwich time. It freezes me every time I go outside of the circle, so I'm trying to... Woo! Trying to, like, put one foot and then back out a little bit. Once upon, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Yeah, I think it's because the most... I would say almost... I would say most of my deaths in a game are typically when you have to, like, escort somebody. Move this person to safety. Even with Fable. Oh, Pass. Fable had the worst ones. That took a great deal of power. Oh no. Fable, Fable, Moon, Moon, thank you so much for the Hunter bits and welcome back in. Wait, just don't faint on me. If you can't just go on. Just don't faint on me. <laughs> now. Sorry. In your firm embrace. I didn't know what else to say. Not in your life. I hope you have a great day at work, Moon, and thank you so much for stopping by. I'd be able to say we could stay here a while and rest. I know, I know. Yeah. We must go on. They definitely test my patience, that's for sure. I love how she just fainted and then we had a conversation. She's like, I will go on. Uh, I must go on. Passage. Maybe I can try. Leave it to me. Mm, will you be playing Dead Space Remake? I am thinking about doing that for you too. That's what I was kind of thinking about. But I also haven't considered that Ragnarok is going to take us. Ragnarok's about to take us two months on YouTube. This game's going to take us another two months. I've got to stop planning ahead and Come, focus on getting these done. The Fable Escort missions, the people are always, yes. But also, Fable Escort missions, they get smacked like Thanks three times help. and they're dead. They have uh, zero health to you. them. You'd never have managed without me, would you? That's true. Come now, admit it. She fake fainted. Yeah, she just wanted to be held in my arms. I get it, I would us. be too. The drama queen, <laughs> not me. <laughs> San, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Yes! Okay, we have Sauron. And we're gonna find out more about the Wild Hunt. Dude, that armor set is so sick. Should I do a Wild Hunt cosplay? That'd be so cool. It's all armor, too. You guys know I do the best with all, all armor. Mm. You're stubborn, Dwan. This isn't the cool one, though. There's one that looks more like Sauron with his head. I shall help you. Step back. Stop telling me what to do. Oh, but I didn't think she was going to help us with this. Gin and Tonic, what's up? Welcome back in. All right, let's take this real quick. Ooh, wait, I don't know what that is. Oh, did not like that. Geralt, look, he's opening a passage. Oh, shit. She needs to block that. She needs to block that. All right, at least I'm using my coin on that. Let's do Thunderbolt. Try to fire the dog's fight. I was trying to fight the dog, not him. Take a hunting pill. Is she gonna block it? Is she gonna open it up or something? This is not the hardest difficulty, but the one before. Okay, he recovered after that. Shit. I like that silver. See, he's susceptible to this. Also, maybe I could put a potion on. I did thunderbolt, but oh ho. ho. That was chunky damage. All right. I don't know what to do with that. All right, let's see. 
He's right there. There's gonna be dogs that come out. I need to protect her. Yeah, the third easiest. We were talking about that. I think I should put on the hardest difficulty though. I need to eat onions. Now I'm just chomping on onions to recover. Hard bolts, welcome back in by the way. Eat the onions. Does it not damage him to do that? He's gonna go down. No, kill him first. Nice. 225 XP points for that? Blood and Broken Bones is plenty hard. So I go back and forth, y'all. Thank you so much for the follows and welcome in. If I've got my knickers on straight. Um, okay. Nobody needs to bring up. I think, uh, I don't know. I go back and forth because I think when I'm fighting somebody one-on-one -on -one like that, I could do Death March and be fine. But when it's a group of wolves, I would die in a heartbeat. So I'm going back and forth. I also want to enjoy my first playthrough, so I think that's why I'm going to stick with Blood and Broken Bones or whatever. The sword I have is OP. Uh, this one is the, I gotta see which one this is. Also true, I agree, Apocalypse. All right, we're lighting this one. Chad just wants marbles no matter what. If they do, if we do Death March, they will get marbles for sure. I eventually had to put it on the hardest difficulty once I played. I played it for a good 200 hours, main story plus DLC. I think that once you get a decent chunk of armor and good weapons, right. you might as well put it on Let's the hardest difficulty. Does it not scale evenly as you continue Sierra, on? This place is no longer safe. Do not tarry here long. Armin, yeah. Trust no one. And above all, beware the witches of Crookback Bog. Crookback Bog. Try to reach the place where last we were together. Oh. If you don't have a hundred oh, rotting flesh together. in your inventory. How much to go on. <laughs> I agree. I agree. Thank you for the follow welcoming. Damn it. Perhaps it's best he didn't leave a clearer message. The now I'm over level. Surely they saw the projection. Yeah. They searched everything. And if they had more time, they'd probably have torn the place to the ground. But that doesn't change the fact that we haven't learned anything. Not about Nits. the elf, oh. not about Siri. Well, we know they were well acquainted and traveling together. I thought we were going to learn more about the hunt right there in our conversation and fight with him. But it was way too easy. You should at least put enemy upscaling on. Yeah, so there's a setting that I could change the enemies. It is too easy, but at the same time, do I want to up it at all? Uh, James, James, welcome back in. There's an option called enemy upscaling in the options menu. If you turn on, the enemies will level up as you go along too. I think that's the best thing to do. Instead of just changing the difficulty across the board, just have the enemy scale with me. I couldn't get into it. Is it worth pushing through? Yes, Mafia, yes. I mean, I got into it right away. I think that I'm actually in the minority with that because a lot of people have said that you kind of have to push through, but I highly recommend getting back into it. And if you haven't heard of a little thing called Gwent, check it out. It might just help. Hi. Elf warns Siri about some witches. Wonder why they split up. Wonder why they split up. Perhaps because the wild hunt was on the elf's trail and Siri would be safer if they did. You know, I also think for the purpose of progression, we should stick with this difficulty because if I up the difficulty and I start spending more time doing things, that's only going to prolong the playthrough and I want to make sure we're staying on track and I have to counteract all of my Gwent hours somehow, you know? The witches of Crookback Swamp. Crookback Bog. <laughs> Victor. Kira, Crookback if you're Bog. hiding something. But I didn't say... Do you know these witches? Didn't mention them earlier. Why? Why didn't you say anything earlier? I don't know. Naughty Peach. With a witch. Well, I had no idea you meant them. If I told you something, you would have rushed off to find them. But we needed first to confirm that Siri was here, didn't we? <sighs> really? I shall tell you everything now, of course. Of course. Now, after I safely led you through the cave. I can't believe you'd think so poorly of me. Perhaps you do bear a grudge against sorceresses. Mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. Can't imagine where that comes from. They're tricky and sneaky and always 
causing trouble for him, I imagine, between Triss. The enemy upscaling does not exactly make enemies go with their level. Higher level enemies will stay at their level. Only the lower levels will go up. Okay, but that's what I would want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't, yeah, so even if you run into enemy, yeah, that makes sense. Mmm, you can go fashion first. <laughs> I should go back to fashion first, and then that would help me put, go back to a decent level and not be so over, uh, over leveled. This is the first time that I actually am a higher level than the mission I'm on. Fully, what's up, welcome. You know these witches. I've never met them, but I've read of them. Oh. In an old manuscript I found in one of the huts in the village. It Pro gamer, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. Crookback bog at times to liaise between the villagers and the crones, the ladies of the wood. The crones appear to be intolerant of outsiders, but they help the local folk. We got a crone. Apparently, they stop the spread of the plague in Bellum. Oh. What's your take on this? I'd love to shrug it off as the nattering of so many old women. Yet, hmm. throughout my first fortnight in Crookback Bellum, Mountain, I had horrible nightmares. Something was calling me out into the swamps. One night, I decided to enter the dream consciously. Oh. Render it lucid. I confronted the thing directly. It broke contact at once. Peaceful nights ever since. Hmm. Aurora! <laughs> uh, it might be illegal. I, honestly, I hope so, for my own sake of not wanting to continue being obsessed with it. It's all due to that sweet, sweet Gwent. <laughs> Chris, welcome in. The story and missions are like 14 and 15 and you're at 26. Is it, do you often find yourself being over leveled in this game? How do I find them? Yeah. The swamps are vast, dangerous. Groove, but they say well. the crones mark the way for peasants who wish to visit them. The manuscript mentions a chapel in Crookback Bog. And from that chapel, one must follow a trail of treats. Treats? Of course. A trail they of didn't treats. Did you read your bedtime stories at Care Morhen? All normal folk know that witches live in gingerbread houses poised atop chicken legs. Oh. I'll have to see that to believe it. Take the tome and read it. I I truly do believe you'll find your Cirilla. Ladies of the wood. All right then. As a start, let's look for a way out of here. That was Good not idea. as long of a quest as I thought it was going to be. Ladies of the wood. Why do we even come? All right, so we need to go this way. Y'all, thanks for the follows and welcome in. When you get to a much higher level than the quest in the... Uh, no, I think you would get the same amount of XP no matter what level you go back to it. So you always want to be doing quests near your level so they give you a higher... Pers like, a not a higher percentage, but a percentage that doesn't seem so minuscule. Because if I'm level, like... 20 and I'm doing a 7, I'm gonna get such a small, like, morsel of XP for it, right? Groove, welcome back in. And Omnito, Omnito, hello and welcome back in. And Eric, thank you for the follow, welcome in. As a completionist, overleveling comes pretty easily. Strange. That's true. The medallion's trembling, but there's nothing here. The more Let's that you... Oh. If you do a lot of side stuff. Gwen, playing Gwen does I give you XP, well. I think. Does it I not? I we might run into such things, so I bought this. <laughs> Where'd she keep the tome? <laughs> Meaning what? The Eye of Nahalani. It dispels illusions. Oh. It's easy enough to build, so you're welcome to this one. It's bound to come in handy. And Thank each you. time it does, you will think of me. Huh. Thanks. I can't escape the sorceresses. Wandering in the dark. All right, interact. Okay, that is super cool, though. That must be how we go through that other area that I was looking for. That's so cool. Uh, we need to we need to meditate so I can get swallows. The sorceress. From the left, must be an exit that way. Good. Let's get out of here. She's like, no. The magic lamp. The magic what now? Oh, I do need a lamp. The elf promised it to me in exchange for my help. And since his return here seems doubtful, I must retrieve it myself. If I can find it, that is. Will you help? Oh, I don't have to help. I'm gonna go straight to the bog. I don't have to help. <laughs> Some of the side quests are arguably better than the main story. That's what a lot of people have said, that I think it's the level of detail they put into the side quest that makes this so incredible. I really liked the, um, the side quest about the werewolf that I did. That one was cool. However, doing Gwent quest does give a slight ones. Not playing Gwent, but doing the quest associated with Gwent. If I go to the bog, I can get back to playing Gwent. If I help her, 
I, I'm a good person? The Robin Williams land. Yes, I'm gonna yeah, go work out my noodle arms. Splendid. Come then. And so I'm already in my workout gear. Alright, we're gonna help her. You guys know I can't pass up helping her. Holy cow, how many points does that give us? We're almost gonna be level nine. The main quests give the most XP. The side stuff doesn't do as much as you'd think. If you do a level scaling for enemies, you can get some OK XP though. So you'll get more XP if I up the scaling on the- Oh! Looks like another damned riddle to me. Would you kindly? Thank you so much for the thousand bits and welcome back in. Hello. I'm gonna help her. Don't get your panties in a bunch. Seriously, thank you so much and we welcome back. Description here. Show me. Show me. Can you translate the inscription? You'll get I good can stuff. I decipher maybe a third, but that third doesn't make much if sense. If I get a Gwen card, it'll be worth it. I was never Davey, really welcome good at the high variant of the Elder Speech. Hmm. All right. This might seem a bit literal. I'm afraid I can't replicate its sophisticated internal rhymes. Her hair is Just so perfect. Translated to bothers make sense. me. She's such Four a goofball. Guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first to light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, second, by the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. And thus hmm. they stood o'er their queen. Who slept beneath flickering stars. Hmm. Sounds like a riddle, all right. I didn't know there were riddles. Repeat the inscription. Okay, let me hear it one more time. Uh, I wondered why I was dressed. <laughs> why I was dressed as I was? Am I not just able to wear what I want? <laughs> Archer, what's up? Welcome back in. Is Gwent card that qualifies as good stuff to you? Well, yeah, if you say there's you get good stuff, I'm thinking. I'm thinking a Gwent card. Okay, let me hear it one more time. Repeating the riddle. Mm, say four friend guardians, and enter. Four flames, standing proud in a line. Bello. The first to light his fire dared not march on the end. First didn't march. The second, by the first, Fatal played a woeful lament. lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. And mm. thus they stood o'er their queen, who okay. slept beneath flickering stars. It can't be that hard. Heron Witcher 1 was the best. All right. Let's I think they did a good job with this. Geralt's, but hers like barely moves. It's so strange. Venus Sorceress helps a lot with needing perfect hair. Just a snap of the finger and it's there. Guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in. <laughs> riddled me this all right we have our four right here correct yes so we need to ignite the right ones in the right order so let me look at them so no they're all okay that is playing a music okay that's playing a musical instrument that is fair i hardly ever have my hair up i guess unless uh, no there are some times unless i get frustrated with a boss then you know we're putting hair up okay so the first one it's either this one so i think it's possibly this one and then music, but something about the dog. Something about the dog. There it goes. Oh, oh, Damn wrong it. order. Oh, okay, we're gonna get a wraith every time that I do. We're gonna get a wraith every time I do the wrong one. We might need to hear it again then. Seems we did something wrong. But this the was the right one. Lit up like a charm. That is the right one. Then it must be this one. Wait, something just happened. Yes. And then the third one played an instrument. Oh. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Never mind. I thought the third one played an instrument as well. Why are you awkwardly staring at me? I heard to close my lines. All right, it was that one and then this one. It looks like a wig. It does. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, Falky. It's the motto. Voila! Third time's the charm. His hair moves inside buildings. <laughs> Remember the, the magical His wind that we it. saw? What do you think? No inscription, sadly. A massive gravestone, though. Hmm. Sign of the go. If I didn't already know where she was buried, I'd guess this is Lara Doran's sepulcher. Lara. Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. 
heroine of a tragic legend to some, but most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Gregenon of Laud. Oh, Perhaps the elven did she marry a human? Skin. It would explain why he's helping Siri. Possible. Didn't you all say that Siri for? has like a very small percentage uh -huh. of elven in her? So what's it supposed to do? Like a super small percentage. Let's leave this place, shall we? Well, she got her lantern. Sage's notes. All right, let's read the notes if it'll allow us to. Three, welcome in. All right, day three thousand two hundred and seventy-five. Final conclusions regarding the lamp. My experiences with the magic lamp unequivocally confirm that by using its active centers of condensed spiritual energy can be coaxed into contact and can communicate a limited set of beings last memories lara doran's remains however emit entirely inert spiritual energy despite the violent conditions of her death which should have been strengthened to the desired tendency lara remains silent at this point, further research on the lamp, enabling contact with the dead, seem entirely useless for my purposes. It's like a Ouija board, except in a lamp form. <gasps> Hunting gauntlets. No, but I think I should have done this map. I should have done this quest earlier. I think these are going to be... I don't think these are going to be the right... Mm, they shouldn't help. Yeah. Yeah, it's too easy. She's wearing a wig. The small elven in her. I thought... No, not that there is a... I thought there's a little bit of elvish in her, or... I thought somebody said that. That's nasty, what's up, welcome in. The rings of power. Mm, and Maru, magic. thanks for the follow, welcome in. <gasps> place of power. We haven't seen a place of power in so long. Mm. Ooh, that juicy ability point, let's go. Carries her. All right, let's throw in two. By the way, did you see that we have three now? So we're getting plus 20%. Let's do this. Oh yeah. I need points in branch needed to unlock four. Oh, that's so many points. I think after this one, after we max the precise blows, we should go back and look at what the other ones can give us too. I don't wanna, th I don't wanna throw everything into combat, you know? I'm sure there was one at one point. I thought somebody said that there was. All right, let's see if we can meditate real quick. Yeah. All right, we'll do that real quick. Serious history will be explored more throughout the game. So I need not worry. All right, we consumed the raspberry juice and then let's go ahead and get the bonus from that. Uh, we already have it. So the wind's a howling. Can you... I guess it re-ups. I thought this is where we get the ability point. There we go. All right, our yard inside intensity has increased. I had to hold it. Exalt, thanks Just for the follow, wonderful. welcome in. Where'd it go? I know it was right here. All right, this is where we'll end up going. I saw the big boy. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh, what? He smacked me with that? Troll in the dungeon. Mm. Nice. Nice. GG. GG. Oh, the posture check. I actually need to stand up in a second, and I do need to stretch. Luki, thank you. All right. Let's see. I wish I could find the way that Maggie looked at loot. Is that what she said? <laughs> to find somebody that looks at me the way that Maggie looks at Luke. <laughs> Siri and Yen weren't in the previous games, so everything we need to know about them is, oh, is explained super well. Okay. We should discuss it with what? What was that? Wait, was that door pass or was that Drash? After you finish the game. So any confusing parts in the lore, I will save for later. This is me just thinking out loud. Ooh, that must have been a good rune. That had to have been a good rune. Tuli, what's up? Welcome in. And also, John, hello. That had to have been a good rune. Let's go into inventory real quick. I need pants that enable something. Is that a 3%? 2% chance to poison. 2% chance to burn. Oh, they're up here. 2% attack power. Wait, that's actually really nice. If we stacked three of those on top of each other. 
I didn't know you could use swords on broken walls. I've always used art. <laughs> Actually, the, I'm pretty sure in the past I have used art, but for whatever reason, I just decided to do that. No need. Welcome back in, by the way. All right, let's see. Rune stacking is really nice. Mind melt. Hello. Welcome back in. Mm, let's go see if those pants are better. Nope. Dropping. Out of here. Be gone. We also can drop these too. And then we can drop the bolts as well. Not that they're dropping a lot, but... And we should probably repair. There might be something I should repair. 97, 94. Ooh, 67. What are my boots at? 76? My tracking boots? I'm gonna repair my trousers, okay? My trousers aren't looking too hot. Mm. All right. Oh, something right there. I honestly need a torch. So, oh, what was all? I need a torch. The loot, place of power, and Gwent. We haven't found Gwent yet. Warlord, thanks for the follow. And Wolfette, Wolfette, thank you so much for the reset for 12 months in a row. And welcome back in. Thank you so much for an entire year. How have you been? Using art on walls is better. Slamming your sword is going to damage it. Actually, that's a fair point. Going forward, I shouldn't do that. You're right, you're right. Checkered bands. Looking very fitness. It's probably because I'm going to the gym right after. I figured out it's for me. Find the exit. All right, we'll find the exit and then we're done. I have to. Oh, we're still overcumbered. Uh, does anybody else pick up uh, absolutely everything that the game has to offer you? <laughs> Wild Hunt Warrior Sword. How is that worth less than what I have? We can drop that. Hmm. How's Ginger? Ginger is good. She might actually be outside the... I might actually see her. Hold on. I need to grab her. I'm all dressed up for Taco Bell. You know me. I always put on my best when I go get Taco Bell. Dom Vods, what's up? Welcome back in. Lesser, Moonstone. I can't wait. I need to start looking at the names of those. Gravel, welcome back in and thank you. I'm so glad to hear that you're enjoying them. Um, Horse blinders. I need horse blinders from chat. I want to get to the point where I see something and I know exactly what it gives, you know? Chromie and also Andre. Andre, guys, welcome in and thank you. All right. It's got to be through here. If I had a... If I had a dime for every time I toss down Yarden instead of Ard. Okay, that's not it. So maybe this isn't the way to go. Ignite that real quick? Huh. Maybe it's not. Will you go to the stream? <laughs> wait, wait, will I go without go playing Gwen? Is that what you asked? And Tix, wait, Tix, thank you so much for the two gifted subs to the channel and community. Y'all, I hope you super and DD, guys, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. And welcome back in. Tix, hello, how are you? Maybe it is in fact in there. Oh, that's my own loot. When you get excited by your own loot, you drop. If I don't get to play Gwent. Hmm. Craig, have a good one. Yes, I will see you Saturday. Saturday's our early morning stream, y'all. I already looted it. Maybe it's this way. No. Hmm. Maybe we have to go all the way back out. I bet you. Place of power. Yeah. Should draw from it. Let me go ahead and. No, 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 I already have it. It doesn't matter. I'll continue on. Craig, seriously, have a great rest of your week. It feels so weird. It feels really weird not streaming again until Saturday. Ah, that's nasty. <laughs> That's nasty. Thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. And thank you. So many tier one subs lately. I Guys, I really appreciate it. Mm. All right, we can go out this way. This has to be the right An way. Illusion. Yes, and then we'll do the illusion. No Friday stream. No, no, I'm falling back into my... I'm falling back into the four streams on. Yeah, because remember how one of them is like my YouTube day too. Cal, what's up? Welcome in and thank you for the follow. But I did say that as long as we're playing Witcher, don't be surprised. Like, don't expect, don't ever expect my off days to be like for me to do an impromptu stream, but it is possible. It is likely that maybe sometimes I'll hop on even if I don't have it on the schedule. Oh, at last. <laughs> 
but it was worth it, right? I'm going to you run for the calves. Siri in the end. <laughs> something important. Sway, have Do a you good one. To venture into Crookback Bog. You must tell me about it afterwards. Don't know that I'll get the chance. Geralt, there Ooh. are two types of men. Those who see opportunity and take advantage, and those who forge the opportunities themselves. That's a fair point. I've I like seen that. you as an example of the latter. Besides, I've a favor to ask you. So, visit me sometime. Oh, whoa, what just happened? Okay, I just turned to raining. Uh, that is a sign not to tear. Yennefer heard that and she cast a spell on me. Absolutely not. I'm not messing with that. No, 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 no. It just turned to dark side. <laughs> no, 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 no. Seriously, get those calves. No stream till Saturday. That's going to be, wait, wait, that's going to be what? Ah, uh, that's going to be the first thing here when I get back. The f I have to feed the addiction of Gwent. Yes. The longer I am away from Gwent, the more games we have to play when I come back. Hold on. Let me grab this real quick. Um, let's just see what happens. Why, why is it I'll try? Yeah, I feel like I'll try is a good non-committal. You know, it's like Yen can't get mad at me for saying I'll try. But I'm also not one to pass up an opportunity like this. I mean, he's literally having to do zero work other than show up at her house. You know, how often does that happen? Weather be changing all of a sudden? <laughs> it's not. Oh, now you want treats. You heard? Yes, now you want treats. Oh my gosh, you're so grumpy, dinner. You're so grumpy. You haven't seen them in like a week, have you? Guys, I don't think y'all have seen Ginger in like a week. He's been like a week. Do you want to tell them how you're doing? Tell them how you're grumpy all the time? Tell them how you're grumpy all the time? Oh my goodness, the scratchies. Get the blue scratchies. Trev, thank you for the follow and welcome in. Um, it's like, oh my goodness. Okay. Ginger's on a mission to get swole too. She's upset that you left her with dad again. <laughs> Probably. She's still mad about it. Is there something you want? Hey, Ginger, is there something you want for me? What do you want for me? All right, let's see. Whoa. What are those? You say you have the YouTube video on with the Faz. <laughs> Double cast of. Can you say thank you, Spazzy, Zen, Ginge, Glypath, and Raj? Can you say thank you guys for the treats? Say, I already had treats earlier, so she really is only getting five treats. Whether she lets them fall or not, you're only getting five treats. You gotta get it. You gotta get it. No hesitation. Commit. Commitment. Commit. <laughs> oh my goodness. How is Ginger the cutest thing? She turns into, like, she looks so old and decrepit all day until she's on, and swear, until she's on camera. And she's like, okay, I gotta put my cuteness overload on. Oh, there we go. Okay, I'll hide behind you. I'll hide behind you. You're not scared of, you're not scared of Geralt? <laughs> yeah, you're so cute. That's my finger. So we're not biting fingers. London. <laughs> London, thank you so much for the thousand bits. Thank you. Okay. Are you done? Say one more treat. <laughs> Say one more treat. One more treat. Okay. One more treat. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> ow. That's not nice. That's not nice. She did eat that thingy. Don't, 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 <laughs> ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. What are you doing? That was a full bite. That was a full bite. Okay, that's all you're getting. She's getting too chunky. That was a full bite. She was going in total jaw style. You going in total jaw style? Do you want to tell them what you're doing? Say she keeps scabbing her, she keeps scratching her jaw, and it's caused a scab. 
All right. Say goodbye. Your Resident Evil playthrough. Wait, 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 wait. Your Resident Evil playthrough? But the Chris Redfield love is real. <laughs> okay, well, to be fair, I do love Chris Redfield. There's like two characters that I love more than anything, and that is Chris Redfield and Jack of Blades. Oh, we do have to do aliens. Giddy. <laughs> we do have to do aliens. She gets two bonus treats because she's old. And you never know when her last treat is. Just kidding. Just kidding. Do not bite me, please. Okay, give them alien. <laughs> oh, she's like, no. <laughs> give them alien. <laughs> she's only 16. She's only 16. Alien. <laughs> I love you. Okay, say goodbye, say goodbye, say alien. We both look like an alien when I have my hair pulled back too. We both look like aliens. All right. See, thank you. See, thank you, chat. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, she just had her sweet 16. All right, let's go. Phone. <laughs> E.T. phone home. She's our little alien. But you have to, at some point, I have to find a video of it where, like, I'm doing it when you're looking above. Because when you're looking at her from down under, it just really does look like an alien. Nick, what's up? Welcome back in. She has not been wanting to hang out with me, so you guys brought her back out. Or I should say the treats brought her back out. Okay, let's do this. Your room would be next level with a two cam setup. With Ginger, is that what you're saying? Have one for Ginger. You guys keep saying that. I do have a second camera and I maybe could get it set up. Like it's decent quality. It's not gonna be the same quality as this, but she just doesn't hang out. Like, you know, she doesn't hang out constantly in the stream room. Ginger's on her way to 17. The Ginger GoPro. Didn't you guys say you want to see a day in the life of Ginger? Sleep, sleep, more sleep. A couple treats. All right, guys, I, I'm gonna be non-committal here. AJ, what's up? Welcome back and in River and Cobra as well. Geralt's looking all dewy. He does have very shiny skin. Do you think Yen was loyal to me? That answer is going to answer this. Cameron, hello. Hmm. Adachi. Heck no. He's oily. He has water on his face. Yen is never loyal. Really? In the beginning dream, Geralt said he wasn't loyal. <laughs> well, don't mind Stop if I do. By. You can be sure. In oh. that case, I shall be waiting. See ya, Kira. As opposed to not waiting? Well, I guess. I don't know. Oh. I mean, she seems pretty powerful. Is she... Ooh, who's more powerful? Her or Yen? Because oh, you said she's in the books, right? The magic lamp quest complete. Yen, hands down. What determines the strength of a sorceress, though? You know? They have an open relationship. Well, in that case, let's just go on down to the... Oh, hey, we found this. Uh, now, okay, I know exactly where we are. So we did need the quest to find it, didn't we? I think we did. Varied, thank you so much for the thousand bits. Thank you. Seriously. And welcome back in. Without a doubt. Easy. Kira might be one of the weakest. Oh. Damn. Mm, Yen is much older and has more experience. So it does come down to like experience and age. Usually age being elf related knowledge. Gorg, Gorg, hello. Okay. Philippa? Philippa? Is it Philippa? You'll find out, but they say and show why Yen was so strong. Ah, okay. All right, y'all. Well, <clears throat> uh, we completed a quest. We do need to do the ladies in the woods. Oh, have I gotten an update on this? Maybe I need to do the ladies in the woods to continue on with my Baron quest. So, uh, <clears throat> there is a quest that I want to do. One quest to rule them all. 
Kailush, what's up? Welcome in. And also, homie, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. Uh, what? You're on Team Triss. I gotta meet her first, but real quick, before we meet her, every time I see this, I, I just, what's that song where it's like, it's written in the stars a million miles away? I don't, that is just what pops into my head every time I see this. But I also live my life with songs constantly rotating into my brain as soon as I see like a word or two. All right. On to it. Outer, outer, I feel like this just happened and no, it's not been a year. You just, this is your first time being in the stream. What are you talking about? We need to go to byways. Actually, we do not need to go to byways. Hold on. Run that back, run that back. We need to go to head. All right, outer. Oh my gosh, when you're being the new first time here. But seriously, I need to know, do you play this game often? This is actually the only thing I stream. Fun fact. Outer, thank you so much for an entire year of continual support and welcome back in. All right, Dar Pass, give me a second. Mm. I'm on T Tris in my playthrough. I mean, I think we could do two playthroughs and then it doesn't really matter. Kind of figure out. So you're saying that you can pick one or the other? Chad, are you confirming this? Is this a spoiler right now? Oh, hold on. Everybody pause. I got a saddlebag. I got a saddlebag. <laughs> Hold on. Darpaz. Give me one second. When we're fast traveling. I got a new saddlebag. <gasps> 30. 90. I can have up to 90 items. Hey there. Mm -hmm. The no you posture check. All right, we're going down. Sugar, we're going down, swing it. It was the books. It was the books. It doesn't have any impact on the story. Oh. Aw, so I don't get to have a romantic love story in this game? That's sad. Oh, we're going to Novigrad. Oh, well, well, well. Would you look at that? Looks like we're going to Novigrad. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. It's happening, it's happening. Schultz? I see nothing. Um, yes. Yes, I did have, did I have horse blinders on? I think I did. Oh my gosh, I have so, oh I know. I don't have my fashionable boots on right now. I know I should put them back on. I know. Yes, the game is incredibly fun. The game is incredible. Okay, you're right, you're right, you're right. All right, we need to roll through here. To Novigrad! Gwent plane innkeepers. I know, they're not equipped. Yeah, they're in the inventory. That's what he's saying. But since we're not fighting, yeah, it was too much. Like, it looks good with this top. Oh, okay, this is just all, uh, nothing's working here. Nothing is working here. Oh, I can, wait. Nothing's working in my, in my, nothing's happening. Aaron, what's up? Welcome in. And JD, thank you for the follow and welcome in as well as Quaz. Kaz, Kaz. It's crazy how amazing this game is and how disappointing Cyberpunk was. <laughs> or do you think that the disappointment around Cyberpunk was because a lot of people expected this quality? Did one lead to the other? All right, we're not going over here. Maybe there's somebody who wants to play me a Gwent left. in this. Hmm. Retro, what's up? Welcome back in. Back at it again. The polka dot tights are not working for me, but it's okay. I'm just gonna roll with it. We're rolling with it. My kind doesn't damn. spread disease. Okay. Soul team. All right, we're going the right way. Let's go. Natty, what's up? Welcome back in. It was not disappointment with cyberpunk in the slightest. Oh, you were not disappointed. I also like just don't have a lot of high expectations for anything in life anymore. So typically things uh, are, I'm kind of pleasantly surprised by things. All right, let's go. I haven't, I haven't done the house quiz. I usually in the past when I've done house quizzes, I usually fall into Ravenclaw or Hufflepuff. I think chat would say I'm probably a helpful puff. The cyberpunk anime on Netflix. I didn't know there was an anime on Netflix. What? That's so cool. When did the anime come out? 
Oh, edge runners. Oh, somebody was talking about that. I know somebody's screaming and yelling, but uh What are What is going on? This feels like that moment in Robin Hood Men in Tights when the boy just runs through and he's screaming and he's like, what are you screaming about? Like, what? Oh, because my sword is out? How do I? We'll flail your skin off. No, it's because of the bandits, not because of me. Come here. It's I'm not the problem. It's the bandits. <laughs> Y'all, thank you for the follows and welcome in. It's the boots. <laughs> Too fashionable of boots. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> sir. Good <laughs> sir. Mountains don't I think we've seen him before. Emperor Palpatine, yeah. what's up? Welcome in. Edge Runners is an emotional roller coaster. Wait, when did this one come out? I'm sure you guys answered that and I totally missed it. When did it come out? Oh, is the Velma show good? Oh, is it disgrace to the eyes? Really? Mm -hmm. I was intrigued why she got her own. Would you rather trade in the city? It's such an odd question to ask him. So close to Novigrad. Wouldn't you rather trade inside the city walls? Maybe he's banned. Guilds entrenched there. Oh. Why, their members fix prices to stifle any competition. Oh, stop. I do a robust mm -hmm. trade here. Isn't that HBO None Max to too? No walls to ring me in. The open's a pleasure in itself. I'm certain you agree. I haven't even looked at it. All right, I'm out. Farewell. We'll meet again. If you're not I talking, know. Gwen, I don't want to talk. Edge Runners actually ruined me. Do I need to watch this? You said it's on Netflix. Mm -hmm. Worst thing I've ever seen. Not even at. Okay, so don't even watch it. Don't even waste time with watching it. That's it, Roach. Were people expecting Scooby Doo? That is true, good point. I mean, they have the winning, like they have the perfect uh, formula there with Scooby-Doo. Have a dog in a game, uh, solving mysteries, done. Next question. Of the eternal fire be with you. All right, there's another shopkeeper over here. Let's go check this out. Uh, La, and also Ref, guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in. Where's Pan Am? All right, let's go over here. I see. <gasps> Look at the infrastructures. Oh, that's so cute. I love, oh, it's so pretty. I think I'm coming down with a fever. Aww. I would have one of these little homes. This would be my home. I already know. I already know. What's your favorite single player game? <sighs> What's my favorite single player game? I hate this question. <gasps> Guys, this has to be. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness. Wait, put out the fire. Portal 2. Oh, I don't know. I know today we're sporty spice, okay? Oh, I just realized that. Do you think a lot of people don't even understand that reference? I didn't even think about that. Your dream house is this area, is in this area code for sure. In Novigrad, is that what you're <laughs> Yes, I've seen Arcane. I love Arcane. I cannot wait for the next one to come out. I cannot wait for the next season to come out. All right, so we need to talk to him. You think I'll like Novigrad the best? Oh man, Ugo, what's up, welcome in. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Ugo. Seriously, thank you, Anon. There's been so many gifted subs. You make me feel old, Tweety, no. <laughs> We're singing, uh, if, I, what was I singing earlier? If I had a thing on the side that made you cry, would the rules change up or would they still apply? All right, let's talk to Greetings. him. Come to and also to popcorn, popcorn chicken nuggets. No, that's not your name. Popcorn chicken from KFC. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the seven the emotes and thank you. Anon. You're approaching the point where people won't understand the Spice Girls reference. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. We've gotten Lara Croft, Chloe from Uncharted, and now we're at Sporty Spice. All because I have hair. <laughs> Show me what you got. Hoping to play cards, actually. <laughs> Glad to take a glance at what you got. Let me guess. Of course, this. please do. You have a story mission here? Chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. Kitchen. I think I would also be an elf in these worlds. Kitchen. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Uh, 
Big Trubin, Trobin, Tam, Frozen, and also Alan. Alan, that's not Alan, that's Steve. <laughs> Guys, thank you, Kitchen. Kitchen? <laughs> Chaos, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs, y'all. The song was like a boy, Sierra. There we go. I like weed. Welcome back in. All right, here we go. Here we go. So these aren't armor, but they are fashionable pants. And I could have a wolf mask. That's kind of cool. And if I need... Oh, these are items I need for... Aren't, don't I need this for a quest? I need to pick out a map or a mask for a quest, I think. I want the wolf. Or... Do you show off the beak or do you think girls would take that long beak as compensation? I don't know. Mm. It's kind of like having, mm. I think I'm gonna go with definitely compensation. So go with the wolf mask. Never trust the beak. <laughs> General, thanks for the follow, welcome in. All right, ooh, the shirt. I would go with like the shirt or this. Yes, okay, so my favorite solo game. You guys know I'm gonna cop out and say Fable. I'm gonna cop out. Fable. The big beak energy. The big bird energy. <laughs> uh, let me see if I can sell something. Hmm. 41 coppers to sell that? Don't mind if I do. We'll sell... Am I wearing the trapper's boots? Am I not wearing the trapper's boots? Alright, let's go. Except it's only 10, but he still One should give me a card. A it's important to still play against these people. Yeah, 41 coppers. That's steel. It's, oh, is it 41 coppers? Oh, that's pretty bad, isn't it? That's not even for gold. Either way, guys, it's important to play not just questline characters in Gwent. Because how else are you supposed to get the, the little basic bitch cards, okay? This isn't my favorite one, but hold on. Couldn't go the whole stream without Gwen. <laughs> How many people just came back and now they're watching me play Gwen? <laughs> oh, okay, so we, ah. Uh, remind me to take out one of these guys because while it's nice to have the stack of moles, I don't actually like having them in my inventory. No spies. No spies. A decoy, but no spies. Swags, welcome back in. Oh, it is Gwent time. It's Gwenting time. Vetoes! Shake that up. Watch yourself. <laughs> Look for the Nilfgaard set. Good armor for early game. Yes! Uh, oh, like a set of armor? Well, I already have my level 11 armor. I know my level 11 and I think level 9 armor, but I just need to wait to get there. Are you really playing? I think I'm just gonna go... I'm gonna play these. I'm gonna play these. I'm just going to start doing the stack mole right away. He'll use spies on you. Once he does, I'll decoy it and we'll be good to go. But he's throwing a lot of points in, actually. Yes, somebody mentioned Aurora, but I think a lot of people say that the Gwent game is not the best on your phone. Here it is! Here it is! All right. Oh, maybe this isn't the right one. I think Gwent is the word I've used most this month. Thank you. <laughs> He passed. All right. <laughs> Eric, I hope you enjoyed the lurk. Thank you so much for hanging around and have a great rest of your week if I don't see you Saturday. Saturday, I don't have a cap on the stream either because I don't have anything planned. So it might be a long one. I've enjoyed Gwen on the phone. It's okay. Is it not exactly like this? It's something completely different. We're gonna throw everything into this round, y'all. Oh, I got one of my level 10 guys. Hopefully he doesn't have a... Wait, 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 what does this one do? 24 hour stream, no. <laughs> uh, clear, uh, oh, okay, clearing weather effects. A lot more okay so similar to the main game itself right it's a lot more mechanics <laughs> 
I'm actually so bad at Gwen, it's not funny. Really? Free Gunner, welcome back in, by the way. It's, trust me, if I can do it, anybody can do it. I stick by that statement. Ah, oh, that was my favorite tune. That tune felt shorter than it normally is. I'm not expecting him to have a lot. He, I think he's just a low level Gwent player. He dropped something crazy on me in a second. <gasps> no, be still my beating heart. The impenetrable fog. <laughs> Raven Lily, what's up? Welcome in. I love your excitement for Gwen. It's one of my favorite parts of the game too. It's just, why would you use that? I guess when you have nothing else to play and I can decoy. Can I? Well, I don't need to. It's it's not like the craziest strategic game, but I've never stuck like glue harder to any in-game game, in-game in -game kind of game than this. Like I've played other games that have them. Fable had a couple, but this just, I'm obsessed with it. I can't stop playing it. Mm. Witcher 3, the Gwent hunt. We need a ginger flute. <laughs> I need to change my alerts to be more Witcher. Man, 20 crowns and, oh, is that a monster? You look like, what's, who's Pearson? You look like Pearson? Gwent, Gwent. Okay, so we're still trying to play, oh, this way, this way, this way. So I never did Caravan. Maybe I should have given that a chance. Now that I see I liked this so much, I should have given it a chance. Oh, Fidel. <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mm -mm. I can do better than that, Fidel. What was it? Oh, a garbage patch kid. But a lot of garbage patch kids together can definitely equal some hard hitters. So, wait, was that a Nilf card? That was a Nilf card card. <laughs> it was a Nilf card card. It, no, it was a monster card. Okay, I thought so. It was a monster card. Caravan is nowhere near as good as Gwent. How is it so addicting? And how did I start down this rabbit hole? You guys did this to me. Sir Foxington, welcome back in. Caravan was a little confusing at first, but once you understood it, it was pretty simple. That's how I feel about Gwen. That's what I was telling my brother about it. <laughs> mm -hmm. well, it was kind of better. It was better than the first one. People get stuck on this, but I haven't played Witcher 3 so far, so <laughs> who has the last laugh? And then next thing you know, whenever you do start at Kitchen, you're going to be playing nonstop Gwen. Just you wait. You got to catch them all. Exactly. I don't expect anything different. Also, you know who's in Novigrad? Fox, what's up? Welcome back in. Y'all know who's here. Some of you guys are really gonna want me to go see her. Hello. The best stock in all Novigrad. All Novigrad. Y'all, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Oh, Novigrad. Very good. Manners before trade, always. Oh, manners before trade. All right, let me whoop your ass in Gwent first. But let me see if you have any cards have for me look. to buy first. No? It's actually really important to see what they have because they could possibly have quest items for you later. It is time to duel. <laughs> Show Got yourself. Of Gwent. Megatron, filthy Megatron. Welcome back in for 34 months. And for 35 months, actually, and a tier three as well. Holy cow. Megatron, thank you so much. You guys are the reminder of how old I'm getting. Oh my God, chat reminds me how old I am. Oh, Harry, welcome back in. How has Gwent not become a thing as a real card game? So I think we talked about this, Harry. Uh, I believe somebody said that it's just, there's certain things about it that make it impractical for like in-person card playing. But it seems so simple. If you were to play it exactly how this is, how would it not be simple? It seems as simple as playing uh, Splendor, honestly. I need to loot and sell a lot of stuff. I have like no money. Okay, first of all, I don't need to point it out. It's not like I can have a credit card in this game. I'm working on it, okay? Pan, thanks for the follow and welcome in. Filthy, thank you so much. I cannot believe it's been that long. I can't. <laughs> No, the outfit sticks out like a sore thumb in this time. Oh no, I need it to be nighttime. Get it out, get it out. The monster decks, yeah. 
Yeah, Harvey, what's up? Welcome back. I know, I have an absolute baby face. Which is good. I will take it. I feel like a lot of people complain about having a baby face, and I... No, I fully... I embrace it. Biting Frost. He's a... He's a Nilfgaardian, correct? That's a Nilf... Yeah, Nilfgaardian Empire. This is the one. That was worth it. All right, so we have a medic. Well, Yen. We have Yennefer and a spy. <laughs> Wallet poor, but boot rich, baby. <laughs> Rob, what's up? Welcome back in. I hope somebody doesn't send to. Oh no, I hope somebody doesn't send torrential. Hey. All right, so we looked at my deck. He has it where he can look, I believe, at the entire deck or up to three cards from my deck. It might be three cards from my deck. We have three boys. Interesting. Let's match him to make him have to place another card. Prime, what's up? Welcome back in. Hello. When you're 27 but look 19, that is me exactly. <laughs> I feel like for guys too, like facial hair makes a big difference because I remember, oh, where was I? I think we were on like a cruise as a family and my cousin had an insane beard at the age of like 17 and they would just not even card him, like at all. Ductile, never apologize for that. I'm just happy you're here now. Welcome back in. He's actually playing pretty smart. Lips, what's up? Welcome in. Dead Space should hold you over. Are you doing Dead Space Remake right now? Did it officially come out, y'all? He's gonna pass. Saucy. Um... I feel like I should pass and go into the next realm. Let's make him use another card because this boy's not gonna be able to stack on anything else. Unless actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. I could place Yennefer. I could place Yennefer, resurrect my, oh no. No, I don't need to do that because it resurrects. I would say decoy my, I would say pass. I'm thinking pass. Sir Foxington, thank you so much for the reset for two months in a row and welcome back in and Han as well, thank you. Mm. It comes out next week, yeah. You're replaying Dead Space 2 right now. I need to actually go back and replay Dead Space 2 because I just feel like I did it so dirty, you know? That's how you don't wanna see. Now it's like, wait, you don't wanna see my ID? <laughs> wait, please take my ID. <laughs> Not the gumdrop button. All right, I say pass. One more to win. We're going into the next round with one more card than they have, so I'll take it. Ductile, yeah, I hope it's been going well, and I'm glad to see you're enjoying the YouTube content. Mm -hmm. Wait, uh, Moose, not Moose, uh, Mini, Mini Cooper, what'd you say? I just missed that whole message. Nah, that playthrough was legendary. Are you talking about the Dead Space 2 playthrough? Absolutely not. Yoink. Damn it. Damn it. Actually, no, this is okay. This is okay. It is now a game of spies. Another spy? AJ, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Did you see how much, like now I'm sitting up in my seat, I'm smiling nonstop. Do you see how much Gwen affects my mental health? It's not good. This is not good. I have to win both of these rounds, so we need to play this right. Your first off or your first play of that, some lovely choices were made. I'm not sure if I would say that. Sal, oh, okay, okay. I will catch you later. T. Tassa. I always want to say Tassa. Tassa, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around, and I hope you have a great time. It has been a while, to say the least. All right, so I could pull. I think what we want to do is wait to use her and resurrect in the second round. So let's do this. You sold your stuff, went on quest, picked up more stuff and sold that. You'd have more coin. I know, I need to keep going back and selling. Even like little things I think would be better than nothing. But I have to win this. So let's go ahead and place. I mean, he could definitely defeat me with one biting frost, but I'm gonna take it. So I can't be a DJ anymore. 
<laughs> no more DJ hours. Fair enough, fair enough. Any chance that Dead Space 3 co-op could happen? Is that a is that a popular game that you co-op? I've never I need to place my six trebuchet and make him have to place another one. Commander's horn. Alright, you troll biscuit. I can commander's horn the first. Nice. There's no way he's gonna pass. There's no way. Really? Oh, shh. Okay. We'll just, we'll just play it out. He has two more cards than me though. Okay, he passed. Solidify the victory. We get an extra card from winning. Dead Space 3 almost killed the franchise. It was that bad. Did some people enjoy it though? Is it kind of like how some people say they don't like Mass Effect 3? Co-op was kind of the whole selling point. Uh, it came out during the phase of co-ops. I feel like co-ops were super popular during a certain like uh, time span. I honestly am indifferent to them. I think co-ops were really fun when you split screen, to be honest. I'm not a big fan of co-ops now, just because there was something so magical about having game nights where you have your friends come over. You know it's awful. You know you don't see a lot of the screen. I get that. But you grabbed the snacks. You had those all out staying out till like 12 p.m. at night or 12 a.m. at night waiting for the launches to happen for like Call of Duty and all of those games. Halo was like the Red Bull girls. It was a whole thing. So Spider-Man 3 of the Dead Space. Is there a Spider-Man 3? Oh, is that the new one that's coming out soon, right? Such a douchebag. Grab the four. Yeah, give him less points, grab the four. Yes, there we go. Not that this is gonna do that much, but still, we've won. I have it in the bag. This person is proving to be more difficult than I thought at first. Split screens with friends just hit different. Back and first thing. Good old Gwent. <laughs> that was a short run, Sway. How are your calves feeling? <laughs> You would remember the Red Bull girls. Oh, I feel like we all remembered the Red Bull girls. All right, don't act like this is just me. This is not ideal. Maybe I should have waited to see if he had another spy because this is going to give him seven points. But still, I get two more cards. Oh, keep it coming. I used to play a lot of the Worms games with friends. If you know what I'm talking about, X-Men Legends with your siblings or friends, that's all. X-Men Legends was my favorite thing. Or to be fair, Battlefront 2. Battlefront 2 for the like OG Xbox. This is proving to be more difficult than I realized. Feeling swole, got a good two, oh. Realizing that your two and a half mile run is longer than I'll ever. Man, I'm about to ruin this man's day with my Scorch. Yes, X-Men Legends, White Winds, thanks for the follow, welcome in. <laughs> What'd you say about the Rebel Girls? Oh, he is about to be wrecked. And this is how you wreck somebody's spirit. I actually think I can only take away the two sixes, but still. Oh, it was the highest guy, the seven? Still. Mm. Toxic victories. Toxic victories, 95 to 42. <laughs> you never, did you ever go to the releases kitchen? They always had I think they still have, it's the same thing as they have like amp girls. Reordain, reordain. B-dubs. B-dubs, thank you so much for the thousand bits. Oh. Oh, that was such a good win. I just feel like I'm getting to the point where nobody stands a chance. It doesn't matter what cards you have. Done. Swift, what's up? Welcome in. Another Swift, not that Swift, a different Swift. 
All right, back to the quest, oh. though. Back to the quest. Uh, win. Win, thank you so much for the gifted sub as well to Frozen Phoenix. Frozen, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Yes, we're in Novigrad. We're in Novigrad. It must be this person. Oh, man. courage to repeat that slander to my face. I always see the bang energy girls. Yeah, well, they have red bull girls. A freak. A useless relic of a bygone age that should be burned like a withered branch. Damn. Anna, thank you so much for the reset for six months in a row. I cannot believe it's been six months and yet you're my best and closest friend <laughs> in such a short time. And also, Reman, thanks for the follow and Hawks as well. J Rocks. J Rock. Welcome in, guys. What did you say? I'm learning lots about rocket science. Do you want. Do you guys want me to. Does anybody want to learn it? Do you want to learn it, Anna? I'll teach you. I got my Gwen fix, but it's not enough. <laughs> How many people, people's lives have you saved? Shut up or I'll shut you up. Waste of words. How many we'll people's lives have you saved? From Brooksay, from Leshens. That has no bearings. Asked you a question. Oh, that has How no bearings. There's something to think about, folks. Preacher's fierce in the mouth. But all are at him and his tail slinks between his legs. Come on, people. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Tail between the legs. All right, let's go this way. Time Splitters 2 with a friend was extremely fun. I don't think I ever played that. Time Splitter 2. Here we go. This one is not going. What is this person doing? Ma'am? Oh, her name is Drunk. That's all we're, <laughs> That's all we're labeling her is Drunk. Bald, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Oh my gosh, look at the back of her head. Is that red hair or is she bleeding from the back of her head? I can't tell. Uh, Are you okay? Oh my god. Oak Town, what's up? Welcome in. And also, French Frog, I hope you enjoy hockey. That's gonna be awesome. I hope you enjoy that. Thank you for hanging around, and I hope I see you Saturday. Mmm. Oliver. Kingfisher. Come here. Where do you get the name? Master Dandelion's poetry. The kingfisher preened, then fell in the latrine. Know it? Yeah. Also know the one then about fell in the Princess latrine. Annie, who drowned in the river Fanny. <laughs> uh, yes. At any rate, the kingfisher welcomes poetry lovers with open arms. Some of the brightest stars in the literary firmament perform here. Oh, okay. Well, show me what you're peddling first. You Let me buy his them? cards and then steal his cards too. Jack, I hope you have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. Thank you. Have a good night as well. Perfect dark multiplayer. Perfect dark. I haven't heard that either. I feel like we, my family and I, we always stuck to like the same games. And then once I found like League of Legends, I was done. I was gone. In 2010? 2010, 13 years ago. I'm not going to be able to afford all these cards, y'all. <laughs> I told you guys. Not enough coin. Let's, <laughs> let's sell the horse blinders. And then I'll go buy it. Check this out. Let's play Gwent. Looking for a partner. Yes. Mind a oh, Gwent. are you talking about... Then you're in the right place, friend. Are you talking about you um, now, the I'll original GoldenEye? Card from my collection. Splinter Cells? Splinter Cells? Sure, let's play. All right, Anna, are you ready for some rocket science? Did you say, is that a level zero? Oh, it's a level zero medic. I would love a level zero spy, but I'll still take a level zero medic. We also need two more guards for the Nilfgaardian Empire, and then I can finally play as something other than the Northern Realms. I will sell my clothes for Gwent. <laughs> I will sell it for long. All right, so we have no decoys. All right, zero decoys. Let's get rid of these bitch boys. Oh, he's monsters. Okay, this is really imperative. Okay, if he's monsters, we want to keep our biting frost and oh, we're done. We have biting frost and we also have our scorch. He's done, done. That's all you have to do to negate any monster if you're ever playing this game, biting frost and scorch cards and you're good to go. That's all you got to do. Micro, Micro, what's up? Welcome back in. And Frozen Toast, thank you so much for the reset for 10 months in a row and welcome back in. Thank you for the continual support. 
Oh my, you've got to be kidding me. That's okay, we can keep it. The, is it, how do you say that? The Scotia? I want to say Nova Scotia every time I see that name and I know that's not it. I don't have any spies. I have an entire deck of spies and I got zero spies. Maggie's gonna have a Carol begging alms for Gwen. <laughs> alms? Alms? What the pole? Are you playing Witcher for the first time? Yes! Oh, Silk! Welcome back in. Yes, we were doing Witcher for the first time. But somehow it's becoming Gwent. It's just Gwent. Gwent featuring occasional Witcher from here and then. Here and there again. Welcome back in. And Shakespeare, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. The level four card is actually good if you have multiple. No, I know that. But if you don't get multiple in your card or your deck right away, it's not the best thing. It's not the bee's knees, okay? It's not the bee's knees. Did I see Spazzy Nerd? But then again, you told Casta something about stabbing. Wait. Yeah, and I told them how you told me to stab a sack today. <laughs> Angel Dust, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. That's interesting. I've never seen a monster player use so many of the third tier cards. Mm. Gwent? Flying Cosmo, what's up? Welcome back in. All right, I can work with that. So they might not have spies, but monster decks are really hard to fight because... They always pull from their deck if they have multiples. That's the only problem. But I'm confident with my Scorch and the other one, I'll be fine. Darth, welcome in. And thank you for the follow. I'm glad to see you enjoying the channel. The witching part is the side quest, 100%. Mm -hmm. The strength for your blue stripes are in fact the best. Only in multiples though. I see what you're saying, but only in multiples. By themselves. I mean, basically this guy equals the monster ability of being able to pull, but he doesn't actually have to pull it from the deck. So I feel like it's either the strongest or it can also be the weakest. Mm, exactly, Warlord. Exactly. I'm glad you're enjoying it. All right, let's do this, though. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I do want to win this round. I'm going to bait out more cards. That could have been a bad play. I could have let him win. Um, we can pull the trebuchet back with my medic, but I kind of want to double. I kind of want to double. Kiss. Kiss, thank you so much for the prime sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Thank you for choosing to use your prime here out of all places. <laughs> thank you so much. I hope you enjoy the ginger emotes. I actually kind of want to do this. What is his, but let's actually see. Oh, here we go. Double the strength of your close combat cards. Okay. I'm pretty confident in myself. I'm pretty confident. Quentin's love, Quentin's life. Here we go. So we'll pull out more cards. He'll still win even if I scorched right now, so it's not worth it. I would say we lose. And he has three cards going into the next two rounds. He will have more than just that, but still. You love how I love Gwen right now? You guys did this. Y'all did this. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. Let's start by doing, oh, the opponent starts as well. The ghoul. Find all the scorch cards, they're so clutch. We have one, and then we also have Biting Frost. So we'll go ahead and let's start by they have one card left. I've already won. He's gonna have to pass. Angel Dust. Wait, wait, the music to it? The <laughs> where I'm jigging to it? Currently enjoying your Last of Us Part 1. Oh, Angel Dust, thank you for taking the time to come over from YouTube, and I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel. Oh, I have to say that my Part 2 is, honestly, I think Last of Us 2 was even more emotional than Part 1 for me. I didn't do nothing. Revolution. All right, let's just place one. I kind of want to... Alright, and then we... Oh, he has so many. Why did I do that? I shouldn't have done that. I should have placed my medic, pulled back a card, and placed one card to win the round. But we'll still win, so... I'll just place this. It's not the bee's knees, but it will work. Does Maggie know about the standalone Gwent game? Yes, I do. I just don't know if I would enjoy it as much. Thank you for the posture check. And Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Angel Dust. Angel, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes as well. And thank you again for taking the time to come over here. 
No, I didn't see the show premiere. So I'm going to watch it tomorrow and record it because I'd like to do a reaction to it for you guys because I did just play through one and two. I think it'd really be fun to do a reactionary video with y'all. The no, you postured. Alpha Bo, welcome back in. All he had was fog. I can't even scorch him. I should have scorched his last deck because now it's just not fun. Now I'm just being toxic. <laughs> All right, there we go. Easy peasy. Should be a best card, which was a monster level eight, maybe? Some of the shots and lines are right out of the game. I cannot wait. I know I'm gonna get shivers from watching it. I already know. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be disappointed either. You guys have said such positive things about it. And while I don't listen to reviews too much, like I like to make my own, uh, I guess, decision on a game or on a movie or something. I like to see it first before I put too much weight behind reviews. I still do take y'all's comments and like suggestions into consideration. So whenever you got like, a, there was a wall on Monday of y'all saying that it's incredible. So I really do put some value behind that. And Vermillion, Vermillion, thank you so much for the reset for six months in a row and welcome back in. Hello. Thank you. I'm so glad you're still enjoying the channel and community. Do you post reaction videos on the same YouTube as your playthroughs? I haven't done any reaction videos yet, but I am planning to do it on the same one, I think. But I've also seen a lot of YouTubers do a separate channel for reactions because sometimes they don't do it on the same one. So I've got to look into that. This is like the first time I'm thinking about doing reactionary except for Walking Dead. I wanted to do a reaction to Walking Dead too. Crego, what's up? Welcome in. I can't wrap my head around how you play Gwent well. <laughs> like why I enjoy it or how I'm actually winning it. Also, by the way, what am I doing? Hold on. See you receive. All right, who was it? It was, it was a level 10. Tybor. <gasps> we need one more card and then I can use the Nilf Guardian Empire. One more card, that's all it takes. It is a 99% on Rotten Tomatoes. That's incredible. That just goes to show you too, I think the power of like, if you actually do a game justice, you have the entire backing of one of the largest oh, communities. Like I think the, com the gaming community is one of the largest Shining communities out there. Nowadays more than ever too. But it can go either way, y'all. We have been seeing some horrible adaptations lately as well, so. <gasps> what am I? Oh, no, 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 no. Did I actually finish it? Aw. I finished all my quests for collecting Gwent cards. Damn. Okay, the last of Gwent. Oh, Fran, what's up? Welcome in, hello. Having Naughty Dog directly involved in the show. Oh, do other adaptations not often have the development company come alongside it? Must be turned to the difficulty. We're level eight, but we're actually getting dangerously close to level uh, nine. And we want to get to level 11 by the end of the stream, but it's already been three hours. That's insane. You finished all the quests for Gwent cards that you've found so far. We just need to pick up more. You're right. You're right. Egade's welcome in, by the way. Hmm. No credits. What do you mean? All right, guys, we're going to go to Kara. She invited us. We're not going to be rude. Half the writers of the Witcher series hated the books. Really? They hated the material that they pulled it from? Or you said the TV series doesn't follow the books very much. I mean, she invited us, so I'm not going to say no. All right. Hyper Stealthy, what's up? Welcome back here. All right, we need to go to... Although I do want to explore Novigrad more. Hmm. <gasps> Wait. Oh, we just fought the Ankeep. Or we just fought him. We just played him. But hold on. I know I use this shopkeeper. I haven't actually... Okay, hold on. There's a second shopkeeper I can do. Of the eternal fire. Believe. Believe. Yeah, Wait, what? Believe, thank you so much for the reset for six months in a row and welcome back in. Oh, shit. Thank you. 
She weighed lighter than a feather. No evil can survive the holy fire. The holy fire enlightens, burns, and cleanses. Oh my god. Behold the flame of grace and mercy. Lighter than a duck, surely. Special fire for you. Yeah, three. I'm at the beginning, beginning. Nice, slow burning. You'll beg for mercy in all the voices known to you. And the others of your speech. The writers of the Netflix show shut on everything? Oh, we just heard about a Doppler. A Doppler? Warlord, thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and community. Thank you, and Grandpa, welcome back in. Look at how often the beat or off the beat Dude, path Halo and the, the Ari adaptations. The Ari Ari adaptations were awful. Like the what was the latest one? Jeez. So a Doppler. Hmm. Anytime. Oh. Oh. Stop. Drop and roll. Every time that I see, oh, hold on. Every time I see Rosemary and Time, the hottest spot in Novigrad. Is this a strip club? Is that what this is? Warlord, seriously, I'm so glad to see you're enjoying the community and thank you. Oh my. Look at the craftsmanship on that beam though. That's some nice spiraling happening on that wood beam. Coming at you like Cleopatra. There we go. Armor. Uh, that's a nice beam. <laughs> that's how I sleep. It's good for the spine. <laughs> All right. Show me your wares. Like to craft. Let's see what his wares are. Show me what you have in store. Show me your wares. Visit and find out. <laughs> we need to go to it for science, of course. For science. Oh, is that what it is? Luke, thanks for the follow. Welcome in, and also uh, Dino as well, Den. Ye old gentleman's club. How is your Gwent card collection going, Mark? We are definitely crushing it in the Gwent department. Follow the clues on the map. Oh, I have no coins. No coins to my name. Shut the damn door. All right, let's sell this. You can actually make a lot of coin by selling runestones. I did not expect that. Wraith and Rocks, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in as well. Hmm. Okay. I could earn 714. Done. Take all of my runestones. I don't need them. I don't want them. Take them. Unless it's fire, I don't, unless it's Igni. Uh, or attack power. Or causing a chance to burn. We like that. Uh, we can rack and stack on the poison, so I'm gonna keep that. Adrenaline point game. I'm not really playing the adrenaline point game. Don't question my decision, okay? Don't question it. We don't need those. We also don't need... What? You got rich all of a sudden. <laughs> because I'm selling things that I probably shouldn't be selling. Yeah, it would be so... Oh, there are real world Gwent packs. Yeah, somebody sent me uh, Etsy, and then I think you can find them... I think you can find like really nicely made ones and then also just kind of like quick, quick made items as well. Sell all the runestones to buy more Gwent cards. <laughs> I do need to exchange if coins. A stubborn beast I do. You be, I have no choice. That's fair. That is fair. Dismantling items. Dismantling items. Okay. I didn't think about that. He's throwing it into the mix. All right, let's look at crafting. What do we got? What do we got? Junk. Trousers. Assassin's trousers. I still can't wear it though. I need to be level 11. 8. 11. 11. Uh, Alright. Repair. I guess let's repair my weapons while I'm here. If I may. And if I can. 
Except it costs so much to repair like that. It's better to find repair kits, I think. Mm. You can exchange coins nearby. Oh, you're right. I think I do have... If I go to sell, do I... I think I... What? Pearl cheat. He won't buy this kind of stuff. I need to go find somebody else. Okay. So long. Wait, was Novigrad the guy that was the master smith? Welcome. Mm -hmm. Welcome. You're talking about the treasure map? Say Show devil, what's up? Welcome in as well. Uh, you're talking about this map? I think I was supposed to. There's so many. Oh. Hmm. Requir requires level eight, level six. Is 458 coins worth being able to carry 70 more? I think so. I wish we could beat him in Gwent and then get like a discount for the shop, you know? That would be perfect. Gotta go mod, have a good stream. Okay, Falky, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. I hope you have a great rest of your week. Do you plan on changing the emotes for normal or are they set up for Christmas 2023? Star Wonders, I gotta change them back. I do need to. Black, welcome in and thank you for the follow. I missed quite a bit. Is the Baron quest finished yet? No, we still haven't finished it yet, but I'm kind of leaving it open for the most part. I think it's worth it. And then let's go ahead and put on the other one and then sell the other one. Master crafted armor. I think you have think to talk to all of them some? first to find out. Ooh, I did get my journeyman's papers, but I've yet to make anything akin to a masterwork. Mm. You might try in Velen. A dwarf there Bigger pockets. goes by Fergus. He might help. I Gilles thought we already talked to Fergus. No one better anywhere south of the Ponta. I swear we did. Joey, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel and community. Mm, how did I get my name? Oh man. <laughs> long story short, you want the long Will story you short? Craft something for me. At this point, I think we could do the trousers. But I know at a level 11, we already have better armor. Unless he would be able to help craft. Let me go to chest armor real quick. What do I need to craft my witcher armor further? Oh, look at all the different things I could craft now. Bounty hunters. Uh, I could keep leveling this up, but I haven't found more of that. And I need to. Uh, yeah, I think at this part, at this point, I can't keep saying parts for my Witcher playthrough because you're right, we're gonna get to triple so digits soon. Uh, oh. days. Sorry. Oh. What do you say about the youth? Well, well, Hello. Hello. Ooh, Where are you? Beg your pardon. The old hag holding out on you. <clears throat> the old hag Anything holding out on you. Well, well, look who's here. Long story short. Wolf himself in my humble Hold on. establishment. Or How medium. I be of service? Hmm. You can get a loan. I'd like to convert some currency. Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. Okay. You come to the right place. We've never done this before. You'll not find anywhere in the city. Long story short, my favorite book series when I was like really young. The main character's name is Katza, but the entire time I read it, I read it as Casta. How can I be of service? Did he not oh, does he need to go in there first? What? So anyway, the whole time I read it as Casta, and whenever I went on to play games, like in League of Legends and stuff like that, I kept my name as Casta 11. I think it was like Casta 11, because 11 is my lucky number. Yep, it was from Grace Lane. Mm -hmm. It was like my favorite book when I was a kid. And I always read it wrong. And then I used to be KS Casta for Killsteel. And then I changed my name after like the first year of streaming to Casticlism, because I wanted to do like a play on words and I thought that cataclysmic events summed up my life pretty, pretty much at that point. It was pretty chaotic, so I just like you thought it rolled. You play Gwent, don't you? Oh sure. And that's that. I'm a dwarf. How can I be a service? Do you also believe I know every other bleeding dwarf in existence? I wasn't saying that. At the end of each that. day, I deepen the mine shaft in my cellar. Wrestling with the so Pokemon. So you play or not? I, I play. That's all I needed to know. I read Bitter Blue. I read all of them. Yeah, except that I went back to reread them and they haven't really held up. I mean, they're not bad. I still think they're they were so fun when I read them at the time. 
but they did not stand the test of time for me. Um, Costa, Costa Pasta. So I always get that one. Stake a unique card, Casta. maybe. Why not? Why is 11 your lucky number? I want to say that was my first number that I had when I played soccer, because I played soccer all the way up until I was about 15. And it was always 11, so then it became my lucky number. <laughs> all right, let's go. Aries, Aries, thank you so much for the hunter bits. I accidentally drank a bottle of invisible ink. Now I'm in a hospital waiting to be seen. Aries. Leaky ass juice, welcome back in. Kind of happy I don't have a life experience tale about my name. <laughs> I kind of like how my name is not tied to my life experience. You're leaking ass juice. That does not hold like any relation to Taco Bell at all. Or maybe a mismedication, some kind of side effect of a medication. <laughs> Aries, that was actually pretty good. <laughs> I have not heard that before. Cold, thanks for the follow and welcome in as well. Football, yes, soccer, football. Yays. Okay, we have our spy man. So I've not actually had a lot of experience with the Nova Scotians. I'm not surprised you can pronounce Castor, right? It took two months to get my name down. All right, when I was younger, I was a little lystexic, okay? Rugby is king. You know, I've never gotten to see rugby. I always liked watching hockey. I would go to hockey games all the time to watch the brawls. It was top notch. Not a bad trade. I don't know if Biting Frost is good against them. Oh, that's your Dark Souls 3 character name? I think before that, my name was maybe, I think it was Killer Eel. Isn't that like an auto name in the original Halos? I want to say Killer Eel was like an auto name. And did I have one before that? Um, I used to have Magpie when I was really young because my family would always call me that. Guys, thank you for the follows, and Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to not only Swift, but also Revelation. Revolution. Revelation. Gwentaclism. I'm gonna toss, I'm gonna toss this. I grew up playing rugby. That's a brutal sport, no? It can get pretty rough. Broken bones, I feel like. Bird. Now we need to see the ultimate battle between Gwent addicts. Yeah. <laughs> oh, has she gotten into Gwent as well? He passed already. So let's just drop a, I know this sounds crazy, but it's one card wasted, but we win. It's not wasted. One card, win, pass, and boom. Done. You get more bruises. Cause you're, you're just not as padded, right? And we can pull that card back, by the way, with our medic, so easy peasy. Trivial with the gifted sub to Gwen sucks. <laughs> Trivial, you've seen me play much more boring things than this, so <laughs> you've seen much worse. Gwen is amazing. Don't do me dirty like that. <laughs> Let's do this. You can't get hero cards back. Oh no, I didn't know that. I still think it's worth it. Like, I still feel like it was worth it. Damn. Heroes cannot be retrieved. That would be kind of OP. Almost as ridiculous as me laying down a Scorch in a second on this person. There it was. That was my person. <laughs> Are you talking about these pool noodles? <laughs> Beware of the pool noodles, okay? They're good at strangling. Actually, I don't know why we're surprised that I'm into Gwen. You guys, why are we surprised? You guys saw me. I'm about to ruin your life. Y'all saw me with, what's it called, remember? Uh, Was it Blackjack? When we were at, yeah. Yeah, RDR2, gambling. Remember I had a gambling addiction and then also I had a gambling addiction in Fallout New Vegas. Gwent sucks, must be Maggie's brother. <laughs> hey yo, Halo games, Buck. Buck is still here. Buck with the gifted sub to Halo games. I hope he has a Frozen. I really do. 
yeah, I think it was still worth playing it. Not the chicken leg. <laughs> Blute. Blute, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs to the channel and community. Cultured bread. <laughs> Y'all, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. And Blue, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Why wouldn't it be Eleven or Geralt? Wait, for what? The chicken leg alert is the best alert. <laughs> Blue, thank you so much. And also, Flare Fox, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Mm. I actually don't have any cards that my medic can pull, you guys. There's actually no point to my characters right now. David, welcome into uh, another day, another Gwent. <laughs> you should get into the game Skull. It's less. Hold on. Hold up. Hmm. I wonder if they have a clear skies. <gasps> oh. I don't know. This is interesting. I can remove one of his cards again, so I can take 12 points off the table. The Gwent music does, Daniel. It does. Halo is a similar game like Gwent called Slayer. You should... I'm not falling for this. I'm not falling for this. Get out of here. And bye-bye. Bye-bye. Another game bites the dust. All right, now I. I recall the last time I was so thoroughly rushed. Oh, that's me. Tried your best. So imagine your kid's name is Gwen. Who else would have <laughs> Their middle name will cards. be Gwen. But uh, first child's Martin middle name will Serenity, be Gwen. For instance, she mm. don't boast about it, but she has one of the best decks in town. And Elena Fisher well. and Laura Croft I know together. What I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't know Elena Fisher though. The one of the game developers uh, for this for this game. Which card is it? <gasps> Guys, we got Vesemir. We won Vesemir. Oh my man, look at him. He's only level six. That's kind of insulting to Vesemir's and Ah, uh, Vesemir is like Sully. They just get better with age. You got the next Gwent quest. <gasps> Did I? I also have an invitation from Kara. Where is it? Secondary quest. Big city players, let us go, let's go. Mm -hmm. I do, Drash, I do need to get rid of some of them. Bobo, welcome in and thank you for the follow. Gwenticlism. <laughs> I feel like people need to understand that when they come into this stream, they're most likely gonna see Gwen play for a while. No. No, 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 no. Exactly three. Exactly three. Check my hours played in inventory and menu. Imagine Maggie and <laughs> Junior Gwen. <laughs> Should you save before the Gwen quest to make sure that you get the cards? I think so. Oh, well, it auto saves after every three minutes. Don't look at me like that. I'm not looking at y'all. It's a hype train and I might not be here for the outro. Do not. No. Spazzy. We're going to Kara. I'm going to fight the addiction. I'm fighting the addiction. All right, let me go to this real quick. David, Gwen is the game. Geralt is the side quest. Roach is also the main game. Hold on. Have I played this person? Yes, Welcome. Welcome. Is this the same man just traveling? Show me your wares. What have you got there? Show me your wares. Oh. 
A little silver pantaloons. Oh, I hope I don't run into a werewolf. Oh no. All right, farewell. <laughs> because I fear the joke. We haven't visited Carrie yet. No, we started her journey. No, we did. Do not, do not start with me. We started the journey. Unknown, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Guys, thank you so much for the hype train as well. Thank you. All right, we're gonna go here. And then we're gonna go north from there. He doesn't sell Gwent cards and doesn't play. He's uncultured swine. Van Halen, I hope you're doing well. Wait a minute. I don't like that in my ear. All right, let's go this way. Is Gwent on the hardest difficulty? No, it's not. Do we feel like it needs to be on the hardest difficulty? I wonder how much the AI spikes, like how much does it go up in difficulty? They probably do have TB. And so are we after our time with Kara. Bloody rodents. Better to have stuffed them with a poison or crushed mm. them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Would Gwent again. Did you see what he did with them? Would Gwent again. I'm not spying. Who is that? Hello. I actually think this is not for what I think it is. I thought it was going to be Kira, some sexy time, but I think this is doing? an actual mission. Geralt. <laughs> you gave me quite a start. I thought we were going to the enchanted Renee, bath. The mage, says, Bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat dragged in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? You told me to come here. What do you mean, what do I owe the pleasure? You said you had a request for me. There we go. Uh, but I do want to learn a little bit more about her. Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much about one another these days. Aww. It's safer that way. Even tried to contact one another? I've wanted to many times, but I've no way of knowing who would answer. Is she from or the same lodge as Triss? Oh, it is a Karen haircut. It is. I know. I see it every time. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. No, but I think we're going to up it. To, we might up to Death March. I keep talking about that every single stream. It's just, I don't know. Uh, we could turn it on for next stream and see how we feel. I'll turn it on so, and see. So, bet you saw this question coming. What we'll see if it's too much. Let me think. Enjoying the country air, admiring the unspoilt scenery. Oh, there's only or is one it lodge. furthering the age-old okay. alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No, I'm in hiding, Geralt. We knew Blind that. to the state of the world. I need to get Don't rid of this eyesore of a shirt. You mean the persecution mages now face? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? We've run into Murderers a couple, actually. scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. Like playing the village witch, like Velen. Picked a strange place to Guys, hide. Guys, thank you for the followers. Welcome in. anything. In the north, Radovid's men hunt sorceresses like fish in a barrel. Mm. Nilfgaard controls the south. Where was I to flee? Emperor does keep mages on a short leash, but he lets them live and ply their trade. Radovid and Emma differ in every respect except one. They share a deep hatred of the Lodge of Sorceresses. Mm. And I was a member. Back to the topic at hand, though. Do you play Gwent? Changing the subject. Oh, she sells stuff. <gasps> Bet the old witch who lived here left you a bunch of Maybe she does sell. Years. She did indeed. I gather you'd like a look. Very much so. Yeah, it might be a little difficult at the beginning, but I think you're right. Oh, wow. Holy cow, look. 5% chances. 5% stacks up really nicely if you have three of 5%. Dude. Pimo. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> Stop harassing people with Gwen. Oh, look at the glyphs. Oh, those are some juicy cards, but they cost so much. Oh, God. Oh, wait. Lesser runes. Does she sell any? Oh, so much stuff. Manuscript? Draconoid? Oh, Dracon. Oh, Draconid. Draconid? 
I feel like I should buy this. I feel like I should buy this. I'm gonna buy that because we do run into dragons a few times. Dawn, thank you so much for the reset for seven months in a row and welcome back in. I know you've been here like the whole time, but thank you so much for the continual support. It's awesome to see. It all stemmed from God of War, wasn't it? God of War 2018. I'm not harassing people. Do you have Gwen? Mm. These are all signs. Alchemy. So this is something that I did not know. We can craft them. Thank you so much, Dawn. All right, let's craft anything that we have for, her, and then we can buy some of the stuff from her, possibly. Missing ingredients. Vampire oil. I don't think we've even run into a vampire. Oh, but okay. Ergot seeds. I wish you could pull this up and then buy any missing ingredients. Maybe you can, maybe not. Hmm. I feel like I should have this by now. So I need cherry cordial. Cherry cordial? Also, is that rat poisoning? Potion of clearance. Uh, hmm. I feel like I could use buying one of like every type of item and that will just slowly help me figure out what I need. White myrtles sound familiar. Oh, this stuff, right? Ergot seeds. How many ergot seeds? Alchemy. Oh, let's do this. Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Vampires are probably the toughest thing to fight. Uh, so you're saying I don't want to run into one? <laughs> Come here, boy. We must engage in a magical gwent. Imagine if God of War had a mini game. Oh, I would not get anything done. It was for the drac uh, Draconis. Is that what you said? Draconis. Four of them. All right, so let's shop for four of them and then we can build that. Mm. Four. Nice. And then let's craft that. Not that. Oh, it actually can make up two. So the oil or there's something else that requires it. Ah, the noon wraith requires one. All right, so let's actually buy a fifth one. What are we having for supper? Gwent. Boy. Be better. Boy. All right, so let's do... You can loot most ingredients. Yeah, I'm grabbing these ones because I'm just here in the moment. Um, I need to be looking for the right flowers too herbs and such all right so we just need to buy one more and then we can craft another item i i look at the alchemy as kind of like collecting them all i want to make sure that i craft everything out there but i don't think that's actually possible mm. all right that's good so back to well let's ask about the magic lamp we can't be rude we can't go straight into the conversation uh, Tornado Cods and LeBron guys, welcome in and thank you. Why do you want the lamp? Oh, you just witnessed why. Lara, to communicate with lost souls. Didn't know you were interested in that kind of magic. That's huge. Wrong with it. I don't know how I didn't see that. Why did the elf promise you the lamp? We traded for it. He needed powerful magic, and sensed I was no common wart charmer. Wart I brought him a potion. To delay nervous tissue degeneration, stave off memory loss or some such. Who'd he want to use it on? Hmm. He didn't say. Okay, real quick, then let me... Uh, the old witch never mind. Lived here. She did indeed. Very much so. Very much so. All right, hold on. So I can... But not within here, right? Oh, you can. All right, so let's pin this, because I do. Formula will now appear in the shop panel. All right, so I need the cherry cordial. That's something I really want to be able to make. And then also Dwarven Spirit too. Yeah. Well, not really because I find those all the time. I find Dwarven Spirit all the time. Superior Beast Oil. I'd like to be able to craft that. Enjoy the exercise, Fazzy. Thank you so much for hanging around. Uh, it is absolutely possible to craft all of the items. Oh, we do need to do the cat. So we need one more water essence. Yes. All right, we're doing that one. Pin that one. All right, back to the request. Mentioned you wanted something from me. I did, and still do. If you have the hours, the you make a good point. The curse on you've heard of it, I'm sure. The local peasants mumble incessantly about it, about the wraiths that haunt it. 
They claim none who go there return. How did it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. Gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Serard, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the Does village he play that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was hmm. a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. I thought this was not, I thought this was a social call. I really did. Jinx, welcome in. When do you want to lift the curse? I guess I'll help her. All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. The 90 part series. Actually, you'll need to sail to Fai Kai. <laughs> Fine, what then? Ransom, well, don't worry, I was mostly playing Gwent. The Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how, but they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. I don't know how. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course, provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. Okay. I'll do so. I'll do so. The magic lamp, how does it work? Why won't you go with me? Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fikaia once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Mm. Nice of you to send me there. I experienced an acute nasal hemorrhage. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. <laughs> at Aratusa, they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Mm. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. Take my boat. I left it oh. on the lake shore near the village. Her hair should be fit to use. Provided rot hasn't eaten it. As it's it the sideswipe for me. Here. The sideswipe program. Welcome back. And by the way, and guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it or do I oh, you have to do something um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. That's kind of um, cool, though. I wonder I if we can I use it on another warn. quest, too. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Nothing Tell you ever all about is. it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenovox. It's a bauble that will let Drugs. us speak over some distance. Drugs. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. She gave me a box with lips on it. Never heard of a Xenovox. It works just like a megascope, but is far more portable. Think of it as a magic box that talks. They hard to build. Why it's does that extreme. remind me of Ella Enchanted's That's book that so talks? Rare. I certainly couldn't build anything like it. So no chance these Xenovoxes will catch on with every mage using one? Not the slightest. It's a magic cell phone. All right. Do you know anything else before I go? I don't know if we're no, going to go right away, all. though. Alds, I hope you enjoyed your time here, and thank you for hanging around. Good oh, luck with the homework. Go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Fire Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And Geralt. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Kind of sus. I should have known that going to her would have resulted in further quests and not just a good old happy visit to each other. Ugh. All right, let's see. Who needs a brawn? <laughs> None of the characters in this game, are you kidding me? Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. All right, so we picked up another side quest in trying to actually finish quests, we picked up another one. All right, so we do need to do Ladies of the Wood before I continue on any further. We're going to do Ladies of the Wood. Uh, let's see. Go back to Novigrad and play Gwen. <laughs> I can't go back in again. I can't go back in. No. Uh, let's see. I didn't know. That's not what I was looking for. It's just when she made the suggestion earlier, it made it seem a lot more... Appealing, okay. All right, so where are we headed? Read Ladies of the Wood. Okay, so we need to read Ladies of the Wood first. But before I do that, I need to run in the bathroom real quick. We're coming in at almost four hours. Oh, we have plenty of time. All right, I'll be right back, you guys. We'll finally get to a RE4 remake in 2025. <laughs> Don't do me like that, please. Hold on, I'll be right back. Let me grab this too. Uh, pull for Gwent or Story. Okay, you guys can make I mean, I don't blame you guys for wanting to see these Gwen skills. All right, can somebody make a poll? 
say Gwent or Ladies of the Wood. Which one do you guys want? It's just got to be paid. I've got to work more for it. This feels, now I understand how it feels. It was, don't lie. <laughs> All right, somebody make a poll for it before I leave, because I'll be back faster than you think. This next quest is pretty good. We don't even need a poll. Are you guys just saying Gwen? I'm not Googling it. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back, John. You didn't even make the poll. Okay, you did make the poll. The answer's always Gwen. <laughs> Oh, I'm trying to decide to wear it or not to wear it. It's just not really that cold. I'll pull for Gwen or Gwen. Does it say Gwen or Gwen? It's not. The Ladies of the Woods is going to be like a 20 part. Is that what it is? Scott, what's up? Welcome in. Thank you so much for taking the time to come over. And from the archive channel, nonetheless, welcome and now to you. Yeah. I mean, Gwen's gonna be faster than a quest, I'll tell you that. All right, the latest bee's knees, y'all. Trader Joe's freeze-dried apples and mangoes. The mangoes are to die for. I'm obsessed with freeze-dried fruit right now. I'm preparing to be an astronaut one day. I chose more Gwen. Isn't it Gwen or Gwen? Isn't it Gwen or Gwen? <laughs> oh. I thought you guys said it's Gwen or Gwen. <laughs> I can teach Ginger to play Gwent so I can just be off stream and she's playing for me. Shadow Knight, welcome back in. Oh, algebra is brutal. So in school, I took up space. <laughs> that is insane. Yeah, the route to become an astronaut is crazy. Like, I'm pretty sure you have to be a test pilot as well. I would not want to be a test pilot. Uh-uh. Trader Joe's is overpriced mediocrity. Did you finally stop at it? Have you actually even given it a chance? If I gave you a list to buy at Trader Joe's, would you buy it? Just to tell me. <laughs> I'm like a pyramid scam mom going door to door advertising for Trader Joe's. Well, you guys requested it, so. Gotta collect them all. I don't even know if we can. We need a thousand hours to start. Oh. <laughs> oh no, Ponch, welcome back in. All right, we need to go here first. I shopped with them enough times and you don't like their stuff. Aldi is owned by Trader Joe's but cheaper. I think I went to an Aldi in, don't they have Aldi's in Denmark? <gasps> the most beautiful sunsets in any game, I think. I like fast travel, but I wish you could fast travel from anywhere instead of having go to go to the post, but I know that kind of defeats the purpose, but. It has the same products, but in different packaging. <gasps> okay, I need to go check out Aldi. I've never even, I think outside of Aldi is German based, but I think also the one in Romania was like, um, the, what was the Mart that was in Romania? Megamosh? I think it's Megamosh. Well, there's Lidl, but no, they, I think they maybe had that, but it was called a Megamosh. Uh -huh. Mmm. That makes so much sense. Aldi's popped up everywhere. Aldi's and Lidl's, I think? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's called Megamage, and it kind of looks like a food lion symbol to me. So I always thought it was like food lion. Uh, all right, we're headed up and over. Well, well. Mega Image is Dutch. Oh, interesting. That's the only supermarket I think I went to when I was there. And Ethereal, welcome back in, by the way. Wait, it's Homo so sapien, how long have you been here? And you're asking if I was in the airport? 
Spend all night spanking Hold on. So Time out. Positively pale. We're picking them all up. We're picking them all up. God, they're so good. Publix is the goat. Fight me. Doesn't Publix have like really amazing sandwiches? <gasps> you know what I'm craving? Wawa. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And her lad deals fist tech. Wawa chicken sandwich. So I came here for Gwent. What's the deal? Ask and ye shall receive. Just give it a second, okay? Give me one second. What's he doing here? I hob? I hob? Oh! Right. They say that that was Air Force gloves. <laughs> what? We get so much shit. I have no problem being called Chair Force. I loved sitting in a chair and having AC. Okay. Mm. What grace! What style! chicken sandwich no 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 there's a specific order that i love from from uh wawa oh those are boobies god of war flashback give her a small jar of but then the noble woman coming out of it pekka uh freeze dried fuji apples and yes naveem i was uh-huh Well, well, well. <laughs> You're sitting there grabbing your crotch and I try to talk to you and you say... Sawed off. Okay. Why? <laughs> You take a gout. Oh. Must you sing this cheer? He, he said sawed off. <laughs> oh, sorry, dude. My bad. You'll see. Nice to see you. Radovid will oh. move Redania's capital to Novigrad. I'm sorry. Wow. But I don't believe it. Piss off. <laughs> oh my god, everybody doesn't want me to. Too old to be out whoring. Am I too old to be out whoring? Oh my. <laughs> What is happening? For the temple. <laughs> oh my god! It's this guy. It's the guy that's holding his junk and telling me to saw it off. Y'all, thanks for the follows. Welcome. <laughs> I'm out. I'm, I'm done. At least in Fable, you could actually sleep with a prostitute. Oh, hello. I am trying to talk to them, Andrew. I'm trying. Boo. Every prostitute tells me to sod off. <laughs> yeah, everybody's coughing up lungs and telling me to sod off. Here we go. This he's gonna say yes. I know it. Le oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Yes. There's a laundry. I told you he was gonna say yes. They'll wash your clothing for you there. Um. <laughs> it's his hands. Look at the stick and twist it. Look at the proportions on these men's hands. Did I just loot water from the prostitute? Yes, okay, never mind. Sorry. But there is. Uh, what brings you to me? There's somebody I'm supposed to. Oh, here we go. White wolf. Here we go. Welcome to the patch of flora. <laughs> it's like the different prostitute no thing. recognition in your eyes. Greetings. I just want to play don't Gwent. Fret. I don't want the I'm people. Sure I look quite different from when we last saw each other. Oh really? Which was? Oh, eons ago. Yeah! I'm a cowboy. Halflings in tow. What a smash they were, the little chaps. 
We recount that night to this day. So the, uh, staff hasn't changed since then? Oh, of course <laughs> it has. It does so incessantly in this Burly Berthy? Burly Berthy married a merchant. Ella struck out on her own. And you'll likely find Cerise praying at the temple. What? I alone remain. So, shall I summon the girls? Just remember, this is a decent establishment. Pause to yourself to start with. Pause and pause. And our girls are well-mannered. The range of subjects they discuss in detail. I myself find it daunting. I'm curious. <laughs> you play Gwent? No Certainly. hesitation. Though for high stakes exclusively, of course. In fact, the game would be exceedingly boring without the risk. I just looted him for swallows, and then I was surprised he said piss off. Gwen's about to become code for something else. Up for a round. Why, yes. Let's play. It's the guy saying piss off. Sawed off. Quickest Gwen selection ever. No second thoughts. All right, so let me do something real quick. Let's go down to our archers and let's ditch that guy and ditch her. Keep my spies, keep my three by threes. All right, let's go. Do I have a new, uh, no, I think I need one more person for a nilf guard hand. I think I need one more person. At least she was so bad at the QTE and made all the dudes look pretty damn good. <laughs> all right. Vesemir is in the deck, yes. Oh, Vesemir's in every deck. <gasps> If I do, uh, I have to stick with this though. I have to stick with this. Y'all, thank you for the follows, welcome in. I do have to stick with this, guys. <laughs> Imagine trading out and getting his brother to come back. Brother. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, that's fine. All right, so we have Nilf Guardian. Go away, I'm playing Gwen. One more round of Gwen, please. Here it comes. That's the card we're gonna take, by the way. Excuse me. Oh, and then we can definitely play with Nilf Guardians. I don't have a spy, do I? He plays to 10 right off the rip. I can decoy him. Bait him out to have to place more cards. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah, that's right, because you can't scorch uh, legendary cards, right? I wonder if I decoyed him, if he would place another card. Or I could horn it. I could use Commander's Horn, double the singular card. But, mm, oh, you can't even decoy him. Can you use Commander Sword on him to make it worth 20? Nope. <laughs> but we were able to use a card, so now bait it out. <laughs> Might lose this one, y'all. I wanna see if he'll pass on this. Let's see if he plays it out. He's gotta have a spy, yeah. All right, so we're gonna decoy that spy. Decoy the spy, although that gave me 14 points. So he would, oh, I shouldn't have decoyed yet. Oh, nice. Okay, I think I should lose that. Do we decoy the spy or do we lose? Or do we pass? Cause then he'd have to play a hell of a lot of cards. I can save my decoy, but he has another spy. That was a level nine spy. It's not like I wanna use that on him anyway. I don't know. I'm kind of thinking call him on the bluff. Use the spy. Oh, use, oh, use my spy. Okay, I see what you're saying. That's a good point. Guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Hmm, he decoyed it. Well, we know that he's gonna place that later. Place the spy again. Okay. Oh, okay, so I think pass now. Cause he would have to use a shit ton. I'm not, de yeah, I know he has another spy in his deck so I can decoy that later. So he either has to lose the round 
He's gonna pass. There's no way he's gonna try to beat that. Yeah. Nice. Okay, but we know he intentionally threw the first round. round. Alright, let's place these. We have Biting Frost, though. Oh, she, yeah. It's funny, whenever I do this, I always look at the leader. That's who I feel like I'm playing is the leader. Only thing I wish Gwent would have added an ability to see your stats, wins or losses, etc. Oh, you can't see your total wins across the entire game? There we go. All right, Jang, I'll catch you later. Thank you so much for hanging around and I hope you have a great rest of your week. Uh, let's see. I mean, I guess if I win this round, I'll be crushing it. But let's just go ahead and place Biting Frost. I think that that does the best right there. He revived somebody. Is that a medic? Yes, or a spy. Okay. Wow. I'm thinking spy and throw the round. That's where my, that's where I'm kind of leaning. Oh, I can revive a spy, can't I? What's in my deck? Hold on. Ah! Don't use that. Do I have a spy in my deck? I do. All right, so let's do that. Ah. Yeah, I don't think, no, but that's using Ven, or Yen. I think we should, mm. Yeah, we could use her revive the spy. I'm going to do that. Revive the spy. Doesn't really matter. Revive spy, get two more cards, and then we'll lose. Well, he only has nine points to begin with. Yeah, that was so good. I think we can still win this round, actually. Ooh, I think we should stick with it. Or we could pressure him for one more card, maybe? Oh, the Scorch would get rid of the two fours. Mm. I feel, I feel, mm. Oh, and then yeah, he has two points. Oh, now he's down to five cards. I would hold the pressure. Yeah, I think hold pressure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We're just winning by mittens at this point. I should do an archer. Yeah. You can revive a healer, then revive another card. Revive the healer? Like, what do you mean by that? Provoked penguin, what's up? Welcome back in. Mm. He has three cards left. I say we pressure him for one more, because then he goes into the next round with even less. But then I'd have to use one of these. Yeah. I think we can win, period, depending on what, if he has a Scorch or something, Commander's Horn. All right, but now he has two cards going into the next one, so I would say. Nah, I'm just gonna send it. I'm sending, I'm full sending. I'm full sending. Double Biting Frost. I'll use my Northern Realm. Oh, I didn't use it yet. Okay, that's not the worst thing in the world. I think I should pass, because I would not win, so we're passing. So he's gonna win this round, but he doesn't get an extra card, and he's gonna pass, and then I have more, yeah. Oh, I should have used an ability and baited the last card. I think he might have passed. Okay, that works out. All right, and then we win. <laughs> and then we're just there we go and a pass gg that was actually for a victory card right she's giving me oh she's giving me that time how i lost that oh i believe this card belongs to you now no any other players i love that he's so old cards. that he reruns into his he old flames brand. too siggy rubin's collection is famous siggy you really should challenge him <gasps> another one Another one. All right, let's see. How about now after I won Gwent? Yes. 
piss off. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Oh, you want your ass kick? You shouldn't have stuck it out so far. I heard that, and then I. <laughs> All right, you scared the crap out of me, B Dubs. I heard Francesca. Hold up. Who is Francesca? Thanks, y'all. Brawly and Yaku, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Hold up. We Vesemir, we need to add to it. Guys, we can try the new hand. Vesemir and Nilf Guardian. Who's our girl that we got? Oh, it was a leader. What? Oh, Francesca was a leader. Oh, do not let my beauty distract your aim. Doubles all the strength of all of your ranged combat cards. Wait, that's awesome. Milfgard. <laughs> that's amazing. Wesley, welcome in as well. All right, so we have one more, I think. I think there's one more. Oh, wait, hold on. It keeps changing the quest on me. No. Bad. Put it back on. Put it back on. Where is it? Don't do the next one. No, 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 no. The Merry Widow. At some point, I will catch up. Actually, I should do the cat gear, shouldn't I do? Shouldn't I do? Shouldn't I? Did I finish that? She told me another lead, but I guess... Don't do the next one yet. She gave me another lead, but I don't think I can to begin with. So we're going to do Ladies of the Wood. So we need to read Ladies of the Wood first. This is perfect timing. I heard the girl scream too, so I thought it actually happened. Should be right here. Ladies of the Wood. The gods have abandoned us. The mighty of this earth care not for our fate. Only the ladies of the wood watch over Velen. In foul times, when plague and famine reap their harvest, we must beg the ladies for help. If they see fit, they will hear our pleas and knock back fortune's foul blows. This is how one begs help from the ladies. Find a child, young and innocent, and take it to the crookback bog. Seek out the lady's shrine. Tis where the tales, the trail of treats begins. Set the child off on the trail, and it shall follow the sweet track and find the good ladies. The child will never want for anything again, for the ladies are kind and generous. Stand before their shrine, pronounce their supplication, and the good ladies will hear, for they see and hear all that takes place in their demesen? Dem Fidel. What the heck? Dude, there wasn't even a thing that went with it. Holy cow, Fidel, thank you so much for the donation. What the hell? If you made an offering as this to be done, your plea shall be heard. There was no, you didn't even do a message with it. Jai, welcome in. Bilbo, welcome back in. Oh, I always want to say Bilbo. Bilo, welcome back in. Fidel, thank you so much for the donation. Holy beans. It is like Hansel and Gretel. Well, I think that's what the person was doing when they put, um, the girl, Gretel? Yeah, Gretel. I think that's what they were doing. Holy cow, thank you. <sighs> Finally got the cool sunglasses on Carol. Mm, so I need to go to a bog or some sort. Gretka. But it translates to Gretel. Somebody said it translates to Gretel. But we did read it. So if I read it, we should be good now. You guys are bananas. I actually have bananas too. I have freeze dried bananas as well. Um, the Ladies of the Woods, you've already read this. So do I need to reread it? Dom, thanks for the posture check. Did someone say bog? All that makes me think of is that one bog. <laughs> the bog in um, mm, Miraculous Guide to Gwent. What? Number of cards which can be won from players of no particular renown of skill. 28. Fidel, thank you. No, it is so much more than that. Thank you so much. Cat School of Gear update. I think we should get the cat gear. I think before I go further. I'm gonna read the other, no, I'm gonna read the other books and items too. I have to like, I feel like I need to check off some before I do anything else. 
White Wolf, thanks for the follow and welcome in, and as, as well as Sir Joe. Mm, when I remember the amount of hours to play to beat the entire game, I already know what I will <laughs> have to wait for my retirement to do, so I delight as a spectator. <laughs> This actually would be a fantastic game in retirement, I'm sure. You could actually do all of it. Sar, The creator and author of Witcher is famous for putting its spin on its own fairy tales. The Grimm Brothers tales. Zar, I feel like it's been a while. No, Zar, thank you so much for five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Thank you so much. I read that as Luca, user not valid, Josh, hot sauce, and Corey. Y'all, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Thank you so much. No, I haven't, Dom. I haven't. It's actually right here. Wait, what I'm looking for is right... Hold on, before I do anything. I'm gonna try to watch it tomorrow and record it. The notice board. Hmm... Did you watch it already? Everybody's saying such good things about it. Bay, welcome in as well. Ha hum hmm hmm. Alright, this one's not giving us an exact. I think it's up here. Find the armor upgrade diagram using your Witcher senses. Oh. But I'm not trying to do the cat gear. Did it just change me to that? Is that what's happening right now? Yes. That is what's happening right now. So we need to go back to Novigrad. Hold on. Bunny dog, what's up? Bunny dung. Bunny dog. All right, here we go. So I need to go to a fast travel, travel, fast travel. All these cats hate me. You can't wear the cat ear yet, by the way, oh, you're too like low right. level. Ugh. Yours. I've got to wait longer. I'm pretty low level too. I'm trying to wait to put on the gear that we collected when we saw Yen. Remember she had some special gear for us somewhere or something? DC, welcome back in. Uh, don't worry, you just missed an excellent Gwent game. It was top notch, okay? C6, what's up? Welcome back in as well. Yeah, I need to read the character cards too. There's so much reading to do in this game. I'm not neglecting it. I'm kind of stocking up on some of it first. This makes me think of, uh... Oh, what is that place? Whoa, that's a big dog. All right, this is why I have to path things because I never can see on my own. Like, what? I was right there. I was right there. Want a smack? Looking for a rise? Watch it, Greyhead. Hey. Looking for a rise? No. Ah. Oh. Shady individual. <laughs> I like the descriptions on everybody in the town. Don't worry. Uh, will be 17 in no time on day 30 of my Witcher 3 exploration. I hate this question so much. Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Milk before the cereal? I mean, it just seems impractical because I feel like you're gonna be able to put less cereal into the milk. So I feel like if you're trying to get the maximum amount of like crispies to cereal ratio, you should always put cereal first. Do I think any differently about them? No, because at the end of the day, in your stomach, it's still milk and cereal. So. Bonus for working in piss poor weather. Oh, in piss poor weather. In hopes of a new story game video. <laughs> like which one? Are you not talking about Life is Strange? Shoot here, by the way. Welcome back in. No milk, dry cereal. I used to eat dry cereal, like dry Cheerios. I used to do that all the time when I was in. Um, holy cow. I appreciated cereal so much when I was in my tech school. For Life is Strange. Uh, tomorrow. The uploads for YouTube are back to normal schedule, so uploads are on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays again. So, that's what, I'm sticking with that, because I know that I can deliver three videos a week, but I'm hoping to start to be able to work on some other things, and maybe every, every so often get more videos out to you guys. I'm doing. Yeah, yeah, Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try to keep them around 4 p.m. Eastern. That's what I've been doing it so far at. All right, so have I, actually, I don't, have I been here before? I must have, but I don't think I've, hold on. I don't care if you're sleeping, you're gonna get up and you are going to play me and Gwent. Hey, hey. 
Hey. Hold on. I'm gonna sleep with you. And when I wake up, you're gonna play me. Hold on. Kata's milk first, Casta. Da, da, da. I mean, it, it's all just a... The milk is a conduit for the cereal for me. Like, it's just a means to an end. I feel like... There he is. Hey. Milk, you. Freshly curded milk. Egg straight from the coop. I don't want to hear about milk. I don't want to hear about milk. Ah, oh, I've already played him. Damn it. So Does she really? <laughs> I need to message her about that now. I feel... <laughs> Oh man. The question is what kind of milk? Like is it almond milk? Are we talking about 2% milk? Whole milk? What kind of milk? Milk? What is milk? Alright, we're headed downtown. This way. Where's Rochi Poo? Whole milk? Roach just came Roach. out of nowhere. So much for a quest. <laughs> I'm on the way to the quest. <laughs> we were gonna take a quick, quick stop. Just briefly. Get up. Roach. Roach. All right, weed. Come on. Come on, man. Real milk. The rest is unhealthy trash. Wait, dragon. Dragon, dragon. Dragons. Harpies and dragons. Hold on. Kill it. A wyvern. All right, let's do this. Wait, we actually can use our oil now. <gasps> yes. Mm -hmm. Vampire oil. There we go. Let's check it out. I'll do two percent usually. I feel like two percent is right. I like that silver. That was way too easy. I cannot loot the body? Oh, there's the entrails. There we go. It was pregnant. There was a wyvern egg. Oh no, it was pregnant. No. <laughs> Top with cheese curds and you've got, wait, what about cheese curds? I told you guys about how one of my roommates one time, she was from Wisconsin and all she would talk about is cheese curds. So when she finally went home to visit her family, <laughs> we had a mini fridge. <laughs> And she brought back an entire mini fridge worth of cheese curds. And she always had cheese curds and triscuits. And that was, whoa. That was pretty much it. That was all it was. Pork miss. <laughs> oh my god, pork. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Wisconsin. It's in there somewhere. Mayo, what's up? Welcome back in. I feel like you've been so busy lately. I hope you're doing well. <laughs> hmm. Right there. Okay, they are really good. With the Triscuit? Mmm. Y'all, I love a good Triscuit. Over here. Follow them. It was a pretty good story, but I had zero room for my things. And I... <laughs> it's not that I had any problem with cheese curds, but I wanted space for, like... I think at the time I was obsessed with raspberries or some kind of fruit and she was like cheese is more important than fruit and I was like okay that's fair fair enough to be fair oh all right yeah let's follow it all Ken what's up welcome in as well I'm not talking shit about cheese curds I loved them I haven't had a real cheese curd in so long like a Wisconsin cheese curd cheese curd but whenever this mug goes I'm gonna have to take a trip to the Wisconsin airport to get another one and then I'll pick up some cheese curds too Aramaic, what's up? Welcome back in. There's bad types of Gwent story time and questing. There's no in between. It's one or the other. Winds howling. Mm. The winds howling. Are these the treats that they say? That's what of? she said. <laughs> <laughs> Dads, what's up? Welcome back in. Come to Wisconsin. Triv and I will take you to the cheese curd state fair. Oh, state war. I thought there was an entire fair just for cheese curds. Although I guess you probably could. I feel like I have less time. I don't know how that works, but that uh, in the kitchen. it's because so you have more time to do meat. things you actually want to do, Cut Maya. That's what it is. Strip your boy's feet. Cook them blood and empty. Strip the skin off clean. Laughed and said how tasty. Best sausage I have seen. Cook's a stupid killer. 
Shouldn't have ate the pup. Now we're like a fire. Gonna roast him up. One, two, three. The one to fetch the kindlings. Mm -hmm. Thee! It's all about cream puffs. Interesting rhyme. Don't know you. Go away. Don't know you. <laughs> they all have the same face. <laughs> all right, here we go. I'm looking for a witch. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing in my swamp? <laughs> what are you doing out here alone? We's not alone. We's with Gran. But where did you all come from? With Gran. We's orphans. All of you? There's a war. So there's orphans. Didn't know that. I guess I didn't. <laughs> I'm looking for a witch. I'm looking for the witches of Crookback Bog. You looks like a witch yourself. <gasps> That's cool. Witches? Of the bog. We can't go in the bog. Gran don't let us. When Are you sure? Zemek went missing. Gran said it was because he went in the woods and We got just need lost. one kid to go into the woods. Gran cried an awful lot one. after that. He could still come back. Ever seen an ashen haired woman around here? I didn't know that. What instruments do you play? A young Trying to get woman some travel time in there in too. Swamp. Fair enough. She has ashen hair and a scar on her face. You kids see anyone like that? Ain't no lassies here. Ain't no Who lassies here. <laughs> You're no lassie. Lassies got tits. They do. Heard an old man say once when the army was here. He says, hide them lassies in the woods. They's dazzling the soldiers with their tits. And it's torturing the poor lads. That's Nobody can said. question their memory. The girl is in trouble. You live here alone. The girl's in trouble. Listen, the girl I'm looking for, she's in trouble. I understand you might not want to help me, but you could try to help her. How you know she was here? I heard she visited the witches in the swamp. But there's no witches here. There's only frogs. No. <laughs> and snakes. And Johnny. What's this talk? What kind of jabbering is this, eh? Granny. No one allowed here. Just kids. My kids. They're allowed. But who are you? Wearing swords like a bandit. Uh Who's Johnny? Oh, true. You take care of the kids. Are you a witch? I'm looking for someone. I'm going to say who's Johnny. Johnny? Who's that? Guitar and sing. That's awesome. Ever since Last of Us, I want to pick up the guitar, even if I can learn like one song. I'm doing better with the piano. Like being consistent is helping for sure. Um, I just get bad feelings about this all over. But I was going to, oh, I was going to mention that I love the detail in his just his demeanor changed around the kids and even his voice went up a little bit of a pitch as most people do when they're talking you know like to animals or kids or stuff like that but it's just such a small subtle thing but he is so much different like so much more different who's johnny who's johnny 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 ate a cat come the more in some furry shot what's Ew. your language they tell Ew. tales and tales nor but tales you take care of the kids. You look after these kids? They're my grandchildren. Gran's good to us. Gonna be soup with scratchings for supper. Kids get lost in the woods. I miss them. Seen them in the woods. No one has. Honestly, the detail on her face is really good too. Are you one of the witches of the swamp? I hear Crookback Bog. Witch? Me? Nay, I've no broom nor owl and not one wart on me nose. Got a pretty nose, see? Gran's got, <laughs> got a, a pretty bit. nose. Oh, you darling girl. Oh, kids are so sweet. First of all, the music is not helping this situation, but Gran's got a lovely beak, by the way. <laughs> Voice acting is top tier, especially when you get to the DLCs. Ah, oh, you guys are talking up the DLCs so much. Just talking to the kids. Asked them if they'd seen a young woman. Oh, it was a lovely young woman. Wore a long, beautiful braid my mummy did up for me. Had dresses with flowers on them. Swear Maybe I've heard her voice her. in Game of Thrones young, somewhere. ashen hair. You're betrothed. Daughter, actually. Daughter? My dear, sweet little daughter. And her sister. Where are they now? Maybe they've come to some harm. Vidal, thank you. Please talk to me. Please help me. Talk. Let's say talk. Had about like enough of this. Asked a simple question. Oh. You've seen the woman or haven't you? Fear not, children. There's no to fear, I just cracked so much. He's only angry because he cares. Maybe oh. Johnny knows something. Knows I'll take him to Johnny. 
before he goes barmy on us. Johnny's your invention, and you shouldn't be using those Johnny? ugly words. To the hut. Go on now. You'll Lucas, stand in yeah. the corner. I'll make sure you do. And you stop scaring the little ones. Now go. Be, be gone. gone. Be gone. Get out of here. Guys, why is it Wednesday and I'm not drinking White Claws? I just realized something's wrong with this. Okay, so Johnny's their own invention. Oh. All right, let's see the character edition for that. I can't help but see that. Anna. Anna. Oh, the Baron's wife. Aradin. Ah, I see why you're saying that it's good because this is how I'm going to learn the lore behind some people too. Yeah, Lucas, I would say easily becoming number one in my games. Here we go. The name of the king of the wild hunt. The identity of the lord of nightmares. The being behind the frightful mask. This long remained unknown. Over time, however, scraps of information gradually coalesced, 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 coalesced into a full likeness of our foe but did nothing to detract from the terror he inspired. The Wild Hunt was in truth an elite cavalry brigade from the world of the Ainel, the Alder Folk, and was commanded by their ambitious and ruthless king, Aradin. Oh, we've heard that name before. He would travel via secret paths through the cold emptiness between his world from ours to capture victims and take them back to his homeland as slaves. The current object of the hunt was Cirilla, whose powers he wanted to harness for his own uses. The only obstacle in his path, Geralt of Rivia. Mm. It is like Sauron. It really does look like Sauron. Yes, Corver. Yes, you did. You were right. The ending is so cool to The Witcher. Has a giant satellite? What? Shell shock. What? Felicia. I don't remember even seeing Felicia. All right, guys, it's going to be story time. Are we ready? Because there's a lot of people. All right, here we go. We're going to read like a couple and then maybe stop and then read a couple more. I feel like I want to get to know. Okay. Many cannot fathom the friendship Geralt of Rivia and I, Dandelion, have shared all these years. Wait, is Dandelion the, um, is that the toss a coin to you, Witcher? Is that the bard? Is Dandelion the bard? Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's right there. That's how we know. Have We haven't met him, though, yet, right? I don't remember seeing Dandelion. Hmm. I would have... I would have remembered him. Okay, we haven't met him yet. So there's people in our character list that we have yet to even meet. Okay. Okay. When we first began breaking bread together, spiteful tongues said he'd be better off cutting my throat and dumping my body in a hollow tree before I provoked someone else into doing the same to us both. Those individuals spoke out of pure jealousy, for Geralt was my dearest friend, a fact which he gave ample evidence of on numerous occasions. I could say a great deal about the world-famous monster hunter, the man known in elder speech as Gwynblade or in our younger, yet no less noble tongue, as the White Wolf, for Geralt of Rivia is truly exceptional individual. A brief encounter might tempt one to label him as a mere swinger of swords, a simple monster catcher, or a rough and tumble practitioner of the dirty blade, or trade. But peer closer, and you will soon discover he is a man of unplummeted depths, unplumbed depths, unique views, and vast world-spanning experience. On the surface, he is introverted, tight-lipped, one might even say gruff, but underneath lies an overflowing sea of goodwill, good humor, and honest readiness to help his friends, be it with a bit of sound advice or masterful application of his blade. Setting aside cumbersome false modesty, I can say that I know his story better than any man alive. Kitchen, I'm reading here! <laughs> <laughs> you're like perfect time for a chicken leg <laughs> kitchen thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs to the channel and community and y'all i hope you enjoy the sub emotes if you got one and please give a big thanks to kitchen as well thank you i'm walking here i'm walking here gwen equals white or blessed and blade is wolf ah read with background alert music 
<laughs> okay, I'm trying to focus, all right? The reading took too long. Wow, I thought it was good, all right? As a result, I am a vital part of his story, both in its earliest and present portions. It is thus my duty to continue my chronicle and for the benefit of future generations, put in writing the next chapter of his deeds or exploits. Kitchen. All right. Uh, I feel like we should go up. So I'm going to read up to Yennefer and then we'll stop and we'll play a little bit and then I'll go back and read some more people because this is really good background knowledge on the people. It's, I wish somebody had said something sooner. Like, it's crazy. I'm... <laughs> Night City, welcome back in, by the way. Eskel. All witchers have a great deal in common, but with Eskel and Geralt, the similarities are particularly striking. They first met as two boys of the same age, swinging wooden swords at Kaer Morin. They then went through an ordeal together, the first round of selections, the murderous changes, the trial of the grasses, and training on the gauntlet, the witcher's daunting obstacle course. They also received hidings together for more than one act of childish delinquency. When they became adults, they walked the path separately, but still recovered at Kaer Morin. Kaer Morin? Nearly every winter to wait out the cold, drink their successes, and remember fallen comrades. Though Eskel never gained Geralt's renown, he equaled the White Wolf in experience and carried out his contracts with care and efficiency. Death had almost taken him many times during his hunts, yet in an ironic twist of the hideous scar on his face came not from a monster's claw, but from the blade of Deidre, Deidre? his highly unpredictable, unexpected child. Deidre who? Okay, Deidre who? You gotta include Grand. Oh, we do have to read Grand. Okay, we do have to read Grand as well. They don't take too long. Promise you'll read every entry in Mass Effect. Well, I kind of feel like I screwed myself over because I should have read all of the beginning characters right off the rip and then just read them as we added more, but it's okay. Yeah. Who? what's up? Welcome back in. Uh, Life is strange all over again. Maggie reading the entire journal and all the character entries. <laughs> Yeah, my life is strange has been a lot of reading, that's for sure. All right, Dandelion. I would wager anyone that you, dear reader, or a person of culture and taste, doubtful, and therefore already familiar with me, Dandelion, and the role I am to play in the following tale. Nevertheless, allow me to sketch a few lines by way of self-portrait, for the sake of thoroughness, and in the event that you have spent much of the last half century in some dark corner where the light of my star has yet to reach. <laughs> He's a little cocky. All right. Born in 1229, a talented poet and troubadour, a graduate of Oxford Academy, a frequent performer at royal courts, an unequaled lover appreciated, and in some cases adored by ladies worldwide, a skilled negotiator and stirring orator. Such is the image of the bard dandelion as painted by his friends or promoters. This image is, of course, somewhat overbright in his coloring. I personally prefer to think of myself as a dedicated artist in thrall to his muse, one whose work has benefited immeasurably from the fact that I was, am, and forever will remain a close friend and steadfast companion to the Witcher Geralt. It is his fate I chronicle in this present work, and his story which I shall sing to the end of my days. He's so cute. <laughs> Boot failure, what's up? Welcome back in. I actually really like that. Cirilla, here we go. Oh, she has a long journal entry, which is important because she is one of our main protagonists. So this is really important. And Lord, welcome back in. How's it going? Ah, uh, reading and video games, what? Cirilla, Fiona, Ellen, Rhiannon. Okay, what can I possibly say about her? That we call her Siri for short, and she was born in 1251. That she has ashen hair and a scar on her cheek. All true. Oh, there we go. All true. That's the Cirilla I know best. The one I first laid eyes upon many years ago. The one who seemed thoroughly, well, not ordinary, but certainly not as extraordinary as she in fact is. For Cirilla is also a highly skilled witcher, heiress to several thrones and the last bearer of elder blood a powerful source endowed with exceptional magic talent and the lady of time and space her hair and cut date of birth seem rather incidental now don't they ah you guys talked about that the elder blood 
I could also tell you that she is Geralt's adopted daughter, but that would be a gross simplification. Ciri is much more. She is his destiny, his unexpected child, someone bound to be the bound to the Witcher by fate, most inextricably, inexpressibly tangled fetters. Following age-old Witcher tradition, Geralt took Ciri to Kaer Morhen when she came into his care. There here, he and Vesemir taught her in ways of the professional monster slayer. It was there that her magic talents were first revealed, and they discovered she was a source. A source. The child surprise. Guys, thank you for the follows. Um, Ciri's gift provided a curse as well. Because of it, she would only, or she would one day have to hide from the world, even Geralt. Ciri's biography contained one more great secret. Her natural father was none other than the Emperor of Nilfgaard, Amir. Oh, different Amir than the one that we read earlier. His words confirmed the fears swirling in Geralt's mind. Ciri had returned and was in mortal danger, for the unrelenting Wild Hunt was on her trail. Yennefer made it clear why the Wild Hunt wanted Ciri. Aridin wanted the power latent in her elder blood. She, was also let, she also let Geralt know that Ciri has been seen in war-ravaged Velen as well as in Novigrad, the largest city in the world. It didn't seem that large. Reports that Ciri had spent time at Crow's Perch proved true. She was there as the guest of a local warlord, Philip Stranger, also known as the Bloody Baron. Despite his violent moniker, this man treated Ciri with kindness and respect. It seemed that during Ciri's time in Velen, she got into a quarrel. A quell. That's one of my favorite words. <laughs> we got into a quell with some sort of witch or witches in the swamps. Okay. And then let's read the old lady. We'll read Grand's story as well. Some of these are going to be shorter too, so it won't take up that much time. The game is based on the book, so it's not a surprise that there's a lot of reading. I think that adds to it. I should have been doing it from the start because like I said, I would have had the baseline characters and then I could have built on that. Now I have to kind of go back and read a couple at a time. But that's really good background knowledge. I actually wonder if there's stories, like see how Cyrilla's story goes all the way up to the witch or witches in the swamp, I wonder if it continues to add to it as you progress through the game. So you can keep going back to the characters. Oh, there we go. Roth. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so it updates as time goes on. Yeah, so you kind of have to stay on top of it. Novigrad is small by our standards, gigantic by their standards. That's fair. I guess I was assuming that maybe some of the other places were even larger. I haven't zoomed out and into the other ones. But Fidel, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And thank you. I really appreciate the continual support. Stanley and OG, welcome in as well. All right, so let's see, Graham. In times of war, one often encounters those who have suffered cruelty at the hands of fate. Geralt was thus not shocked to meet the woman who the children in the Velen swamps called Graham, though she seemed to have suffered manifold unspecified ills. Whatever her woes, it is clear she cared for the war orphans in her charge with love and devotion. Okay. I have to go get some- Yes! Wait, wait, uh, I think- is this your last day? You said you were headed back out tomorrow, so have fun. Good luck. Crush it. I'm sure you will. But, thank you. And be safe. I'm a fan of the story time with guests. <laughs> All right, everybody gather your tea, gather your blankets, and let's get cozy and read the tale of Granny. Benji. First things first, we're going to steal everything. <gasps> I think I needed a Torfin spirit. Pretty sure. Don't mind if I do. Oh! Great balls of fire. How could I forget? <laughs> oh, hold on. How could I forget? Mmm. Mmm. Be still my beating heart. Do you see that? 130? Woo! Oh my gosh. Oh, fiddlesticks. <laughs> the character entries update alongside the progress you make throughout the game. I think that is such an amazing detail in the game that can often be overlooked if you're just focusing on the storyline. So thank you for reminding me that that exists. And I will try to keep up to date with readings more. Mmm. Loot it all. Steal everything. Mm. Alright, that should be everything. Mika, what's up? Welcome back in. I think there's something even right here. Sean, welcome back in too. Give me that rope. Leave nothing for the children. Oh. Travic. Can't come in here. Oh. Not allowed in here. I just want to talk to the boy. Not allowed. Can it's everything. not allowed. He won't talk to you anyway. Gran don't like you. 
and and Johnny's made up. And and Stranger Steel Still kids. kids. Og dog, thank you so much for the reset for seven months in a row. And yes, I was going to say it has been a hot minute. How are you? Thank you. I hope you're off to a good start to your new year. Where can I find this Johnny boy? Johnny boy. You don't want to talk to me? Where can I find Johnny? Just tell me where I can find Johnny. Johnny's made up. Be gone. I don't believe it. Be gone. Honestly, pretty sure that Schmeagol's mother. I'm getting strong Gollum vibes and sounds there. All right, talk to all the kids. Why don't you want to talk about Johnny? One of you knows about him. The others must too. It's just him who's pals with Johnny. Oh. They pick mushrooms and hunt snails. But Gran says Johnny's made up. Have you ever seen Johnny? Your friends are not afraid to go into the woods? The boy who plays with Johnny, he must be brave. Not brave, just stupid. Sat his bare bum on an anthill once. Oh. But yeah, he plays with Johnny. He don't Sat listen to bum and on an ant hill. And then he's got to have a time out. And he eats snails. Yuck. Hmm. Let's see if she's ever Does your grand treat you right? Fully fresh. She welcome back. You? Never. When we're bad, she cries. She's scared. Say strangers might take us. And we'll disappear. Aww. Something weird is happening here. Performer, what's up? Welcome in. And thank you for the follow, Fear and Sin. Have any of you ever seen Johnny? Of course. Looks just like him. Then why do you say he's made up? Gran says so. And Gran knows lots. Oh, does she now? The girl I mentioned is in danger. You gotta help me get your Gran away from the hut so I can talk to Johnny's friend. All right. But you gotta do something for us, too. Play hide and seek. Gran never does. Says her feet hurt. Oh. Is there something else you want? Can I just give them money? Do I have to play hide and seek? Ugh. That's Littles. <laughs> Is he a little liar? She was very gollum me At the end there, or like Bilbo Baggins when he was like, mine. Or he was like, you know, when he turns into the crazy If the a crazy stubborn face. beast you be, I have no choice. You still live before cell phones. It's so insane that they used to go outside and play. All right, fine. I'll play hide Let's and seek. Let's play. You hide, but if I find you, you have to help me talk to the boy who knows Johnny. Wait, this will be fun. He'll find us easy. Means he's never hid from the You're black in game one. Plus. No looking, and you have to count out loud. All your fingers, toes, too. Oh, toes, too. One, two, three. It's kind of after 18, reading his 19, um, character 20. description, I feel like I got a little bit better sense of it. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, yeah, I can use my Witcher senses. Ooh. Let's see if I can find them without using my Witcher senses. All right. Behind here. Hmm. Here? In the stump. Maybe I have better hiding spots than they would have. In the barn. The Orphans of Crookback Fog. I reckon there might be somebody in the log right there. Hello? Under here? Tango, what's up? Welcome in. Big man, welcome back in too. Yes, when he sees it with the greed. Wait, oh, they could be up too. Maybe. Well, I'm wondering if you have to use it. Hmm. There's definitely one in here. <gasps> See ya. See you. Come out. How'd you find me? Maybe I'm thinking too bigger picture, but also more stuff to loot. Fool's parsley leaves. Not bad. Anyone in the barrel? Like I'm thinking too. Uh, yeah, no. Yoshi, welcome back in. You're right. Remember, kids are tough. <laughs> Journey to the end of the world. Journey to the center of the earth. Sirens, the harpies, distant relatives, are winged monsters found in Skellig... Skellig? No, we're not starting this again. I'm leaving that. We're not starting that again. That word shall not be mentioned in this stream. We are done. But you can add bestiaries by reading things? Okay, that is another big reason to... Sirens... Uh, we just got all of those added. A succubi. Don't mind if I do. Um, oh yeah, I didn't look at those. The Hounds of the Wild Hunt. I need to read up on those hybrids. Here we go. 
Mmm. That's crazy. Harpies. Seems like they're all susceptible to that. Look at the siren. What is happening? Are those wings or is that coming out of her tail? I guess those wings are separate from her tail. Mmm. Be sure to open them. Yeah, I need to go back through and open them. I'm saving them because I do want to go back and read some of those. We just encountered a word that shall not be. Not Skellige. But it wasn't the word. It was the one after. A succubi. Unlike other monsters, succubi and menads feel no desire to kill. Do not crave human blood and usually do not, in fact, mean any harm at all. They are motivated by one thing only and one thing and one thing only. An insatiable lust. They try in vain to slake this by engaging in sexual acts with other humanoid species they encounter. Mm. Though succubi are peaceful by nature, when forced to fight, they will defend themselves fiercely. One should thus not be fooled by their fair appearance. Under the velvety skin of their arms lie muscles of iron and blow delivered with their rear. Goat-like legs. Okay, I need to finish reading that. Or their thick horns on their head, which can easily crush bone. Ooh. That one is different, though. That one is a quensine. But the other ones are susceptible to ard? Yeah. Mmm. Sir Joe, by the way, I hope you're enjoying the channel. Uh, there's definitely a bloody rock here. I think that might be kind of important. Just maybe important. Mm. Glad we finished that one right there. Here? Kitty, kitty, kitty. Retro, what's up? Welcome back in. Somebody's behind here for sure. In this pile. There. There's something right there. I'm pretty sure there's a kid in there. I ran into something. Okay, we're not gonna smack them. Why can't he find Why can't we run into there we go. There you are. Another one. Alright. Alright, so that's two down. Were there four kids to begin with? I think there were four kids to begin with. Hmm. A hornwort. Miguel, what's up? Welcome in. Kids, 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 kids. The tree. Up in the tree, maybe? No, they're too small for that. Hmm. I'm thinking too. Maybe they got up here. I know I can use my witcher senses, but I don't want to. See, I would have hid in the trunk. I feel like that's next level. I miss when Hydra was 500, so I could annoy me. <laughs> I know when you guys start exploiting certain... Uh... Oh, jeez. Certain redemptions. This is the cost and the consequence of y'all's actions. Baseball, welcome back in. I feel like I'm gonna have to use it. All right, which your senses it is? These little pesky kids. I'm pretty sure I found one, by the way. Mm. I think where I was punching was in fact a kid. I think there was a kid there. It's gotta be a rock. See, I thought they were like in a log. There's three homes. Oh, there are three homes. Wait, let's go back in here real quick. All right, there's no more kids in here. I didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't do it. Fozzie, what's up? Welcome in. Oh, Granny's in there. We can't go in the locked place. But I still think that there might be one behind here. No, oh, there we go. No witcher senses needed. Oh, we already talked to her. I know it's got to be so simple. I see it like I, mm, I'm overthinking. <laughs> I'm over, oh no, oh no. We're overthinking. Maybe there's three kids total? In here. Oh, in the side house. Here we go. I spy with my little eyes. Y'all, I see. Oh, Granny's in here. The other home was locked, but this one wasn't locked. Okay. Before we can talk to him. Oh, the loot. We already looted. Is it right in plain sight? Is that what this is? We have two right there. It's that. I've never gone into that one. Oh my goodness. It's locked. Requires a key. There we go. Footsteps. Footsteps. What? I can climb up that? 
I can't climbed up there. I'm supposed to... Eric, I hope you have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. <laughs> oh my gosh. I wasn't gonna check the... the roof? Hello. Where is it? I think it was a sayer. There's no way this kid went all the way to the top, so where is he? Where is this kid? Ah! He was right in front of me, wasn't he? Damn it, these pesky kids. <laughs> He's gotta be right here. Mmm. Oh, that was the cutest little sneeze ever. See, I know. See you. Really? Y'all, I was pressing A right in front of it. Do not do that. I knew that they were right there and I was pressing A, but I think because I didn't use my Witcher senses, I wasn't able to see that they were right there, maybe? What? I was, I already picked up on that scent. Yeah, I think you have to use the senses to find at least some of them. There's one more. There is one more. Most hated mission in the entire game was finding these kids. And I would have gotten away with it if it wasn't for you meddling kids. Mm, I'm forced to cheat. Like I half expect to see them in somewhere I've checked before. You know, you lost the kid, bad parenting. <laughs> to be fair. Look, I already found three of them. Do we really have to find the fourth one? Totally not necessary. Some bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. I bet he's up in the tree and I already, wait, I heard something. Hmm. Pi! I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. Pi, welcome back in. And Miguel, thank you for the follow as well as Lucid. I'm telling you, these pesky kids. Oh my. There it is. Okay. Wait, maybe it's. Maybe he went over here first. No, he definitely. Where are the footsteps going? Oh. Oh, they're inside the house. Or did they come from this way? I hated this because I left my cousins at their hiding spot for hours. <laughs> no one left hiding. You're a wizard, that, right? Gonna show us some tricks. That is a little bit of an annoying, no, I would say. We'll talk about your promise. Creeper. <laughs> it was kind of an annoying mission. I was hoping you could Found do it without all. the now senses. You keep your word and help me talk to Johnny's friend. Why wouldn't we? Promise, didn't we? Oh. You might want to prepare for the werebears. The werebears there? Whatever. It's a werebear. Gran! You've been busy? Gran! Hopefully it's a good busy. Bumblebee bit Yagner in the arse. <laughs> Gran! Come! This is kind of, if you think about this, this is kind of messed up. We're trying to isolate a kid to be able to talk to him without his parental guardian. Geralt, please. Don't be afraid. Don't know nothing. I won't hurt you. Awesome, thank you. Welcome in. And inked Where's as well, guys. Gran? She's busy. A werewolf? A werewolf? Why are you afraid? Where are your parents? Where are you and your friend's parents? Dad. Some starved. Others were killed. Like mine. One day, <laughs> we went out at dawn to Urban. the berries in the woods. Still some around back then. When I was coming home, I heard the yells. Then laughing. <laughs> went up and hid in the bushes near the woods. My mum yelled. And the soldiers laughed. <laughs> Lay my part down by the barn door. Aww. His head cleaned off. And then my mum. It's all right. That's enough. Hmm. Why are you afraid? Why are you scared to talk? You're not scared of nothing. You're all scared of something. Would have told me about Johnny otherwise. I'm worried about Johnny. He don't come round no more. Once, when we was mushroom picking, I saw his burrow. But 
Gran yelled at me. His burrow. Not to talk to strangers, because then kids go missing. She worries about Johnny too. His mushroom so burrow. She says he's made up. But thank you so much for the prime sub. I'm glad to see you're enjoying the channel and also choosing to use your prime here. Thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy the ginger remotes and supply my high welcome back into mm, Plant Boy. Hello as well. I just and want to talk to Johnny. He could know more than you. Not gonna hurt him, right? Because he's real. He's not made up. I feel like he's an animal. Like I'm a... not gonna hurt him. Johnny used to be boy. Because Gran liked listening to his songs. When we was picking mushrooms, Johnny said he saw a girl with ashen oh. hair in the swamp. It's Where Keanu can Reeves. I find Johnny? There's a little meadow on the edge of the swamp. This strange tree grows there. Look around. You'll see him. Thank you. Um... <laughs> I think I'm gonna realize this multiple times in this game but holy cow how can you not like I don't know how to describe this right I'm thinking of the immense amount of dialogue that they have put into this game and the time that they spent probably creating all the different options in the dialogue choice it was like it just blows my mind like these are just side well this is like a main mission right but all of the side missions, even the main missions, all of the little small dialogue conversations, the emotions that all of the voice actors have thrown into them. It's I've just never seen so much for a game. It's incredible. It's deep, but these devs loved their art. I mean, this was a passion project. Like, this is not just a game. Like, it really is. Like, I, I say I feel like I say that a game is a work of art a lot, but this was absolutely created with all love like absolute love and passion 35 hours total of dialogue <laughs> yeah this game does it right there's over 30 or 40 total endings because of how much side missions impact the overall story like think about i think because like my production manager side is coming out and i'm like oh my god thinking about like all of the dialogue and how they need to intertwine to connect to each other and all the different routes like you said with different endings i'm thinking of the storyboard like i'm thinking of the storyboard and it's stressing me out <laughs> guys thank you so much for the resubs like it's stressing me out in a good way i'm just like that is such an incredible like just creation to take on it's truly incredible there's so many posts, so many. I'm thinking of all the like posted notes too and everything. Um, JSAC, thank you so much for the reset for 15 months in a row and welcome back in. Writer's room or hell, I'm sure. But at the same time, did the game, I know you guys spoke to the Netflix um, writers and everything, not really caring about the source material, but do you feel like the game did? It seems like the game did. Like the game's devs worked like side by side with the um, author, correct? Jay Sack, seriously, thank you so much for the continual support. And Moriarty, Moriarty, we meet again. <laughs> thank you so much for the reset for two months in a row and welcome back in as well. And I saw Tay. Tay, I hope you're having a great week and thank you so much for the continual support. Wizard, only good comments and 6-5 guys. Thank you for the follows and welcome back in. Um, four, wait, 4,045, 450. Holy cow. They save the work in a random NPC characters. It's why all the random merchants look the same. I'm okay with that. Like, I would take... Hmm, ooh, ooh, okay. You can only pick one. Great writing and dialogue. Great graphics. Or, like... No, I'd say that. Great graphics or great, like, dialogue. Which one's more important to you guys? You haven't even played... I know, I haven't... Lasagna, exactly. I haven't even gotten to the DLCs yet. It's just a setting. I don't know, it's setting in every single time I get to one of these missions. Probably because I haven't really been doing a lot of main missions. So maybe that's why it's all starting to, like, set in. But love and passion. Different. Like, for people to truly put their passion behind something, I mean, it shows through and through. Definitely one of the best games I played. Just recently started as well. I like watching other people to see the choices that they make. Oh, shoot. Welcome back in, by the way. Yeah, I, I'm actually really pleasantly 
surprised by the game. I was a little worried when I first started that I actually, it was going to let me down because of how many people say that it is the GOAT. But I mean, I, I get it now. I really do get it. And it's kind of cool to see that a game is so universally loved by so many different people. It's so many people's favorite game. You can see the effort and love that they put into it. A hundred percent. It helps that the author paints it pretty well. The devs just needed to add different branches to existing stories. Are a lot of the side missions drawn directly from books? There's a GDC conference with a flowchart of one mission. It's massive. Wait, I actually want to see that. I actually want to see that. Yeah, Rainmore, I've done actually a couple different things prior to going full time with this. I've actually, I am a, I always say a jack of all trades, master of none. I don't think they did. Uh, he didn't care for the games till he wanted more money. Really? JS, welcome in, by the way. But he sold the rights for it, right? Like, he's had to sell the rights for both the TV series and the game, no? And Tristan, dialogue, dialogue, good personality. Depends on the game genre, really. That That's a good point. You can have both. Just look at the quarry. <laughs> Praying, I was like, what? Don't worry, I'm not ending. I know it seems like I'm ending by having this conversation. I just got, um overwhelmed by the beauty i suppose i love the main story in this it's massively underrated the main story i think the side i'm surprised by how many of y'all talk so fondly of the side quest truly them's the rules <laughs> no it ticks no dem's not the rules about Corey. the author just wants more money because he signed a deal with the books were unknown wait wait what oh when the books were unknown what do you do you feel like the game made the books more known and then the TV series has now made all of them more known? Hottam, welcome back in. Don't be overwhelmed, just stay well. Just stay well. All right, back to it. He didn't sign the deal for a flat amount and got upset when it blew up that he didn't get a percentage question mark. Shoot, I would have gone for a percentage. I would have gone for a lower um initial, like a, a, a what is it called? The base pay and gone for more of like the continual sales and things like that. Even if you took like, I would say, what? I don't even know if you could do something like a, f I'm sure it wouldn't be like a 5% cut of each sale, but that would, that's truly crazy. It took me five years, but I platinumed the game and pretty much since I've done every side quest, it was an incredible journey. Don't you have to do this, all of the side quests to, hold on, we're going this way. Do you not have to do every single side quest to platinum the game? I don't know what it takes to plat this game. Mm. <laughs> Capster, what's up? Welcome back in. Yes, I intend to. I'm going to watch the movie tomorrow and record it. And then we're going to work on trying to... Uh, my editor and I just have to talk about how to do reactionary videos because they do have a different... Like, they have different rules that apply to them. But I really do want to. You've seen Lord of the Rings. Think about the chills you get from... For your own change, that's the game, what the game gives you. Yeah. I think that... I don't know why Lord of the Rings stuck with me. I think also I happen to really like Tolkien as a person. So I think that the author does have a little bit of an impact. I know that's kind of weird. I don't know so much anymore. But an author and their works is very... It says a lot. I like Tolkien. I loved, but I also grew up loving C.S. Lewis, and Tolkien and C.S. Lewis were good friends growing up. Oh, we better lag. It's like a loot goblin in Diablo. <laughs> the author didn't get much from the percentage of the first game, so he decided to do flat on the next two games. Woo! I'm burning him. Nice, 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 nice. <gasps> I've been waiting for water essence my whole life. I've been waiting for this. Nice is making bank with the game after all of the fun they made. I can't believe that the Netflix people aren't a big fan or like didn't work alongside alongside him, but maybe he didn't really want to be a part of it either. I mean, he had to have sold the rights for the film to Netflix. He had to have sold the rights and I'm sure he made a killing off of it. It's 9 p.m. and you're still going to the gym. I mean, that Papa John's do be looking nice. If John's <laughs> real, he must leave Prince. 30 books in the series, amazing. Johnny Prince. Oh, ow, hey. Sounds really poorly planned. Out stopping. Hold on, hey. No, you don't have the time. 
You don't have to do every side quest 100% of the game, but a decent amount of time. Hmm, I kind of want to look up what it takes to plat. What if the first game I was to ever plat would be this? That would be insane. I'd have to pull such, <laughs> have to be pulling 12 hour streams to put immense and heavy games. Yes, water essence, let's go. All right, so let's go back over here. <gasps> what is it? Is it red sun? Sailors, something, something dark side. Crazy enough, I've 100% the game twice. That's not crazy enough. It just means that you're passionate enough about the game. Passion, passion. Find Johnny's footsteps. Oh, Johnny boy. Sartorial, welcome back in. Red sun rises, blood has been spilled this night. Oh. Red in the morning, sailors take warning. Red in the night, sailors delight. Okay, so it's good. It's nighttime. He's good. He's good. <laughs> All right, I saw those things. No, I didn't say 12 hour stream. I needed that string, actually. Here, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. My cousin started playing it after the show. I feel like the show probably helps if you're not a huge fan of reading all of the intricacies and the uh, characters, the books, all of it that it gives you. But I feel like I want to play the game, read as much as possible out of this, and then go back and rewatch the TV series. Vintage, have Small a great night. Thank you so much for hanging around. And I hope Johnny's I see you Saturday. I hope I see you Saturday. And DJ, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. All right, let's see. Red sky at night, shepherd's delight. Red sky morning, shepherd's morn. That's the Irish one. <laughs> you can apply it to nearly anything. It's just, isn't it just the tell of a storm coming or not? Is that what it is? The Netflix staff doesn't want work with anyone. I remember when Netflix announced that they were going to make the series. I was so excited. I waited for years and then they butchered it. I mean, do you think it would have been worse had Henry Cavill not been on board with it too? Because didn't he fight for a lot of artistic similarities to the game or books? I can't remember if he said he had read the books, but I know that he was very passionate about that project. Like, wasn't that a dream role for him? <gasps> Is that a uh, cat's tail? Mm. Silk, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. What's inside. Have a great rest of your week. And Capster, and have a good night as well. Mm. Skywalker. Yeah, but tomorrow Johnny? is another Let's Play episode. Don't be afraid. Oh, three. Thank you so much for the prime reset for four months in a row and welcome You're back a in. Bucca? A Luton? Ah, a godling. Not many of you left. A godling? I'm looking for a woman with ashen hair. Seen her? Schmeagol. Tell me everything from the start. I ductile, Where did you see her? Leader. What was she doing? It's important to me. Mm. Why not? Oh, he can talk. Uh, now we have to see Cavill purge the heretics and yeah, he's leaving after this one, right? This is his last one. He had his agent call them every day for months to see if they even started the casting progress. That's awesome, though. Think about I mean, that was like his dream role. That's incredible. Ducktail, seriously, have a good night. Thank you for hanging around. Luki, I ordered the first book a few days ago, actually, because your streams. Wait, yes. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna do, <laughs> we do a caster reading of the first book. I'm doing an audiobook of it. Um, <laughs> Benji, no, I'm not streaming tomorrow. I'm going back to my normal streaming schedule, which is Mondays, Wednesdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Yeah, yeah. I literally giggled when Henry Cavill first spoke in the TV series. I need to go back and just watch the first one. Yeah, it's a godling. I don't recall we've heard about them. Thanks, London. This is where you live? Thank you. Oh, he's Cozy going to Borough. Warhammer. Good location. Must know about everything that happens in the bog. The bog. Doesn't bother you having monsters for neighbors? <laughs> you know the kids from the Clarion Well? 
You know the kids from the clearing well? I don't know, is it tomorrow? Don't be afraid, not gonna hurt anyone. You can't talk. What's wrong? Can't talk? Why? Lost your voice? Do you think if Can he... Can I help you somehow? If he grew up alone, is that why he probably doesn't speak? Wasn't there... There was that... How... What was that one psychologist kid? Didn't he do that? He, like, isolated her from everybody, and it stunted a lot of her development. Don't speak. I know just what you're thinking. I don't understand. Try to explain. I didn't realize this was late either, to be fair. It feels bad for Henry Cavill. Let go of playing Superman and Geralt, two characters he truly loved. The Superman thing was hard to hear because I thought the assumption was he left um, Geralt for Superman. There were two or more cases like that. It wasn't just the one. Uh, I'm trying to think of the one that comes to mind. Yeah, B Trip, what's up? Welcome back in. Want me to follow you? Want me to follow you? No and choice, I guess. Her. And if your friends don't dance, and if they don't dance, then not, no friends of level nine! Multipass, thank you so much for the reset for 10 months in a row, and welcome back in. Uh, level nine, baby. Yes, Johnny will take me closer. <gasps> okay, so I do want to read about them. To the bestery. Bestery. Bastery? The bakery? To the bakery. Where is it? Rat. Is that Rat Stallion? <laughs> That's a great name. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. And if your friends don't dance, and if they don't dance. Well. Not too long ago, the areas around peasant hamlets were chock full of guardian spirits. Today, it's high, it's nigh, unto impossible to spot a brownie, bucka, or luton. And godlings, they are always the first to go. Such is the price we pay for civilization's forward march. From the preface to The World We Have Lost by Professor Dory. Dorian Gray? I read that as Dorian Gray. Godlings, sometimes mistaken for Luton, are woodland creatures dwelling in burrows and moss-covered hollow stumps on the outskirts of human settlements. They are similar to children in behavior and appearance, and like children, delight in mischief. Godlings are deeply rooted in their home territory and perform acts of care and guardianship to those dwelling near their burrows. They watch over people as well as animals, but shy creatures by nature, they try to do so much while remaining unseen. Godlings are drawn to joy and innocence and so delight in the company of children and usually only show themselves to the young. These hardworking and clever creatures gladly perform small services for those in their care, asking only for respect and payment in the form of food or cast-off tools in return. They are easily offended by churlish, ungrateful, or simply rude behavior, aren't we all? Godlings also treasure their peace and quiet. When the village, uh, when the village, a wait, wait. When the village a godling watches over becomes too populous or its inhabitants forget the old ways, it will abandon its burrow for good and walk off to destinations unknown. Aww, I like the godlings. Hmm, Finn, what's up? Welcome in. The East Coast. I was scrolling and I love the game. Watch out! It is my first playthrough ever. And did I also see an Aurelia? Aurelia, what's up? Welcome back in. Hold on. We need to protect the godlings. Protect them! I know I could put oils on, I'm just not worrying about it. Right, let me consume a swallow. Loot all the bodies, take the monster eyes, take it all. Take it all. Stay close to me. Aw, Johnny boy. I wonder what happened to the rest of his family. Oh, you know what? Actually, let's try that. Hold on. Hold up. Wait. Don't I? I, made, I created it, right? Cat. I get to cat. All right, let's throw it on here. I want to check this out. Well, that's pretty cool. Well, that's pretty cool. Here we go again with the pronunciation. <laughs> all right, we're not talking about it. If I'm going to read all this stuff, it is what it is gonna come out how this it comes place? out let me look around feral child in france oh i haven't heard about that one 
I just remember in psychology, Something I think it was childhood development. I remember hearing about the story. Voice back. We can help him get his voice back. Guess I gotta make this climb. Let me do it for you. <laughs> All right. Julius, what's up? Welcome back in Roach as well. I haven't used a single oil yet. Honestly, I was very opposed to them at first. I'm learning that I kind of need to lean into them. Or like, you don't have to lean into them, but I think they do help greatly. Mm. Ah! Hold on. Let me jump up here first. We gotta do this. Mm. Oh, Finn, I'm glad that you're enjoying it here and welcome. Thank you so much. And Sean, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Finn. Finn, I hope you enjoy the sub in the emotes as well. Thank you so much, Sean. And Dark and Rat. Or I already said Rat, but thank you guys for the follows. All right, we have a nest. A harpy. Ah. Uh huh. Harpies are susceptible to. Hold on, let me go into. I need. To the bakery. Hold on. Relics. Interesting. Falls under um, hybrids, right? Ah, uh, that's right. Ard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. oh my gosh, that's disgusting. Oh, that is so disgusting. Man. That ain't bad. Oh, I'm honestly starting to hear the music in my dreams too. <laughs> the little pop-up body. Harpy talons. Collect them all. Execute. Hmm. Nice little execution here and there. Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Sealed bottle, raven's feather. This bottle. I want to keep those bones for my bone chandelier. Na, 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 na. Uh, we are playing on blood and broken bones. Something, something dark side. Wait, I need to read whatever that last one was. Florida man, what's up? Welcome back in. Hold on real quick. I do want to, before we go. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Uh, I just hit level nine, but I'm doing a lot of Gwenting, so... I have like over 40 hours in the- are we- we're probably at like almost 40 hours. Banana be welcome in by the way. Hold on, I missed that large one. Uh, okay, wait, no, you're talking back to add more. Okay. Blood and broken bones, yeah. I think we will up- I think we'll up it after tonight's stream. I think we'll up it. Take everything and give nothing back. 99 bottles of beer on the wall. Before I need <laughs> No, it's locked. Hold on. Inventory. Oh, 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 oh. You can also equip your crossbow. Look, we don't need to use crossbows here, all right? In other circumstances, I love ranged weapons, but I'm a hack and slash kind of gal through and through. I just like to get up in their face and do a death by a thousand cuts. I don't need any bolts. <laughs> Crispy and uh, is it chaotic? 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 Guys, welcome in. And Z Star. Here. Z Star, thank you so much for the resub for five months in a row and welcome back in. Johnny. Whiskey, Slither, Ringworm, Rubbish, Bumblebee, Flabbergasted. Flabbergasted. Ah, the sound of it. Peter Piper picked Prince Proxima a pack of pickled peppers by the Pontar. <laughs> Done celebrating. My oh. favorite word. Life without savoring the sound of surreptitious shenanigans is like licking snails. I wonder what drop. happened to his Thank voice to begin with. Noble whoever you are. You make Long a good point, Brimble. Hang on a minute. I helped Hold you, on. now you help me. Would you turn this beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors? Uh, yes. I don't know what any of them, but yes, I would. Banana Bee, thanks for the follow. I'm glad to see you're enjoying it. How do you bottle someone's voice? How do you Ask lock Ariel. someone's voice in a bottle? Just wondering. As am I, especially as mine's a voice to crown all voices. Sometimes it's like a forest brook, at others like a roll of thunder. 
And let's be honest, I don't know what happened. Happened. three barrels or more. Somebody used some powerful magic on you as a prank or just to be mean. Mm, I do. You know what? I do feel like I was it's either hit or miss angel, you know, Vincent, what's up? Welcome back in. I appreciate that you paused the game to try it. Oh, thank you. So no, I of course, of course. I know I talk about it a lot. Like my Twitch content is very different than my YouTube content, which is why I started doing YouTube. Um, but no, Twitch is this is just there's a reason I've been doing it for forever. And it's because I get to interact with y'all like it's truly incredible. So, of course, I take the time. Someone pulled a prank on him. That's all. Uh, I think he's going to. It had to have been a creature, right? The lot godlings get bullied. Well, he's alone, too. Y'all, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Um, I actually tried really hard in that. I do like shooter games, though. I'm not the worst. I'm not the worst. I'm not the best, but I felt like The Last of Us was just I was focused on that. How Why do you did lose you your voice? Work? One morning I awoke and opened my mouth for my usual bout of singing with the thrushes. Lo and behold, no sound escaped. I tried and tried, almost burst a blood vessel. I've done that then before. Then I went to the village, because word has it, the new cunning woman works miracles. But people new began crying woman. out, a smudger, a smudger, and sick their dogs on me. Do I look like a smudger to you? No. Not a bit. I thought not. So it must be the crones doing. Who else would curse me? Blackbird friend of mine located my voice. Yes, it is gym time. To retrieve it. Couldn't ask a raven friend to just give you the bottle? The godlings get bored. Ravens serve the crones. They don't help no one. Hmm. I'm looking right, for ask. a young ashen haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. Oh, okay. My favorite part of the day. To the After coffee, of course. Right glorious. Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared. Out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired. Just like you said. Mm -hmm. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's huts. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my morn. <laughs> Sadly, I'd lost my voice. So I don't think she heard me. He's so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was watching the last of us play recently and some of the shots at the start were very questionable. I said that it's either 100% a hit or miss. It's like either a perfect dead center headshot or it is absolutely six feet to the side, okay? It's putting more distance than people during COVID. A woman from village in the swamp, who is she? No, I actually do want to know more about the woman in the village. Yes, I highly recommend it. 100% play it. Like, get past the beginning. Yeah, we did Ginger at the beginning. I've been to the village in the swamp. She took treats a woman who might have been a crone. Did she seem confused to you? Don't Nuts disturb my morn tomorrow. <laughs> so I'm not crazy. That's no crone. That's the granny who takes care of the orphans. Yes. Claims the kids made me up. Me. An she doubts it. In the swamp? What do you have against swamps? John, have a good one. Whole life, and I heartily recommend it. Thank you so much for hanging around. Kingfish, welcome in too. It is so perfect. Enjoying me, <laughs> emptying me bowels. Okay, so we know about the crones. She ran off toward the orphanage. Kids Not a witch, I'm your wife. <laughs> or the old woman who takes care of them. Oh, that old hag don't speak to strangers, and you're a stranger. Will she talk to you? I have spoken mm. to her. Got my ways. So be it. You helped me and I'm no bore. Come with me. Come with you. Character entry updated. Okay, that's why I keep saying update on those two. Okay, so we're gonna need to start next stream with reading some more entries as well. But where is he leading us? Oh, to the hut that we were at. Oh no, further into the woods. Into the woods. To grandmother's house. Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Zabra, have a good night as well. And Pilot Echo, welcome back in. Ooh, this is not Careful, the old crone that out. I'm looking for. I think he's gonna hide until. Uh, all right, I think we have to defeat them. Well, I would be at the gym right now, but I decided to start a quest. You know how that goes. Damn it. Yes, Johnny is definitely the, definitely the goat. I can see how you can get the fatigue from this game. Like, there is so much to do. 
All right, here we go. It's spectacular. I like the quest, and that's why I, I also don't want to rush it, so... I'm gonna get rid of these water mags and stuff. And then we will... Okay. Come back out, Johnny. Everyone be a Johnny and get yourselves a Johnny. Hey, Johnny. Round her tongue. Lead the way. Oh, wait, let's go over to the shrine. She's not playing Gwent. You know what the sad part is? I really wanted to end today's stream with Gwent, but I, it's just not gonna happen. Lord Trapula, what's up? Welcome back in. An unknown, thank you so much for the gift of soda, Vincent. Vincent, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. I'm trying to follow Johnny, but I guess I have to stay right on right on him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's no Gwent in these swamps. But Johnny will still be here when I go. Well, I don't. Johnny will still be here. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying a quick little Gwent round never killed nobody. But truth be told, I actually do not. I don't think that I... I don't think I even know of somebody I haven't beat in Gwent. Like, I don't even think I could. I've nearly fought everybody I've met. There's only been three Gwent games. <laughs> I'm gonna wear my gym clothes so I can be more efficient after stream. <laughs> so, hey, I can still leave and go, okay? That's the amazing part about 24 hour gyms. Okay, all right. Just depends if I'm stopping by Taco Bell after. Hi, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Mmm. Mmm. See, I don't think there's anywhere I haven't played Gwent with, unless. Hold up. Hold up. I might fail the quest if you fast travel. No, it's just like putting time out on the test real quick. I can still do it. Hold up. To the world map. I don't have a problem. To the storage. This way. Run away. I think it automatically saves every three minutes. I feel like I should be fine. I did Johnny a little dirty. He was so loyal to me. Uh, am I staying on the outside? There are a ton of more merchants in Novigrad. That is true. We need to get across here. I think there's going to be more over here. I also haven't found a lot of merchants to sell. Like, to sell to me, you know? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, never mind. You need to advance the quest in order to play more Gwent and feed your addiction. No. Don't tell me that. Oh. Meow. Easy. <laughs> Meow. Johnny can enjoy his poop time while we play Gwent. Wait, why is that marker showing red? Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Do you see what I see? Should be up here. Should be up here. Oh, it must be down below. When the Gwent itches. <laughs> I need to play. There's definitely supposed to be a merchant right here. Let me just take a nap real quick. Okay. Take a quick nap. Maggie's mad because Johnny is the best Gwent player in the small. If Johnny played me in Gwent, I would have stayed with him. But he didn't offer Gwent. I... I'm a simple girl. I travel where the Gwent is, okay? These are simple times. What was merchant. It to fall to not, this is ah! not the merchant that I'm looking for. Uh, how about the, um, how about the blacksmith? Did I, oh, I did beat that one girl, didn't I? Poor townsfolk. It's gotta be in here. I just can't get inside of any of these buildings and they're all locked. It's like it doesn't want to allow me access to these. Maybe that's what it is. Oh, if, okay. It reminds me of Yu-Gi-Oh. All right, we continue down south or I guess west at this point. At some point I will run into somebody who will be willing to play me in Gwent. 
If the boat takes me there. Um. Oi, you, Oi. <laughs> oh, you took a bad time to stroll through this burrow. Should we talk to this? See, Novigrad docks. There's got to be somebody to play here. Hmm. I can't go to the gym until I beat Gwent. Well, he says I talk too much. Mitz to yourself. Sorry. Mitz to yourself. You just don't look well. Hmm. After this rep, fancy a Gwent? I think maybe I have played everybody I could. Nitz, do you actually know somebody that I have yet to play? I've had enough of living. A hundred Gwent games later. Please, somebody play me. I will pay you 20 coins to play me in Gwent. <sighs> I don't think it's possible. I think it's not possible. I think I have done everything up to this point. So are the gains. Quests are important, so are the gains. I think it's telling me to go back to the bog. I know. It's saying get back to the bog. Are you sure the kids wouldn't play me in Gwent in the middle of Novigrad? I think I've already done that one. Have I not? You're talking about right here? I've played all three of these. Only a thousand question marks, too. <laughs> uh, I don't want to pay for a prostitute. I want to pay somebody to play me in Gwen. I don't want... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I need to go to the... All right, so let's go back here. I already played the blacksmith. I already played the blacksmith. <laughs> I have a problem. I think at this point I have to wait. I think I do have to wait. Hmm. I don't think I played a bookstore guy. I don't remember that. Y'all, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Um. Bookstore guy. It's the brothel Gwent time. I already played her. Yeah, I already played her. No, I crushed all of those. Maybe up here? Like, maybe somewhere in here? But maybe... Um, it's currently 3 a.m., so I pushed it too far. All right, Zar, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. I just don't think I can end today on Gwen. I don't think it's possible. Hmm. I need to continue onwards. <laughs> I have to go back to my it's mission. Okay. There may or may not be a console command that allows you to play random Gwent. Where? 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 Where is it? Somebody play me. <laughs> Somebody play me in Gwent. Here we go. Who said that they're getting banned? <laughs> uh, say no to Gwen in school. <laughs> ah, okay. No, Johnny's waiting for us. And unfortunately, so is the squat rack. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, please return your trays to the upright position. Return your chair. <laughs> as well and we are getting ready to jet i got a jet um no today yeah uh that wasn't bad progress right that was not bad progress dark raven dark raven thank you so much for the 100 bits it's been a roller coaster of emotions and i appreciate everything you do thank you so much seriously I remember, I distinctly, for some reason, I feel like I remember most when we were playing through RE4 and your message meant the absolute world to me. So I'm so glad that this has been a positive light to your last year. And just thank you for including me and giving me your time. Um, oh, we're gonna do this. Okay, so I'm trying to do more rating of Witcher, but 
when I see Elden Ring, I see Elden Ring. So guys, we've not raided him in a long time. So I've been friends with Cole for a very long time. Let's go give Cole Brew a raid. Um, he's doing Elden Ring. I don't think it's his first time playing Elden Ring. I'm pretty sure he's played it before. <laughs> Dark Raven, thank you so much. And guys, thank you for another incredible stream. And all the new subs, there's been... I thought you were supposed to not be here. I thought you said you weren't going to be here. <laughs> Y'all, seriously, thank you so much for all of the support, all of the resubs, new subs, continual subs, gifted subs, and just everything. And most importantly, for your time and spending it here this Wednesday afternoon. I hope you guys enjoyed the Gwent games. I think we got a decent amount done. And so, yes, so let's go give Cole some, some cast of love. Like I said, he's playing Elden Ring. I couldn't tell you if it's his first time playing. But yes, I'm going to run. I'm going to jet. I got to go work out. I've got to get these noodle arms up and up and going. I can't look like those things flying outside of the... the what are those things called? You know, like the, <laughs> the little balloon guys just sitting outside of the, the car dealerships? The noodle arms? Is that what they are? <laughs> Y'all, I will see you on Saturday for more. Tomorrow is going to be another upload on YouTube. And other than that, thank you guys. And I will see y'all on Saturday. Wolf Shadow, the wacky inflatable R men. Yes, yes. Kareem, good night, Pie, Lakers, all of my mods. Thank you so much for everything. I love you guys so much. DC, good night. Admore, good night. Alphabet, good night. Kitchen, good night. Buried. Bye.